hands to the Lord. As you shout this prayer louder than anyone around you. Three prayers to pray with your hand lifted up. Pray with fire and pray with power. Powers! Crying in the night against my glory. There is somebody here who needs to shout this loud. Before I leave this place, death in the name of Jesus. Powers crying in the night against my glory.
Jesus name we pray immediately the process of the next prayer starts violent angels will be sent in motion so it's important that you concentrate and pray to well any chain in my body break in the name of Jesus break the chain yes Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Still raise your two hands up. Powers! Swallowing good things in my life. Your time is up. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Something is happening. In Jesus' name we pray. A louder amen. Have your seat and take your Bibles. We need to begin to openly demonstrate the supernatural power of God. Openly. The Bible says we fight a supernatural war. It says, for we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. So we are fighting supernatural forces. Supernatural forces. When you are playing with somebody and a voice is speaking from that person's throat, it is supernatural. When Mountain Top University started, there's this practice of praying for the students. Run the students through deliverance. The chaplain called me in a shock. So they were praying for the students. And one lady there who had never visited a place of birth. A voice spoke from her. The voice of an old woman. Said, so, so, you were able to find your way here. Has anybody in your family ever found their way into the university? And you are here. So, let us see how you are going to pass. Let's see. We are going to finish this course. That was a supernatural voice. So we are fighting supernatural warfare. I'm praying for somebody here. Any power that you say we shall see, I will succeed. We shall see, I will make it. We take time for the amen. We bury them tonight in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. That is why you are called Jehovah. That is why you are called Jehovah. What you say you will do. That is what you will do. That is why you are. Sing it again loud and cry if we 
you believe what you have said? Oh, that is why you are called Jehovah. That is why you are called Jehovah. What to say you will do? That is what you will do. Destroying, Hallelujah. Should pray this divine intervention prayers. Prayer to connect to the supernatural power of God. Don't joke with these prayers at all. Convert it to machine gun prayers. Can I hear you shouting this loud and clear? Where is the Lord God of Elijah? Is that the loudest you can shout it? Jesus. and only boldness any power in existence expanding my battles can I hear you saying that your voice is not loud enough what are you waiting for in the name of Jesus Somebody is breaking through in Jesus. 
Jesus name we pray say I plug my life into the supernatural power of God by the power in the blood of Jesus can you shout out I plug my life into the supernatural power of God by the power in the blood of Jesus can you shout it again shout it again I plug my life say it again thank you Jesus That has no mercy on the enemy. And the prayers today shall show no mercy to every enemy of our souls. I know there is somebody here this morning that your enemies shall cry. To that person, shout it loud, hallelujah. I know there is somebody here this morning too who shall have the last laugh over all the enemies. If you are that person, shout it loud, hallelujah. Psalm 7. Look at what it says in verse 16. Psalm 7, verse 16. Are we there? It says this. His mischief shall return upon his own head. I, it was, it's not Dr. Luca that wrote that one. It's inside the Bible. His mischief shall return upon his own head. And his violent dealing shall come down upon his own part. That's what the Bible says. Look at verse 15. He made a pit and digged it and is falling into the ditch which he made. Open straight to Psalm 35 verse 8. Psalm 35 verse 8. He says, let destruction come upon him at unawares. And let his net that he had eat catch himself. Into that very destruction let him fall. All this is talking about sending back evil arrows. Go straight back to the book of Nehemiah. You find your Nehemiah after Esther and after Job. Nehemiah chapter 4, verse 4. So let's show you this once in scripture. So you won't say what kind of doctrine are they preaching here today? Nehemiah 4 4. Hear our God, for we are despised, and turn their reproach upon their own head, and give them for a prayer. In the land of captivity. In the same Nehemiah chapter 13, verse 2. Nehemiah 13, 2. Look at something else God can do. Because they met not the children of Israel with bread and with water, but hired Balaam against them, that he should curse them. I will be our God turned the curse into a blessing. I pray that every curse issued against your life shall be converted to blessings. It shall be converted, it shall be converted, it shall be converted to blessings. In the name of Jesus. 
Now go right back to the book of Esther. Esther chapter 7 verse 10. Esther 7 10. Note these scriptures very well. Esther 7 10. So they hanged Haman on the gallows that he had prepared for Mordecai. What? The, is, the instrument that he prepared against Mordecai backfired. This is what has happened here in scripture. Something happened in South Africa. It's an example of what we're talking about this morning. It was in the news. An armed robber was mistakenly killed by his own gang member. They went to steal somewhere and his own colleagues shot him down. That's what they call sending back evil arrows. And I think it was about a month ago or so, somebody was giving a testimony at the headquarters. He said he came for one of our services. And the Lord said, there's somebody here, the enemy wants to kill you, but that arrow has backfired. So he said that day they were going and some armed robbers accosted them. And he tried to shoot at this person. And the gun refused to walk. I said, well, ah, but I've just used this gun. Why is it not working now? He aimed the gun at this person and was trying to shoot him, but the gun refused to cooperate. But while he was fiddling around with the gun, the gun went off and blew off his own hand, giving that person an opportunity to run away. I pray that the bullets of your enemies shall destroy them. <laughs> if I were in your shoes, my amen would be loud and clear. I also pray that every evil plan against your progress shall return to the sender. You know, God told King Jehoshaphat, so don't worry, say these enemies that are coming against you, by the same way in which they came, by that same way they shall go back. And by the time they were going back, they went back in scattered pieces. The Bible says the last days will be characterized by intensive satanic revival. Revelation church 12 tells us that war unto the earth and unto the sea. For the devil has come against you in great wrath. Knowing that he has but a short time. The Bible makes us to understand that the wicked will fire arrows at the righteous. Mm. That one is very clear from scripture. And you'll be very naive and very foolish to believe that you no know, one is interested in attacking your life. It will be very naive and stupid for you to say, I don't have enemies. God himself has enemies. In Psalm 11 verse 2, Psalm 11 verse 2 tells us, for lo, the wicked bend their bow. They make ready their arrow upon the string that they may privily shoot at the upright in heart. The Bible tells us that arrows shall be fired at the righteous. I knew a girl who went to the examination hall. She had studied, she had read, she had prepared. And everything was okay. They gave them the question papers. She looked at the question paper. She found that it's an exam she could pass very well. But as she took a pen and wanted to start writing, any time she touched that pen, there would be violent vibration in her hands. And she could not write anything until the examination was over. An arrow was fired into her hand. The Bible also tells us about the arrows that fly by noonday. The Bible makes us to understand that we are not to live in this world as someone does not understand the world where he or she is. When wicked arrows are fired against a person, three things may happen. The arrows may enter into the person's life. And that's what happens in most cases. Arrows may bounce off. The third thing is that the arrow may miss the person and eat another person. When arrows are fired like this, what God does for his people is what you sometimes what what sometimes happens is what you find in Proverbs eleven eight. This is what God sometimes does for His people when arrows are fired like this. In Proverbs eleven eight, the Bible says the righteous is delivered out of trouble, and the wicked commit in his stead. When evil is dispatched like this, the Lord removes the righteous, replaces the righteous with another person. Just like the Bible says that God can give life for your life. It's important for you to know how to send back evil arrows back to the sender. Many weapons and arrows of darkness are being used today. 
And the attack of the enemy against us may be so terrible that they don't want to mind how many casualties are suffered. These are not days to be ice cream Christians. There are many weapons and arrows of the enemy operating in so many lives these days. You find people being choked on their beds. People hear voices from the spirit world. Insanity is on the rise now. And most of them claim to be hearing voices. A sudden depression comes upon a very happy person. All of a sudden the person becomes sad. Some suffer from needless fear. Some just have a, some paralytic wind blow upon them. And then before you say Jesus is Lord, there is trouble. Some complain of cold chill at night in a hot room. There are some, they just feel that their heads are becoming heavier and heavier and heavier. And the head, there is no extra weight on that head. Some have taken food and they found strange items in the food. Some have found insects, all kinds of things in the food and they didn't know it got there. There have been cases of people who slept and when they woke up, something has been cut off from their body. It's so terrible now that they even send physical idols to people. People actually, they are in their room and this physical object moves in. They do all kinds of things to people. People stay in locked rooms with windows are not open. All of a sudden, you find bats and birds inside the room. They send physical and spiritual snakes to people. Some complain about heat in the head or as if wind is blowing through the head. It's the arrow of darkness. Some complain of people calling their name at night from the sleep. Many dream and what they would normally ordinarily don't eat. They will force feed them with those things in their dreams. You find sisters complaining of being molested sexually in the dream by a female with male reproductive organs. They send emergency force messages to people and they send this feeling of lifelessness onto people. We are here this morning to do a particular operation to return all these arrows, conscious, unconscious arrows, back to wherever they came from. Many here today have been attacked at one time or the other by these evil weapons. If you were attacked when you were a baby and you didn't do anything about it, the, those arrows are probably still in you now. If you were attacked before you got born again and you are not aware there is an arrow, the arrow is probably still in you there. If you were attacked when you were ignorant and you didn't know what to do, the arrow is probably still in you now. But something I know will happen today is this. As many arrows that have been planted into the life of the righteous shall go back to the senders in the name of Jesus. With years and years of experience in prayer, evangelism, deliverance, and ministrations, we have been able to identify different kinds of arrows that we have come across. I will tell you the major ones that are prepared and fired into people's lives. I want you to understand something. When someone is so wicked and disobedient as to fling witchcraft curses witchcraft arrows on people they must be stopped we can't just wait and let them do whatever they want to do they have to be stopped i remember something that happened many years back we were at a crusade somewhere at evans square in yaba and as the crusade was going all of a sudden thunder struck the microphone became practically ashes. And the whole of the crusade went into darkness. Or the man of God there knew what to do. He shouted in his voice, everybody stand up. And they stood up. And he said, what has happened now is an arrow of darkness. He said, all of you will now raise up your voices. And say, evil arrows, go back to your sender. They prayed like mad prophets at that crusade. The light came back on. They now started using megaphones few minutes to that time a man was rushed into the crusade I have never seen that kind of thing before and I don't want to see it again this man, it was as if somebody came to him and used knife to cut off the whole of his skin and put his skin on the floor they brought him on a wheelbarrow he was the head of the native doctors in that area he was the one that sent the arrow so when the believers now said back to the senders the arrow that he sent, he had no power to contain it. When you command bad prayers, evil arrows that are against you to return to their chest, they are in trouble. When you return the arrows back to the senders, you were not the one that initiated it. But you are merely sending it back to the originator. 
Satanic agents are normally afraid when their arrows are sent back to them. But then is the principle of scripture. A man died in the place of Mordecai. Those who arranged for Daniel to be put in lions then were the ones who were eaten by the lions. Those who threw Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego into the fire were the ones who were destroyed by the fire. The giant sword that Goliath brought to kill David was the same sword they used to cut off his head. I pray that this morning before you leave this place, your Goliath shall destroy itself. In the name of Jesus. The enemy sends arrows to people. There is arrow of disfavor. There is arrow of satanic anger. Just like it happened to Moses when he was about to enter the promised land. There is arrow of failure. There is arrow of unexplainable health problems. There is arrow of academic and career frustration. There is arrow of almost dear or near success syndrome. There is arrow of joblessness. There is arrow of untimely death. There is arrow of vagabond life. There is arrow of insanity. There is arrow of poverty. There is arrow of building and not living inside. There is arrow of marital distress. There is arrow of suicidal tendencies. There is arrow of addictions. There is arrow of unexplainable gynecological problems. There is chain problems, arrow of chain problems. There is arrow of confusion. There is arrow of being disgraced out of breakthrough. There is arrow of infirmities. There is arrow of demotion. The arrow of hardship. There is arrow of dream oppression. There is arrow of strange accidents. There is an arrow of mark of hatred. Who just ate you without any cause. There is arrow of constant spiritual attack. There is arrow of torment. No wonder the Bible talks about the fiery darts of the enemy. There is arrow of paralysis. There is arrow of attack on one's children. There is arrow of business failure. There is arrow of tragedy. There is arrow of spiritual blindness. There is arrow of sin but not attaining. There is arrow of strange woman. The arrow of strange woman can be fired into the life of a man. There is arrow of bad houses. There is arrow of stagnancy. There is arrow of devourers. There is arrow of satanic delay. There is arrow of buried talents and virtues. There is arrow of disappearance of helpers. There is arrow of having to fight hard and fight hard before you get anything done. There is arrow of just always in the wrong position, wrong position. There is arrow of depth. There is arrow of prayer paralysis. There is arrow of evil diversion. There is arrow of bewitchment. There is arrow of gradual dispossession. There is arrow of profit starvation. There is arrow of unexplainable loss of very good things. There is the arrow of homelessness. The arrow of leaking pocket. There is arrow of success manipulation. There is arrow of drug dependence. There is arrow of shame. There is arrow of fruitless efforts. So the enemy has prepared his arrows and is firing it at the righteous. What do you do to send back these arrows? The first thing to do is to plead the blood of Jesus. You plead the blood of Jesus. And you have to try and learn the blood scriptures. All the scriptures that have to do with the blood of Jesus. The second thing you should do is to learn warfare prayers. And that will involve you to learning warfare scriptures. The third thing you should do is to learn to send the arrows back to the senders. When there is an arrow in place and it's not out yet, God in his mercy, who does not want his people to be destroyed, comes to them, sometimes in their dreams, and be showing them things to indicate that there is something you should address. So all the dreams of properties being carried away by flood is indication of an arrow. All the dreams of walking in slippery ground is, is an indication of arrows. All the dreams of the cap or the heart being blown away is an indication that there is an arrow in, in, in place. All the dream of things being stolen away from you is an indication that there is an arrow. All the dreams of your name missing from important list shows that there is an arrow in place. Dreams of counting pennies and counting coins when you should be counting paper notes is an indication that there is an arrow. All the dreams of giving out money to people you don't know is an indication that there is an arrow. 
All those injection dreams, it's an indication that it's an arrow. All the dreams of picking eggs and picking rotting things, is an indication that it's an arrow. When God begins to show you this kind of troublous dreams, He's telling you there is something in place you need to address, you have not addressed. And once some dreams begin to repeat and repeat and repeat themselves, what God is telling you that is that there is still a trouble you have not solved. We have work to do here this morning to force the arrows of darkness to go back to where they came from. I was a crusade we had many years ago and we were on the altar like this. Men of God were on the altar. It was an open air crusade. And as the message was going on, right down, down below, some men gathered. I could see them. They gathered in a circle. We're doing something inside that circle. Whatever they were doing, when they finished, something just rose up from their middle and began to trans- travel far, fast to the pulpit. And I saw it coming. I saw it coming. When it was about to get to the pulpit, it distributed itself to as many men of God as were there. But as it was about to reach the altar, the thing made a roundabout turn. I started going back. I was still watching. I was watching. The men had not dispersed. The thing struck them where they were. Many fell down, couldn't move. Some ran away. I pray, beloved, that every power assigned to destroy you shall destroy itself in the name of Jesus. I remember that brother who used to preach every morning in a particular location. He didn't know that he was annoying some powers. So one day, all the witch doctors, the native doctors gathered together in that area. And the agenda was to destroy this brother. They wanted to kill him. So they gathered. So this man who is disturbing us every morning must be destroyed. So they prepared their juju, their magic. It was like a drum. The face of a drum. The idea is that they will call the brother. His face will appear on the surface of the drum. And then they will stick a knife through that drum. And the brother will bleed to death. They brought the best expert to come and do it. I pray that any satanic expert assigned against you shall be destroyed in the name of Jesus. They brought the experts. So he started his incantations. He was supposed to call the brother's name three times. He called him the first time. No face appeared. He called him a second time. No face appeared. He called the third time. The brother's face appeared. And they brought out their knife. As, as it remained just a split second for that knife to touch the drum, the face changed to the face of the man with the knife. And it happened so quickly, he could not stop. He put a knife through his own face and he fell down on the floor. I pray at any power observing your face in a mirror in order to destroy you, they shall be put to shame in the name of Jesus. Rise up on your feet now, beloved. The time has now come when we should send back these arrows back to the sender. It will be a tragedy if you go home from this meeting with any arrow in your life. Because the anointing to send those things back to the senders is already all over this place. All eyes closed. But you see, if you are here this morning and you are not born again, you have not just surrendered your life to Jesus, you cannot send back any evil arrow. So wherever you are, while all eyes are closed, you say, Pastor, I want to surrender my life to Jesus. Just leave that seat very quickly and run to the frontier. Very quickly, very quickly. Don't waste time. Jesus is waiting for you here.
Those of you at the front, I congratulate you. Taking the most important decision in life. Close your eyes. Bow down your heads. And say what I'm going to say after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. As from today, I say bye-bye to the devil. I enter into the kingdom of light. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. I'm going to pray with you now. Father, I thank you for these your children here who have taken this very, very important decision. I pray that it shall be well with you. And the Lord will keep you standing by his power. He will do great and marvelous things for you. Today that you have surrendered your life to Jesus, every arrow of darkness shall be disgraced. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Right there where you are, our counselors will discuss with you. The rest of us, let's sit down and quietly confess our sins to the Lord. Any sin that will hinder you from receiving mighty deliverance today, ask the Lord to forgive you. Tell him you don't want to go home the same. Tell him you want his power upon your life. Do so now. Don't guide it, 
Nothing can our peace destroy. 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 Nothing can. Peace destroy. Africa Let's rise up on our feet now. As we begin to pray these prayers, many kinds of things will begin to happen all at the same time. I want you to pray with concentration, with boiling anger. Maybe you've been attacked. Your family has been attacked. Your children has been attacked. Your career has been attacked. Your spiritual life has been attacked. You have a wonderful opportunity to send these arrows back to wherever they came from. As we begin to pray this first prayer, I want you to pray now. There are people here that familiar spirits have fired arrows into their life to make sure that they die this year. These people are between the ages of 40 and 43. As we start prayer now, the arrows will go back to the senders. As you pray this prayer through, if you are that person that the enemy fired an arrow into your leg, and the leg is swelling like balloon, all of a sudden you feel the touch of the power of God upon that leg, and it will return to the normal size. As many people as are here that have the arrows of paralysis and stroke fired against them, the arrows of chronic arthritis, the arrows of internal rottenness, the arrows of cancer. All these arrows shall vanish immediately. For they shall go back to the senders. Now you will shout this louder than anyone here. You shout it loud and clear. Don't allow anybody's voice to overshadow your own. As you decree this with a commanding tone. Arrows of darkness! Assigned against me. Hear the word of the Lord. Gather together. That's the first command. Let's gather all the arrows. Sisters, are you here this morning? Sisters, pray. Arrows of darkness. Assigned against me. Hear the word of the Lord. Gather. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to gather them. Gather them together. Masika poya bo shendera bo kotora ba santa. Open your mouth and declare it. Masopola kaya bo shendera boka. In Jesus' name we pray. <laughs> All right. We have to do it one more time. There are people here. There are things the enemy have planted in your body now. The Bible calls them strangers. You notice they move about in the body. You notice they come to choke your heart. It's because of those kind of people who want to pray this prayer again. Of darkness assigned against me, hear the word of the Lord. Gather in the name of Jesus, open your mouth and declare it. Gather them together. Something is happening already. They are Silence. Silence, beloved. 
Many things are happening here. Yes. And some seven persons who are receiving some really special deliverance where they are. That's tried. Let the legs be released. Let the ties be released. Let the womb be released. Let the stomach be released. Let the heart be released. Let the liver be released. Let the kidney be released. Let the eyes be released. Let the head be released. Let the backbone be released. In the name of Jesus. Aha. Aha. You will now pray the second prayer like this. In this very aggressive song. Now that you've gathered the arrows together. It's now for them to get the second instruction. And the instruction is in this song. Which I want you to sing like fire and like thunder. Not allow anybody's voice to overshadow your voice. Sing it like a warrior. Sing it from your heart. Sing it with faith. Believing that as you are saying it. That is happening like that. Are you ready? Evil arrows go back to your Evil arrows Evil arrows Evil arrows Evil arrows In Jesus name Evil arrows Oh yes Evil arrows Evil arrows In Jesus name Go back to your sender Go back to your sender Go back to your sanders. Go back to your sanders. Evil arrows. Go back to your Evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. In Jesus name. Go back to your Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Maso kapo ya bo shende rabo kota rabo sanda. Ribo soponde ke ya bo shente raba. Nakatonda ka ya bo shente raba. Aha, aha. Amen. If you came here with any infirmity, this is the time to lay your hands on that place as we pray the first arrows back to the senders. Father, as we raise up our voices now, let your healing power begin to take place. Let every arrow of infirmity go back to the senders. Let there be no infirmity that will remain in place. In the name of Jesus, shout this after me with boiling anger. Arrows of infirmity backfire in the name of Jesus. Let them backfire now in the name of Jesus. Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Receive the touch of the healing power. Of God, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name, we pray. Check your body now. Do what you cannot do before. Check your body now. The powers that have been ringing. Evil bells in one ear has now been silenced. This terrible medical report has now been silenced. The terrible skin disease has been wiped away. The swellings in the body have been melted away by the power of God. The heaviness in the head, the heaviness by the neck has been melted away by the power of God. Check your body very well. Things are happening all over the place. Aha. This is the, the first arrow is the arrow of infirmity and is going back to the senders. That's right. The one on that child, too. The arrows in the life of that child is going right back to the senders. 
Just check the chart. Check the chart. The arrow is going back to the senders. The arrows of unexplainable flow of blood has gone back to the senders. The arrows of not being able to bend has been sent back to the senders. Look at what is happening over there. Look at what is happening over there. I see a woman at the back of that place. You had a dream that you were thrown into the well. The power of God is bringing you out of the well that the enemy has thrown you inside. Thank you, Jesus. If you check your body now and you find that you have been healed, quietly find a way to the altar here so that we can pray with you. The enemy will not bring back the problem. Quietly find a way to the altar here. We are praying against the second arrow. Can you shout this louder than anyone here? Arrows of untimely death. Is that the loudest you can shout it? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Arrows of untimely death. Backfire, 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 backfire. In the name of Jesus. Aha, 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 aha. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Everybody will shout this third one loud and clear. Arrows of poverty. Backfire in the name of Jesus. Masika poya bo shendera bo kotenda raba. Bakatora bo sopola kayaba. There must be a backfiring effect. Enough is enough. Receive your deliverance. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. God is touching the eyes of somebody and also the legs of somebody that they say had a, tr- had a problem. Problem is being melted away from that leg. Someone here, the enemy has been stealing from you since you were born. In fact, you came to this program from somewhere else. The enemy has been stealing from you. That arrow of loss has gone back to the senders. Shout this louder than anyone at this meeting. Arrows of witchcraft. Backfire. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Aha. 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 Oh, Jesus. Begin to move. In your power. Move. Move in your power. Move in your power. Move in your power. Jesus. Jesus. Something is happening over there. That's right. In Jesus' name we pray. Silence once again. Just look at what is happening. As many people as are here this morning, and as an arrow of witchcraft in the body, the power of God is coming upon you where you are, and that yoke is broken completely. That's the first person. Number two, number three, number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight, number nine, number ten, number eleven, number twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yes, it's happening all over the place. Aha. Amen. This prayer. Don't say I don't think it concerns me. Pray it anyway. Arrows. 
of failure. My life is not your candidate. Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Amongst the people. By the power of the Holy Ghost. By the power of the Holy Ghost. By the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. This is very interesting. Look at what is happening here this morning. The next arrow that should go back to the senders. Don't joke with that one too. Hmm. Arrows of failure at the edge of success. Can you shout it louder than anyone here? Fire in the name of Jesus. I refuse to fail at the age of success. Jesus. Mosepekete poya poka. Maria no kosaponde kaya bo shente yaba. Mana rebosa. Marna rebosapia. Mana reboka podaka. Mana reba sapia la katanda. Go satende kaya bo shenta. Yes. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Jesus is here. In Jesus name we pray. Thank you Jesus. And what is receiving a new organ in the body, an organ that the enemy has destroyed. A new one is coming into place. Somebody here, the Lord is ushering you into great wealth. Because the the owners of evil load have carried their load now. Oh yes. Oh yes. Aha. 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 Uh-huh. Yes, you the arrows of lump in the breast come out now and go back to your senders in the name of Jesus. You shall not die but live to declare the works of God. Now, sister, check yourself. When the problem has vanished, let's find a way to the altar here. Thank you, Jesus. This next arrow, we want to send him back three hot times. Let nobody sit down now, not at this time. Arrows of household wickedness. Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Oh yes. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Yes, 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 yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and pray it again. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and pray it again. Yes, the most backfire. In Jesus' name we pray. Aha. So many things are happening. Now, say this. Evil loads assigned against my life. Hear the word of the Lord. God, 
In the name of Jesus. Command evil lords to gather. They must go back to the senders today. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Aha, uh-huh. now that the lords are here. Say, owners of the evil lord. Carry your Lord by fire. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. They must carry their loads. In Jesus name we pray thank you Jesus now if you have ever been attacked in your dream whether it's happening now it has happened before this is the time to send back those arrows arrows of dream attacks cock fire in the name of Jesus yes Something is happening, something is up. I lose some dream attacks by fire, by fire, by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Now pick a song of praises where you are and begin to sing it loud and clear. To the King of Kings and to the Lord of Lords. What a mighty God we serve. Glorious in holiness, fearful in praises, doing wonders. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Father, I thank you for this, your children at the front here. And I thank you for all the signs and wonders you have done here today and the ones you are yet to do. Father, I cover the signs and wonders and the miracles with the blood of Jesus. And I decree that your miracle shall be permanent. Jesus, mighty name we pray. You may go back to your seat and apart from those who have interviewed here. Glory be to the name of Jesus. But if you have received an outstanding testimony, don't go back. Make sure you talk to somebody so that the devil will not bring it back upon your life. Thank you, Jesus. If you believe the Lord has touched you here this morning, shout it loud, hallelujah. Let's pray these prayers for our country, Nigeria. Say this loud and clear. Every agent of darkness assigned against Nigeria scatter in the name of Jesus. Let's open our mouth and declare it. In Jesus' name we pray. So every power assigned to cause confusion in this country, we bury you now. In the name of Jesus. Powers are assigned to cause confusion in this nation. We bury you now. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, so, oh, all Prince of Peace, reign in Nigeria. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and declare that one too. In Jesus name we pray lay your right hand on your head now henceforth no evil arrow shall locate my head it, it is to your own advantage beloved to shout that prayer with holy anger henceforth 
No evil arrow shall locate my head. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say thank you, Jesus. These 21 prophetic prayers, the louder your amen, the faster your breakthroughs. If you say amen to these 21 prayers, and your voice goes away, but you receive your breakthrough, you have made a powerful bargain. I decree by the decree of heavens that every buried greatness of your father's house shall resurrect in your life. In the name of Jesus, it shall resurrect in your life. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I decree by the power of God that the almighty God will over answer your prayers of breakthrough. He shall over answer, he shall over answer. He shall over answer. He shall over answer. In the name of Jesus. Masoka Porabo Shandera. I decree by the power of God and by the bulldozing power of the Holy Ghost. Every obstacle on your way of greatness. I command them to die. In the name of Jesus. 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 I decree. Now, whether it is convenient for the enemy or not, God shall be God in all your situations. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare by the power of God that if the enemy has placed your hand on the program of failure, take your hands off in the name of Jesus. Take your hands off in the name of Jesus. I pray that the vulture of your father's house planning to feed on the carcass of your destiny shall die the vulture shall die the vulture shall die in the name of jesus i decree that for the rest of this year every tragedy left in the year shall not include yourself or your family in the name of jesus the oil of breakthroughs the oil of gladness the oil of favor assigned to your head shall not run dry. He shall not run dry. In the name of Jesus, any pattern of darkness that has enveloped your life shall be broken. 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 In the name of Jesus, every good thing the Lord has deposited into your life shall manifest my fire shall manifest my fire thank you jesus the lord your god shall make the right people to help you at the right time in the right place in the name of jesus every curse issued against you i decree that they will be converted to blessings in the name of jesus Whatever the enemy is planning to be your worst time shall be converted to your best time. In the name of Jesus, I decree by the decree of heaven that because of you, your family shall not know poverty. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I decree that the rest of this year shall be a time of uncommon breakthroughs for you in the name of jesus i pray that you shall not struggle to be recognized your god shall announce you 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 in the name of jesus i decree by the power of god that the son of your life shall not listen to the voice of witchcraft the son of your life shall arise and shine in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus the power of God shall single you out for honor in the name of Jesus the power of God that has no respect for impossibility shall swallow up your problems and I decree 
that every grip of darkness upon your life shall be broken in the name of Jesus I decree by the power of God that your God shall arise your story shall change your God shall arise your story shall change your God shall arise your story shall change in the name of Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus listen the Lord has designed this month to make many people multi-millionaires this month all you need to do where you are now is to make a secret vow with the Lord between you and the Lord that if he will carry out his own part of the contract this is what you will do for the Lord too don't say but I don't have anything that I want to do now this is our, an arena of faith and uncommon breakthrough thank you Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus aha yes the angels of answered prayers they are already working on people who are here today I congratulate you for coming here today his hand which is a mighty hand is already upon you
of a person's are close. Nothing will go smoothly. Are you concerned about success in life? Are you concerned about getting to where you wish to get to? Have you checked the heavens over your head? If it's close, it's a serious problem indeed. When the heavens over the head of a man is closed, he will plant much but reap very little. The whole of his life becomes a struggle. There will be what is known as profitless hard work. When the heaven is closed, when the heavens of a man is closed, problems remain the same even after deliverance ministration. The problems remain just the same after deliverance. It's still the same. Because the heavens are closed. Can you raise up your right hand? I'm putting what you want to put into this prayer. Whether it's your career, whether it's your marriage, whether it's your calling, whatever you want to put inside, put it inside. Say, heavens over my career. Open by fire in the name of Jesus. Open by fire in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. I was over my life. I was over my career. I was over my calling. Open by fire. Open by fire. Open by fire. Open by fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. When the heavens over a man is closed, the person will labor so much but achieve very little. When the heavens over the life of a man is closed, devourers are released upon the labor of the person. The person will be living on old or past achievement. When the heavens are closed, there will be no fresh fire in that spiritual life. The prayers become ordinary noise. When the heavens are closed, the mind of the people the person will be wandering around during prayers. When the heavens are closed, the Bible reading becomes routine and dry. When the heavens are closed, the quiet time will become dry. When the heavens are closed, when the heavens are closed over a man, the person finds it easy to coexist with darkness. All kinds of spirits that are not supposed to be around you will be roaming around the person. Because the heavens are closed. When the heavens are closed, the expectations of the person is always cut off. So it is a very sad thing, a very uncomfortable thing for heavens over a man to be closed. Say, thy heavens, which is over thy head. When the heavens over a man is closed, you look for much investment but to get 
very little. When the heavens of a man's life is closed, you have leakage in your purse. There will be plenty of pockets with holes. When the heavens of a man is closed, there will be stubborn satanic dominion over the life of the person. If the business has, if the person has business, the businesses will be running to depth. When the heavens of a man is closed, when the heavens of a man is closed, there will be scarcity of testimonies. Scarcity of testimonies. When the heavens of a man's life is closed, there will be lack of divine visions. Lack of divine dreams. Lack of divine revelation. When the heaven over a man's life is closed, when the heaven over a man's life is closed, there will be chain problems. As one problem is going, another one is coming. As one, pro one problem is going, another one is coming. I pray that any demon in the heavens over your head, any principality upon your head, trying to control the heavens over your head, I scatter them in the name of Jesus. 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 When the heavens over a man's head is closed, there will be unexplainable hardship. There will be backwardness and regression. There will be manipulation by evil powers. There will be delusion instead of reality. There will be darkness instead of light. There will be contempt instead of honor. There will be war instead of peace. There will be hatred instead of love. There will be bondage instead of freedom. When the heavens over the life of a man is closed, there will be sadness instead of joy. There will be frustration instead of fulfillment. Problems remain the same. No matter how much prayer the person is praying. Simply because the heavens over the head of the person has been taken over by strange powers. Worldliness will be set into the soul of the person. Even after a series of deliverance and prayers, the person will have prayed and cried about situation. That oh Lord, I don't want to do this thing again. I want this thing out of my life. But two hours or so after the prayers, the person is back inside. When the heavens are closed. For years, what the person is doing just remains the same. Instead of the thing to move forward, it moves backward. You are working, but there is nothing to show for it. When the heavens are closed, and there is no rain for a long time, people go about looking for water. People searching for where there is water. A person may be zealous, but then the heavens are closed over all his activities. When the result you are getting is not justifying the labor you are putting it, then the heavens are closed. You cannot cast out demons under closed heavens. Deliverance session can go on for weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks. But the demon is saying, Do you all your best? Do you all your best? We are not living here. When heavens are closed, 
a lot of laborers get tired because there is nothing to show for it. Destiny fulfillment becomes very difficult. Intercessors will labor and labor without breaking through when the heavens are closed. Spiritual warfare becomes useless effort when the heavens are closed. Our individual assignments as people becomes difficult when the heavens are closed. Spiritual promotion becomes unobtainable when the heavens are closed. When there is a close heaven, people backslide so easily. This is a very, very serious matter. When there is close heavens, temptation overcomes the believer with ease. But listen, beloved. When does heaven become close? This is where you need to listen to me very carefully. Heavens become closed when we live in sin and disobedience. Heavens become close when there is ignorance on what to do to get the heavens to open. Heavens become closed when we are operating outside the will of God. Heaven becomes closed when the prayer altar is weak. Heavens become closed when men and women do not seek first the kingdom of God. Heavens become closed when we are stingy towards God. Heavens become closed when there are essential family and community bondages in place. Read your Bible very well. Jesus, when he wanted to start his work and he went to be baptized, the Bible says heavens were open unto him. Heavens were open unto him. And then he was baptized, was preaching, was teaching, was praying. But when heavens have not opened to a person, all these things will be a big struggle. It will be a big struggle. Now, heavens cannot open to you when you are not born again. Take note of that. Heavens cannot open to you when you are unrepentant. Heaven cannot open to you when you refuse to pay your tithes and offerings. Heavens will refuse to open to you when you are not using your talent to serve the Lord. It is possible to sing, to dance, to jump up, to attend conferences, whereas the heaven over your head is closed. There is here space over our heads. It must be open. And this is the purpose of today's meeting. To pray for open heavens. For heavens to open over your life. Over your career. Over your business. Over all the things that you do. So that you can be a champion for Jesus. You need to make God your friend. You need to work hard. You need to repent from all known sin. You need to ensure your complete deliverance. Then you need to pray the heaven sharing prayers. I say, oh, that thou will as rain the heavens and thou will as come down. Rise to your feet now. In case you are here, you are not born again. You have not just turned your life to Jesus. Do so very quickly now. But see what I'm going to say after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. As from today, I say bye-bye to the devil. 
are entering to the kingdom of light. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus, then we pray. To say that short prayer with me, the ushers and counselors will meet with you. Or you contact us through our numbers on the screen. God bless you, Jesus. Then. It is now time to pray with a voice that roars like fire and like thunder. My heavens, hear the word of the Lord. Open by fire in the name of Jesus. My heaven, hear the word of the Lord. Open by fire in the name of Jesus. My heaven, hear the word of the Lord. Open by fire. Open by fire in the name of Jesus. Open by fire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now bow down your head. Ask the Lord to forgive you of any sin that will keep your heaven closed. Ask him to forgive you. Jesus is here. His power is upon your life. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Amen. It is time to pray now. Pray like a man or woman from another world. Thank you, Jesus. You will now shout this prayer loud and clear. A prayer unto the God who has no respect for impossibility. I don't know the area you want the heavens to open. Whether it's finance, whether it's marriage, whether it's career, whatever you want to call, you need to call it when I call the prayer now. You want to see? Oh, I'm on. He won over my career. Glory, share me. Cheer. In the name of Jesus. Glory, open your mouth and cheer it up. Open fire. Continue, continue to tear the heavens. Continue to tear the heavens. 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 In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. Anything. My life under satanic anointing. Can I hear the sister shouting it? Anything, yes. I'm sure the sisters can do better than that. Brothers, can I hear you roaring like thunder? Anything done against my life on that satanic anointing. Backfire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. This is number two. Open your mouth and pray again. Jesus name we pray. Lord God Jesus. This is number three now. Open your mouth and pray. Mark 
Backfire in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Let your voice roar like thunder and fire. Shout this loud and clear. There is somebody whose voice is not loud enough. Fall down down in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, Jesus, See what is happening now. I told you. Imagination of darkness. Against my existence. So this is what I hear. Can your voice be loud and clear? So can see. Imagination of darkness against my existence. Backfire in the name of Jesus. Backfire in the name of Jesus. Yes. Jesus name we pray Lord God Jesus every sorcerer God show a sign against me he want your lord is can you shout this loud destroy yourself in the name of Jesus Jesus something is going on here that is a that is the power of God. Makatenda yabo shende rabo setela kayaba. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Jesus name we pray Lord for Jesus Labadura every sound of darkness go go ida okuku raised up against me ti won go so ke lo di see me can you shout this loud ati go re lo run ara sisters can your voice roar like fire are you going go so ke bi no brothers let your voice roar like thunder ti won kun re ki go re bi ara Shout it, everybody! Kill your owner! In the name of Jesus! Oh yes! Kill your owner! Thank you, Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Lord God, Jesus, Labadura. Immediately we start this prayer. There are three persons. They will not be able to stand on their feet. Because the oracle that has been speaking against you shall be embarrassed and disgraced. Satanic oracles. Consulted against me. 
me. Fight your own. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Command them to fight their own. By checking what pen you told you want. But centrally, Kaya Boshenta. Fight your own in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray. Lord who called Jesus. Say my blood. My blood. Hey, Jimmy. My blood. Hey, Jimmy. My blood. Hey, Jimmy. Can you shout that loud? Uh-huh. Shout it three times. My blood. Reject every infirmity. Thank you, Jesus. Reject every infirmity in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You now shout this. Louder than anyone around you. Oh, I keep a lay low, and I do burn it all. I let bear it Stop bomb pursuers of my life. Oh, darling, any matter, yes, I hear me. Turn back. By the perish in your Red Sea. Shake it, see no go by Stop bomb pursuer of my life. Oh, darling, any matter, yes, I hear me. Jesus, name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. Like Badura. Every domestic hidden enemy. Every domestic hidden enemy. Is that the loudest who can shout that prayer? Your voice is not loud enough. Lose your power. Open your mouth and decree. Lose your power in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Somebody is breaking through. Yes, continue, continue. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. Like the Lord will arise. Oluwa yo dide. And silence the powers I want to silence you. Your mouth. Enure. Shall be larger than the mouth of your enemies. The world that has swallowed your breakthrough. Shall vomit them right now. Your punishment is and those that have been mocking you, I want to see them back on there. They shall join in your celebration. In the name of Jesus. And now listen to this. Any power that hates your existence shall die in your place in the name of Jesus. Let that heaven rule like thunder. Somebody is breaking through again. 
This is not a day to negotiate. In Jesus' name we pray. Can you raise up your right hand and in boiling anger shout this loud again? Generational liability. If you are here to Bawambi and you dream to say Lala, a strange person any ajeji, is laying claim to you. Maybe he's decreeing that he's your husband or father or parent. And you don't even know who they are. Be on your knees. So these strange things laying claim to you. We'll have to let you go. If they don't let you go, you remain where you are. They are laying claim to your life. Shout this loud and clear. Strong man, to limit my life. Can you shout this loud? In the name of Jesus. Strong man, assigned to limit my life. You are a liar. Can you? There must be no negotiation. We are not in this meeting to negotiate. Yes, they are releasing you now. Once you see the value, in Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. La Badula. Silence. Ida Kerowa. The covenant with the strong man. Maja Mukwelo Kona La Bara. It's been broken. Own for by. This is the first person. Eni Kedini. Number two. Eni Kedi. The covenant between you. And a strong man is broken. Why they are pursuing your life? The covenant making them to pursue your life is broken. That's number two. That's number three. That's number four. That's number five. That's number six. That's number seven. That's number eight. That's number nine. That's number, nine. That's number ten. Owners of limitations. Jesus. 
Jesus name we pray Lord who called Possibility possible. He made him possibility. Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Nisi, Jehovah Shammah. He made him Jehovah Lohi, Jehovah Rapha, Jehovah Shammah. He made him possibility. Hallelujah. He made him Possibility possible, and he made possibility possible. Shout it loud, hallelujah. Let's rise up on our feet now. Let's close our eyes as we raise up our two hands to the Lord and sing this loud and clear. Holy Spirit. Be my comforter, Holy Spirit, take control, hallelujah, as I walk along the way, the way is now, oh yes, Holy Spirit. Be my Holy Spirit, move me now. Hallelujah, be my life all again. Oh, yes, and Spirit, move over me. Spirit move over me. Come and reign. Come and reign. Hallelujah. Come and reign in my life, children. Almighty God. Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Nisi, my life, and God we may have where it should be no way. He walks away, we cannot see. He will make our way for me. He will be my God. Hold me closely to His side. With love and strength for each new day, yes. He we may away. He we may away. Made impossibility possible. He made impossibility. Jehovah Jireh. Jehovah Nisi. Jehovah Shammah. He made impossibility Jehovah Lohi. He over Rafa, he over Shama, he made it possibility. Hallelujah, he made it possibility possible. And he made possibility possible. Grab somebody by the right hand and pray for that person violently. You to pray for your friend violently. As you are praying those prayers, the dew of heaven 
will begin to fall upon you that is praying for your friend shout it loud and clear like this say my father make him a candidate of supernatural surprises my father make him or make her a candidate of supernatural surprises in the name of Jesus open your mouth and pray for your friend like that aha in Jesus name we pray grab another person by the right hand and pray for that person seriously like this any evil meeting summoned against your destiny scatter in the name of Jesus pray for your friend Lord and clear aha aha in Jesus name we pray grab a third person by the right hand and pray for the person like this say my friend hear the word of the Lord your generations are celebrate you open your mouth and pray for your friend like Your generations are celebrate you in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, we thank you for a time like this before you. We praise your holy name for yesterday. We thank you for today. We thank you for your grace and your power accept our thanks in Jesus name this morning meet each and every one at the point of their needs lay your hands upon our lives in Jesus mighty name we pray let's have a say God bless you bounce back by fire can I hear you saying that in Proverbs chapter 24 Proverbs chapter 24 verse 16 Proverbs 24 16 this is a prophetic message Proverbs 24 16 for a just man falleth seven times and riseth up again but the wicked shall fall into mischief for a just man falleth seven times and rises up again that is he will bounce back I prophesy upon the life of somebody here that it shall come to pass that you shall bounce back in the name of Jesus it shall come to pass that you shall bounce back in the name of Jesus it shall come to pass what does that mean I have that word for somebody here I don't even know who I'm talking to. But the word says, it shall come to pass that it shall be recorded about you that you bounce back in the name of Jesus. What does it mean, it shall come to pass? It means prophetically, it is established. It means it is certain it means it is sure it means it must take place anytime you are reading your bible and you find it shall come to pass i'm telling you what it means now 
Or if you say a prophet saying, it shall come to pass. I'm telling you what it means. It shall come to pass means it must be done. It means it must stand. No matter what, it must stand. It shall come to pass means it is sure to occur. It must come about. It must materialize. It must transpire. And this occurs over 120 times in scripture. It shall come to pass means it shall arrive. It shall come about. It shall arise. It shall come into being. It shall come to pass. It means it shall appear. It shall emerge. It shall manifest. It shall take shape. That's what it means. It shall come to pass. There is somebody here. That statement I just made. That it shall come to pass. Has been recorded about you in heaven. Once this statement. It shall come to pass. Comes out of the throat of heaven. 30 things can happen. Once this statement. If it hasn't come out. No problem. But read your bible well. Then you begin to hear. And it shall come to pass. It has never failed. There is somebody here. That statement. It shall come to pass. That it shall be recorded about you. That you bounce back. Shall be your testimony. Once that statement comes out of the throat of heaven. It can mean 30 things. 13 things can happen. One. Darkest secrets will be revealed. Two. Impossibilities are rendered possible. Three, stubborn yokes are broken. Four, the strength of the wicked is blasted to pieces. Once the Bible says, and it shall come to pass that you will go from zero to hero, it shall come to pass that you go from nonentity to somebody, no matter what, it will happen. Number five. It shall come to pass. When that smell comes out of the throat of heaven, evil gathering against that thing will be shattered to pieces. That is, once heaven has said it shall come to pass, it doesn't matter how many witchcraft covenant meetings they are holding. It doesn't matter who is there. It doesn't matter who is talking. Six. It shall come to pass means the boasting of the wicked will be silenced. Seven. It means the high places are cast down. Eight. It means strongholds are pulled down. Now, it means the grip of the oppressors are blasted to pieces. And I see somebody here. The grip of the oppressors upon you and upon your children is shattered to pieces now. Ten, it means the strength of the wicked is shaking asunder. When it says it shall come to pass. It means diviners will be rendered mad. That's number 11. 12. It means the talking of evil men will be frustrated. 13. It means the yoke of tormentors shall be desolated. 14. It means all dark fortresses shall be set ablaze. It shall come to pass. 15. It means the agents of affliction shall be afflicted. 16. It means the altar of wickedness shall be dismantled. 17. It means the strong man shall be confounded, mesmerized, and confused. 18. It means things that are not real will be brought to reality. 19. Things that are not into being shall be brought into being, no matter what words are being said against those things. It shall come to pass. 20. We mean that dead and dry places will be revived. 21. It means that the closed doors shall burst open. 22. It means the garment of shame shall be set ablaze. 23. It means the power of the tormentors shall be drowned. 24. It means yokes, binding yokes shall be completely destroyed. When that statement comes out. If it has not come out, no problem. Once it's out, it's like the bulldozer. 25. 
It means the power of the slave master shall be buried alive. 26. It means the fire of affliction shall be quenched completely. 27. It means the handwriting of the wicked shall be set ablaze. 28. It means mockers will completely turn against themselves. 29. It means the Lord can change situations because of you can change the rules because it will change the rules because of you and 30 it means the man or the woman in problem coma will bounce back sevenfold the man or woman in problem coma will bounce back sevenfold it shall come to pass it shall be recorded about somebody here that you bounce back What does it mean to bounce back? It means to recover quickly. It means to recover after a setback. It means to recover one's health. To recover one's wealth. To recover one's confidence. To get over an uncomfortable situation. It means to pick up and take a turn for the better. It means to get back on your feet. It means to gain strength. And to overcome. It means to get back in shape. Or to be revived. That's what it means. To bounce back. I have a word for somebody from heaven. It shall come to pass. And it shall be recorded. About your destiny. That it bounce back. To the glory of God. And to the shame of the devil. Now listen carefully. You can allow circumstances in your life to become set back or to become opportunity to bounce back. It's a personal decision to allow your setback to keep you down or to allow the setback to be a stepping stone to promotion. Satan's main agenda is to cause us to fall. Any attack the enemy brings against you is to tear you down level you to the ground demolish and devastate you that's what the attack is meant to do every battle has an agenda and behind every battle there is a spiritual force perhaps you had things before now you don't have them anymore you used to have a big shop no shop anymore you used to have big commodities now you are just managing you used to have plenty of things around you. Now they've all gone down. There is a voice from heaven speaking to you loud and clear that you must bounce back by fire. You must bounce back. 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 In the name of Jesus. It is your duty not to allow what you are going through to bury you. Rather, allow it to propel you towards your destiny. Don't allow the circumstances you are going through to pull you down. Rather, allow it to catapult you to your promotion. That is a prayer that heaven said I should ask you to pray. Pray it with the loudest voice you can gather. Because there is a specific angel for that prayer point. Can you close your eyes, beloved? And with a voice louder than anyone around you. Don't joke with this prayer before the angel departs. Can I hear the sisters here shouting this after me? Every enemy of my next level. Every enemy of my next level. Look at the sisters. So, is that the loudest you can say it? Don't you want to go to your next level? Can I hear the sisters say? Every enemy of my next level. Brothers, let me hear you shouting like thunder. Every enemy of my next level. Everybody together now. You are a liar! Damn! In the name of Jesus, deal with the enemy of your next level. Makate setelaka, ribo sapanda kaya bo shenteraba. You must go to your next level. You must go. 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 Jesus.
Jesus name we pray don't, don't open your eyes yet we're not through with that prayer immediately we started praying those prayers the Lord made me to see seven wells and they were pulling people out from those deep wells wait wait but there are more wells that's why I stopped you so you can pray this more aggressively the angel to carry the request goes away something is happening to those seven persons that I saw that's right there is a hand from heaven coming upon your head where you are like rainfall get yourself ready again say powers assign against my next level in the name of Jesus that's right Something is happening here this month. Aha, 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 aha. Basopata katanda. Riba le katanda kaya boshenta. In Jesus' name we pray. Have your seat for a few minutes. Amen. David bounced back after his mistake. Daniel bounced back after the lion's den. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego bounced back after the fiery furnace. Jacob bounced back after his slavery in the camp of Lebanon, Noah bounced back after the flood. Abraham bounced back after he tried to sacrifice his son. Paul bounced back after the shipwreck and the imprisonment. Jesus bounced back after facing Satan in the wilderness. That which is confronting you that looks like a big battle before you you can make it to become the very thing that will cause your bouncing back i prophesy upon your life again that you shall bounce back job bounced back after his tragedy the lord said he now had much more than he had before what are the principles to bouncing back number one be thankful that song that says count your blessings count them one by one the psalmist says if it was not the lord that was with us what will our israel now say if it was not the lord that was with us what will our israel now say remember the story of that man who was complaining bitterly that he had no shoes no shoes he stopped complaining when he found somebody with no legs so stop complaining become thankful count your blessings count them one by one he didn't say counsel your blessings he said, count them to think about it you have plenty of things to thank god for and the kingdom of heaven is against grumblers and complainers you are complaining about god grumbling against god the kingdom of heaven is against such people that's what destroyed the israelites in the wilderness they were grumbling they were mumbling they were complaining stop grumbling stop complaining Two, be positive. Don't be a negative person. Three, be persistent. Don't give up praying. Don't give up reading your Bible. Four, be honest. Because every dishonesty will bring the enemy into your life. Every falsehood in your life will lead you into more bondage. Be honest. Five, be prayerful let prayer become your oxygen pray in any situation in which you find yourself don't be ashamed to pray anywhere whether in the market the public the plane inside the bus don't be afraid to pray anywhere be a prayerful person six be focused 
It's so easy to lose focus. Sometimes you can come to the house of God and lose focus completely and concentrate on what you really should not concentrate upon. Seven, be forgiving. Don't keep malice. Have a forgiving heart. Eight, be happy. Happiness is a decision. It's a choice. So you must decide that no matter what situation you are, you will be happy. When you are happy, no matter the situation, the enemy is breaking against you, the enemy runs away from you. When the enemy says that the more problems it brings, the happier you are, the more hardworking you are for God, the enemy will back away. Because they will, they will hold the meeting. Say, ah, we are disturbing this person, but the person is even working for God more. The more we disturb this person, the other he works. Let leave this, let's leave him alone. They will leave the person alone. But if they say that anytime they pinch you, you shout and scream and say, pinch him more. Because you have given them the weapon. Nah. Be generous. Many of us are stingy even towards God. Many people sitting out here will have been multi and multi, multi millionaire and billionaire if they can just cultivate the spirit of giving sacrificially. A lot of people don't give to God what they really should give to God. So God keeps back what they should do to them. So I say, I will give to God when I have enough money in the bank. But if you have things that you are not using that you can sell, you so sell it and bring the money to God, it's a sacrificial offering. It will bring back to you million fold. The key to prosperity is you have to give. Ten, be loving. Have love in your heart. Have love in your heart. The agape kind of love, the love of Christ. Eleven, be wise. Study the principles of wisdom and swallow that principle. Twelve, be obedient to God. Obey God in every situation. Thirteen, be patient. Be patient. God respects the patient person. And last but not the least, be holy. Be holy. For he says, a just man falleth. A just man falleth seven times and bounces back. A just man falleth seven times and rises up again. So the one who rises up again is the just man. Be holy. A lot of people hate the message of holiness. They don't like it at all. And a lot of people who will have had maximum breakthroughs run away from mountain of fire because they say, well, this kind of uh, message the preacher, you have to be holy inside and outside. I don't like it. When one will insist holiness within, holiness without, people run. As far as the Bible is concerned, there must be a difference between a child of God and a child of the devil. Difference in talking, difference in relationship, difference in dressing. Many years back, we brought an old man to come and minister somewhere. Now he was around 80 years old. As they were driving him to the church where we minister, he saw one church and people were trooping in and out. The old man looked at the driver and said, Are they having a party in that place? So it's not a party, it's a church. The old man sighed. And he didn't talk again till he got to where he was going. There must be a difference between the children of God and children of the devil. The name for the children of God is peculiar people. They're strange. They're strange. The way they would dress will be, may be strange to you. The way they would talk will be strange to you. So there must be a difference. A clear, clear, clear difference within a child of God, a child of the devil. Holiness that is inside must be reflected on the outside. And that is an area where the enemy is stealing from so many people. Many things that people put on just chase the good angels away from them. They finish deliverance, they put on the Jezebelian attachments and Jezebelian pains and everything and the demons come back. And the demons will come back. A just man falls seven times and rise up with you. Rise up with your feet below. Rise up on your feet now. All eyes closed. I'd like you to bow down your heads where you are and tell the Lord that He should forgive you 
of any sin that want to keep you stagnant anything that want to make you just roaming around ask the Lord to forgive you after asking the Lord to forgive you we now start the bouncing back prayers during the bouncing back prayers anything can happen to anybody in this meeting but the important thing is that that rope that has been tying you down in one spot the rope of failure at the edge of success the rope of this is how far you can go you cannot go further they have to be dashed to pieces meanwhile close your eyes remain standing bow down your head ask the lord to forgive you any sin that will keep you in any satanic bus stop ask him to forgive you My heart in my heart dies a great revival. Teach me, Lord, to watch and pray and to read my Bible in my heart. E my eyes agree river teach me Lord to watch and pray and to read my Bible and it shall come to pass that it shall be recorded about you that although you were derided you bounce back (laughs) it shall be said of you that although they say you never come up you came up (laughs) it shall be said of you that although they say you will never marry but you got married (laughs) it shall be said of you they say although they say you will never rise to that top place you not only rose there you surpass it as many people as are in this garden this morning and you have an agenda to bounce back the kind of prayer i want you to pray now is not a gentleman's prayer because i say horn that scattered that does not allow judah and israel to raise up his head because i say power that suppresses the head that's why it has to be a strong prayer before you start that prayer i want you to sing this song sing it with a loud voice sing it with fire and with power don't bother what's happening around you you just concentrate on your own singing concentrate on your own singing by the reason of anointing every yoke must be broken by the reason of anointing every yoke must be broken by the reason of anointing every yoke must be broken by the reason of anointing every yoke must be broken by the reason of anointing raise your voice raise your voice raise your voice raise your voice by the reason of anointing Every yoke must be broken. Every yoke must be broken. Every yoke, every yoke, every yoke must be broken. Every yoke, every yoke must be broken. Every yoke, every yoke must be broken. Every yoke, every yoke. Every yoke must be broken. Every yoke, every yoke, every yoke must be broken. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Every yoke must be broken.
Masakatela Kaya Bushendera Bosanta. Continue, continue singing, continue singing, continue singing. Yes. of a night by the anointing Jesus breaks the yoke by the Holy Spirit not just as the prophet said this is the day of the late God is moving in his power again by the anointing Jesus breaks the yoke not by power, not by my, by my spirit, princess, 
this mountain, this mountain. Hallelujah. This By my spirit, every yoke must be broken, risen of and not every yoke. And the reason of anointing. Now we're ready. We're ready now. Listen. Woe unto that power that wants to keep you down. Woe unto that power that doesn't want you to lift your head. Woe unto that power assigned to suppress your destiny. So with boiling anger in your spirit, shout this loud and clear. Power! Suppressing my bouncing back! In the name of Jesus! Something is happening now. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to double your aggression. Evil hands. Pressing down my head. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray with a voice louder than anyone in this auditorium you will cry out like Zerubbabel you will cry out like Zerubbabel in the Bible Say so the hand of Zerubbabel has started to be his hands also shall finish it he says who art thou O great mountain before Zerubbabel thou shall become a plain you will shout your name loud and clear. Daniel Olukoya! Hear the word of the Lord! Bounce back by fire! In the name of Jesus! That's it! 
This is not a death on our church. Jesus name we pray wonderful thank you Jesus there are people here this morning beginning from today positive signs of your bouncing back shall begin to manifest father as many of your children as are gathered here this morning the key the power to bounce back the rod of breakthrough to use in order to bounce back give it unto your children in the name of Jesus every voice dragging anyone to the valley let the voice of the valley be silenced in the name of Jesus and every satanic order on anyone here asking them to come down just like that order came to Elijah say man of God come down he said no I'm not coming down instead of me to come down let fire come down any strange power any dark power cry upon anyone here to come down receive fire in the name of Jesus receive fire in the name of Jesus Receive fire in the name of Jesus. It is well with you. The Lord will bless you from Zion. Make his face to shine upon you. And be gracious unto you. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Let us share the grace in fellowship. Grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God, the sin fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us now and forevermore. Yeah. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all days of our life, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord. For shout a Jericho destroying, hallelujah! Shout this loud and clear. Any wants me to die before my glory appears can you shout that loud you are a liar in the name of Jesus open your mouth and begin to pray why was I want me to die before my glory appears my potter said, Tell you, Kayabra. Yes, our power must be disgraced. In the name of Jesus. My Paula Kayabra Shanta Rabo Santa. Aha, 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 aha. Jesus. Jesus, then we pray. I'm going to come from one to seven. Smite your head seven times. On your head lies the ear which represents your glory. Something is about to happen to you now that will change your story forever. When you smite that head, you will shout with a loud voice, Fire! One! Two! Three! Four! Five! Six! Seven! Aha! 
And I begin to shake that head. Shake it vigorously. Today is a day of deliverance. Shake it vigorously. Something is coming out. Yes, shake it. Every arrow fired into the brain, fired into the head, that they are using to manipulate your glory. Out. 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 In the name of Jesus. Every power that has been manipulating your glory, I bind them and I cast them out in the name of Jesus. Beginning from today, your story must change. 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 In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. You, that person. That the enemy has been harassing. Enough is enough. Yes. I command the power of the oppressor to release your legs. Release your hands. To release your body. In the name of Jesus. Owners of evil law. What are you waiting for? Carry your law. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and decree it. Command them to carry their loads. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, where is the Lord God of Elijah? Alas, let my story change in the name of Jesus. Cry unto the Lord now for a change of story. Your story must change, your story must change. Your story must change. Amen. Pray this prayer with violence and with power. Without any apology to any power. Anything can happen now. Pray the way you have never prayed before. Surprise! That handed me over to the strong man. You are a liar. Dead. In the name of Jesus. Power that under the of the strong man. Die in the name of Jesus. Amen. Raise your two hands to the heaven as you pray this prayer. The louder you pray it, the faster. My blessings. 
held up in the covens. Come out by fire in the name of Jesus. Come on, to come out. Mapote seteli kaya boshanda, ribo sopende kaya boshenta rabo sente. In Jesus' name we pray. If you're that person that you know that your body is decaying internally, nobody needs to tell you can smell it. Right there where you are, begin to drink the blood of Jesus. Drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it, drink, 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 drink the blood of Jesus. Aha. I command you to recover yourself now. In the name of Jesus, with a military voice, shout this. I shall laugh last. You are not shouting it yet. You are still not shouting it yet. Over my enemies by the power in the blood of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. In Jesus' name we pray. Now from inside your belly, not just from the mouth alone. If you believe that prayer you just prayed, with a loud voice, begin to laugh your enemies to scorn. <laughs> just laugh them to scorn. Laugh them to scorn. <laughs> Make it louder, make it louder. <laughs> Aha. Amen. I shall love love over my enemies by the power in the blood of Jesus. Shout it again. Shout it a second time. Make it louder now. A louder amen. Let your amen roar like thunder as I pray now. In this prayer session, anything can happen at any time. Father, in the name of Jesus. Your amen is not loud enough. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you because your word says that oppression shall be far away from us. Your word says, they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Your word says, no weapon formed against us shall prosper. Father, I decree right now that anyone the weapon of the enemy is already prospering in your life. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. Master Polikaya, receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. When I say one, two, three, go now. You shout the name of Jesus seven aggressive times and then you keep quiet. One, two, three, go! Shout it again! Father, 
it is written anyone that calls on the name of the Lord shall be saved as many as have called upon the name of the Lord just now receive your breakthroughs now in the name of Jesus Receive it, 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 receive it. Makatela kaya bo shentera bo sa. In the name of Jesus. Silence. Father, all who have been dedicated to one idol or the other. Consciously or unconsciously. Father, these are your angels that are moving around. Let them begin to touch them. Yes. All those who have been dedicated by their parents or anything. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. Say, I receive power. To rewrite my family history. By the power in the blood of Jesus, can you shout that loud? Shout it again! In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray. Jesus name we pray all eyes closed the prayers I want you to pray now they are not ordinary prayers but it's important that you do not negotiate with the enemy it's important that you do not joke with the prayers at all it's important that you pray it well violently immediately the process of this prayer starts the miracle hand of God will begin to work. Some people, it will go back 20 years, 30 years, 50 years. Some will just see the body lifting away. Some may actually see the strong man pulling out of their bodies. If you pray this prayer and you lose your voice, but the process of deep deliverance happens in your life, you will have done yourself a world of favor. While the process of this prayer is going on, there are people all your life they have been pressing you down it is those power that are pressing you down that you want to unseat now there are people the enemy has fired all kinds of arrows into your body so as if the body does not belong to you you will see what will happen in the next five minutes if you will open your mouth and pray aggressively blind Bartimaeus screamed and cried out Jesus son of David have mercy on me his voice was loud enough to embarrass people for the voice of a single man to embarrass a crowd it must be a serious cry it is that kind of cry that can get the breakthrough the bible says in the day that i cry then shall my enemies come back there is somebody here immediately you begin to cry out to god now the enemies that pursue your grandfather pursue your father is now pursuing you shall be buried alive if in the process of these prayers you find that you could not remain on your feet right there on the floor where you are continue the prayers now place your hand on your belly button area with a voice that nobody beside you will overshadow you will shout this loud and clear blood of jesus There must be great deliverance. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Aha, 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 aha. In 
Jesus name we pray uh-huh. we are making progress we are making huge progress say voices from my foundation that are attacking my star yeah! in the name of Jesus Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. I am going to count seven from here, which is a sign of perfection. Something is going to happen to three groups of people. Number one set of people. Everywhere you go, you face unexplainable hatred. The power of God will fall upon you, and that yoke shall be broken. Number two, you are at the edge of a serious breakthrough right now. But some forces have just risen up again to steal that breakthrough. As I count seven, the power of God will fall upon you. And that yoke shall be broken. And by the next power of changes, you come here with your testimony. As I count to seven, all those who are here, and you came here almost lifeless, the power of God will fall upon you. And your blood that has been taken away shall be returned. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, you have been operating for a long time. Today is the expiry date of that operation. Masi katende kaya bo shende raba. Rima sapi ali katende. Just shake the serpent out of your head. Shake the serpent out of your head. Masi katende kaya bo shanda. Aha. Yes. Amen. You that unexplainable swelling in the body, I command you to depart from your hiding place in the name of Jesus. Yes. In the name which is above all names, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, Right there where you are, receive the touch of the great physician in the name of Jesus. Receive the touch of the great physician in the name of Jesus. Aha. There are serious prayers to pray. Very serious prayers. If you pray this prayer, this single prayer, we bring you uncommon testimonies. Pray this prayer to encounter your testimonies. Joy swallowers of my father's house. Is that the loudest you can shout it? Your voice is still not loud enough. Make it a louder shout. Damn! In the name of Jesus. Those who are swallowing the joy of your father's house.
Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Yes, in Jesus' name we pray. This is wonderful. This is wonderful. Stretch your right hand towards me here. Father, these hands that are stretched here, let his hand carry the fire power of God. Let it carry the healing power of Jehovah. When you use his hand this day, every bondage shall be broken. And every arrow of death and hell shall go back to the senders. In the name of Jesus. Now, anywhere you are having problem in your body, smite it without mercy 21 times. And shout, go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. Go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. Let's go. Satania Aha 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 Thank you Jesus Amen Check your body now Do what you could not do before Say this after me Anything in the land of the dead troubling my life is prayer for somebody here because your breakthrough also happened today, 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 today. Anything in the land of the dead troubling my life. Death! In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree it. Masateli Kaya In Jesus' name we pray. That's right. Check that body. Yes. The arrow fired into your head. That makes it look as if it's going to burst. The power of God is coming upon you. That person over there, they say you have cancer fire is coming upon your body and that disease is drying up check your body check your body this particular prayer is a serious one indeed lay your right hand on your head then later you lay your hand on your chest as we pray this prayer let's start with the head foundational injury In my life, can you shout it loud? Is that the loudest you can shout it? Receive healing in the name of Jesus. Yes, foundational injury. Receive healing now. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. 
say any dark power living in my house or around my house can I hear you saying that loud and clear that voice is not loud enough uh huh get out now in the name of Jesus any dark power living in my house or around my house command them to get out In Jesus' name we pray. Silence. Father, I'm praying for anyone under the sound of my voice who has been dedicated to any idol and this idol from the waters from the forest from the mountains the idol that has been controlling this destiny my captain that they upon everyone like that here let the chain of the idol power be broken now be broken, 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 in the name of Jesus. That evil tree planted in your father's house with your name that has been troubling your life. Let the chain of that satanic tree upon your destiny be broken now in the name of Jesus oh yes aha aha anyone who has stepped on any magic item or any sorcery item or any enchantment item and the thing is affecting their legs let the fire of the god of elijah burn to ashes every plantation of darkness in the name of jesus yes that's the power of god coming upon you father i'm praying for all those here or under the sound of my voice who have been dedicated to the waters and the power controlling their destiny is inside the waters father as i count seven from here let your liquid fire fall upon such people and let the yoke of the waters be broken to pieces one two three four five Six, seven. Aha. You now need to pray this prayer. The prayer that delivered that woman from the bondage. Pass! Assign to use me as a sacrifice. You are a liar! Die! In the name of Jesus! Deal with that power now! In Jesus' name we pray. Yes, Lord, we pray.
With a loud voice, sing this song of deliverance. Unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up my soul. Unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up Pass! Submit! 
Don't say my name to the cove. Die in the name of Jesus. Makatendayaboshenta. Jesus name we pray shout this loud and clear powers discussing my fears in the covers can you shout that loud scatter in the name of Jesus open your mouth and decree it Discussing my fears in the covers. Your time is up. My sick heart is like I. In Jesus' name, we pray. Anything pronounced against my life. Under satanic anointing. Can I hear the sister saying that one? Brothers. Is that the loudest who can shout it? Of Jesus, aha. Jesus name we pray I shall laugh last for my enemies in the power the blood of Jesus Jesus, mighty name we pray. Sir, Holy Ghost bulldozer. Open my way. In the name of Jesus. Jesus, name we pray. Glory killers of my father's heart. You are a liar. Death in the name of Jesus. Thank you.
to Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. As you pray this next prayer, anytime you are at the edge of a breakthrough, you have some strange dreams and the breakthrough disappears. If you smell strange odors that others don't smell, shout this prayer loud and clear. Pass! God that to disgrace me! Your time is up! Scatter! In the name of Jesus! Something is happening, something is happening. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, rough life. Back seat. Can you shout out to this loud and clear? Shout it louder than that. I am not your candidate. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Rough life box it. In Jesus' name we pray. Point your right hand at me here. Father, let the Holy Ghost fire and the power of deliverance fall upon this hand. In the name of Jesus. As I can seven now smite your head vigorously. One. I want you to be more aggressive. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Yes, Aha. Yes, bro. Can all the feathers? Yes, bro. Can all the feathers? Yes, bro. Can all. The feather he has set me free. I will sing Hallelujah. I will sing Hallelujah. I will sing. Set me free, he has set me free. He has broken, he has broken all the fetters. He has broken all the fetters. He has broken all. He has set me free. He has set me free. I will sing. I will sing. Hallelujah. I will sing. I will sing. Hallelujah. I will sing. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Every power that has 
just handed me over to the strong man. Yeah! In the name of Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say anything planted in my life to disgrace me. Can you shout it loud? Death! In the name of Jesus. Jesus, let me pray. Prophesy upon your life now. You will shout your name. Say, Daniel, hear the word of the Lord. Arise and shout in the name of Jesus. Arise and shine in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, Daniel, I prophesy upon you. Move forward by fire in the name of Jesus. Prophesy upon yourself. Jesus name we pray now with a voice that roars like thunder you want to give five commands to your hands five hot commands speak to your two hands now with this spiritual order or command cobwebs assign against my heart Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Upon my arm, in the name of 
Jesus. It's happening, it's happening, it's happening, it's happening, it's happening. In Jesus' name we pray. Curses upon my eyes. Pray in the name of Jesus. Enough is enough. Makapote sete ya boshanda, ruma sape ni katanda. In Jesus' name we pray. This is the fourth command. Evil magnets upon my eyes catch fire. In the name of Jesus. name we pray stretch your right hand towards me stretch your right hand towards me father these hands that are stretched here let them become instrument of deliverance instrument of power instrument of strength instrument of glory as many infirmity I shall be smitten with these hands let the infirmity go back to the sender. In the name of Jesus. You will smite anywhere in your body where there is trouble. You will smite it without mercy. And shout, go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. Go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. You need to smite it 21 odd times. Let's go. Do it one, do it one. Makatenda yabo shente. Thank you, Jesus. Aha, aha. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. The fifth command upon your hand. As you are issued the command, you'll be clapping those hands. Clap it aggressively as you issue the command. My heart receive deliverance in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus silence things are going on a lot of things are going on every spiritual wedding ring of the spirit husband has set you on fire in the name of jesus as the first person that's number two the fingers on fire that's number three number four number five six seven eight nine ten The kind of prosperity you've never experienced before will begin to happen in your life now. Shout this louder than anyone around you. Shout it ten times. I plug myself into the socket of divine favor by the power in the blood of Jesus can you say it number one number 
Nó bắt chú Nó bắt chú đi Mà cắt tên đại bố sáng ta ra bố sáng Say it now, say it now, say it now. Plug yourself into the socket of divine favor. Amen. Say so every chain upon my hands, upon my legs, break in the name of Jesus. The mighty chains will be broken. There must be no negotiation. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers of pocket with holes. Get out of my head. In the name of Jesus. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Cobweb spirits. Get out of my eye. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray it loud. Jesus name we pray this next three prayers the Lord said I should tell you that as many as who open their mouth and pray with violence within the next 10 days they will have uncommon testimony these three prayers my heart hear the word of the Lord Locate my prosperity in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Jesus name we pray arrows of failure fire into my heart backfire in the name of Jesus somebody is breaking through oh yes Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus, then we pray. This is the third prayer. Look at what is happening. Look at what is happening. Power 
of death. I signed against my hand. Death! In the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Rumor Pocates attend the In Jesus' name we pray. Raise the two hands to the heavenlies now. Raise the devilies. Raise the devilies. I decree that before you will put these hands down, the testimony, the blessings, the virtues that will shock your neighbors and surprise your friends. Receive it now in the name of Jesus. Makate setende yaba. In the name of Jesus, beginning from now, even if you touch what does not sell, it shall become gold and silver in the name of Jesus. I decree that every good thing this hands have lost, my capote is attending Before you put them down, they must repossess it. Repossess. Repossess it. Repossess it, repossess it, repossess it, repossess it, repossess it, repossess it, in the name of Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Father, I'm praying for those who are here. And the enemy has swallowed the joy in your marriage. Right there where you are. Whether it is convenient for the enemy or not. Receive your deliverance now in the name of Jesus. Receive it. Aha, aha. That's the power of God. That's the power of God. Pokotara basetende keya boshenta. Manakantanda rabosopola. Receive it now in the name of Jesus. Aha. Glory killers. Embargo of my father's house. Can you shout this loud? Your voice is not loud enough. I think you should try harder than that. In the name of Jesus, enough is enough. Bata setela kaya boshendera basant. Yes, 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 yes. Jesus name we pray something is about to happen divine acceleration uncommon promotion mysterious elevation it's about to happen now you will shout the name of Jesus Jesus Christ Grace I am available. Touch me now in the name of Jesus. Jesus Christ, great physician. I am available. 
Touch me now! 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 Thank you, Jesus. 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 Receive the torture of the power. Receive the torture of the fire. Receive it. 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 Makapoli Kayabo Shandera Basanda. In Jesus' name we pray. Somebody is receiving a brand new heart. Somebody is receiving a brand new kidney. Somebody is receiving a brand new womb. Check your body now. Check your body. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You now pray this particular prayer. Arrows of delayed blessing. Can you shout it louder than that? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. As someone here this day, I have a word to you from the Lord. The Lord said, I should tell you that your time of uncommon advancement has come. Your time of awesome testimony has come. Listen, the God whom you serve shall cause you to overtake those who have been mocking you. Yes. And your season of accelerated promotion has come in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let there be silence now. Silence now some surgical operation spiritually is about to take place now all eyes closed you that person over there I divorce you from this spirit that comes to your dream to have constant sex with you I divorce you from them right now in the name of Jesus That's the first person. That's number two. That's number three. That's the power of God coming upon them. You can't hide. Enough is enough. I disconnect you over there from the spirit that brings dreams of failure to you. Anytime you are close to a breakthrough, I disconnect you right now in the name of Jesus. I disconnect you, that person over there right now, from the evil mark placed on your forehead, preventing you from moving forward. I disconnect you right now in the name of Jesus. There is a power of God coming upon you. thing you have trampled upon that is now affecting your walking your legs and they are calling it arthritis and all kinds of names right there where you are I command the arrows that have entered into your leg to go back to the senders in the name of Jesus 
It's happening. Silence. The power of God is about to fall on three persons. And those three persons will not be able to stand on their feet. These three persons that are powers of eaters of flesh and drinkers of blood right in your bedroom. Anytime you sleep on that bed and wake up, it's as if life is going out of you. Right there where you are. I bind and cast out from your body the spirit of death and hell in the name of Jesus that's the first person that's number two that's number three Yes. You, the spirit of cancer, hear the word of the Lord. It is written, as soon as they hear of me, they shall obey me. Strangers shall submit themselves unto me. The strangers shall fade away, and they shall be afraid out of their clothes. I bind and cast out every arrow of infirmity of cancer in the name of Jesus. Silence. Silence. I'm going to count seven from here. The power of God is going to fall on 50 persons. And they may not be able to stand on their feet. But that will be the end of the blockages they have been noticing. The angels to process that, they are already in the midst. One. Two. Three. Four. Today is your expiry date. You can't block the way of God's people anymore. Thank you, Jesus. All those powers that have been scratching your body when you sleep, I disconnect you from them in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Your time of unprecedented, unexpected, and envious breakthrough has come in the name of Jesus. Yes. Your God shall make you a showroom of the display of his power in the name of Jesus. Jesus spoke to that deaf person and cried on his head in a language called Ephata. A father is a command. Be open. It is that command that Jesus gave you. You are going to give to now. Can you shout this louder than anyone around you? My way of breakthroughs. My way of joy. Alpha. In the name of Jesus. in the name of Jesus in 
in Jesus name we pray pray this prayer the way you've never prayed any prayer say Pause! that wants me to suffer what my parents suffered can I hear you shouting this loud? Your voice is not loud enough. Your time is up. In the name of Jesus. Masepinakia. The Santa La Kaya Boshanta Raba Santa. Oh, put your mouth, oh, put your mouth, oh, put your mouth. This is why Jesus brought you here. That's the power of God, that's the power of God, that's the power of God, that's the power of God. Yes, something is happening. That's right. Papa, take it. Haribo Sopanda. In Jesus, then we pray. Uh huh. Your hand on your belly button. And shout this loud and clear. Collective captivity. Inheritance from my parents. Damn! In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Makapa da riba sopanda kaya da riba sopanda kaya bo shentera basanda in Jesus name we pray aha yes oh yes oh yes see what is happening there's a disconnection going on all over the place the evil blood that flowed into you has been extracted now. Aha. Be released. Be released. Be released. Enough is enough. Shout this with holy anger. Keep your hand on your belly button. Generational deficiency. Jesus does the power of God as the power of God as the power of God thank you Jesus thank you Jesus in Jesus name we pray remember your head is a symbol of your destiny makapota lika ya bushanda ribopo lika disentendeka pray this prayer don't say you have prayed it before owners of evil Lord, carry your Lord in the name Jesus oh yes carry your loot carry your loot carry your loot in Jesus
Jesus' name we pray. Let your voice roar like fire and like thunder. Inherited infirmity. Can you shout this loud? Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Something is happening to somebody over there. That's right. Makatenaya Boshenta. Deal with the inherited infirmity. Jesus name we pray say so I fire back every arrow of disgrace in the name of Jesus open your mouth and fire it back Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Lay your right hand upon your head now and decree this loud and clear. Satanic luggage of my father's house. Shout it with boiling anger. I am not your candidate. Dead. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus them we pray silence now please don't say anything until I ask you to talk now masekatenda le kaya boshandia ribo setila le katende kaya boshandia bokampea manaka di setende kaya le katende ke sependi ya boshandia father I'm praying for all who are in this gathering and they have been on consciously dedicated to a shrine to an idol to an evil power wherever such people are the covenant conscious unconscious between them and the idol between them and the shrines between them and the evil agreement between them and the evil agreement I break it in the name of Jesus. Be broken, 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 in the name of Jesus. It's happening. It's happening, yes. The dedication to the waters, the dedication to the forest, the dedication to any occultic power. Break in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
that person who cannot use the legs very well Jesus is by your side therefore arise and use those legs in the name of Jesus put your foot into action and use those legs right now thank you Jesus thank you Jesus thank you Jesus father I'm praying for all those who used to dream of going back to their former house going back to their former schools going back to their old apprentice workshop going back to places they have surpassed taking examination they have passed before Mapotasetia wherever such people are now any covenant between you and backwardness I break it now in the name of Jesus be broken, 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 in the name of Jesus. Yes. Shout this loud and clear. Power of the grave. Of my father's heart. Death. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus, let me pray. Like somebody, you are so close to breakthrough that will change your story. So say that amen with value. Every power that does not want you to rejoice, I bury them now in the name of Jesus. Possess your possession, 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 possess your possession in the name of Jesus. Stretch your right hand towards this altar now. Father, we thank you for all powers belong to you. You are our rock, you are our strength. Your word says, with man, this is impossible. But with God, all things are possible. Father, by your power, which has no respect for impossibility, lay your hands upon the hands of your people in the name of Jesus. Lay your hands upon the hands of your people in the name of Jesus. As you lay your hands on your body now, in a prophetic action, the hand of God will arise and fight all your battles. In the name of Jesus. Lay that hand on your belly button. Lay it there. And let there be silence. Father, where there is the spirit of untimely death, right there where you are, receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, silence. They are departing. Yes, the spirit of death and hell is coming out through the mouth, through the nose, through the womb. That's the power of God coming upon you, Father. As many as are here, and they are wallowing under the bondage of inherited poverty inherited backwardness inherited failure receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus
Thank you, Jesus. Every snake in your foundation that is biting your future, I kill that serpent now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Silence. Now, very gently now. Gently. Not aggressively. Gently. I'm going to count seven from here. Smite your body betting area seven times. Gently. One. Something is coming out already. Two. Three. The spirit of your mother is releasing you now. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Now with a voice that roars like thunder. Can you shout this louder than anyone around you? Arrows fired from my foundation into my destiny. Can you shout it loud? Your voice is not loud at all. Jesus Ma pata secha likayaba In Jesus name we pray You are going to pray The prayer is in the song and you sing the song 10 times don't let anybody's voice be louder than yours. This song is a prophetic proclamation. It's a powerful prayer. Don't let anybody's voice overshadow your voice. Ten times. Ten good times. All eyes closed. Are you ready? Thank you, Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Turn me to fire. Turn me to fire. Louder, louder, louder. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Louder, louder, louder. In the name of Jesus. Say anointing that terrifies the enemy. Come upon my life now. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to ask for that anointing. Anointing that terrifies the enemy. Come upon my life now. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, I'm praying right now for all who have breakthrough still hanging in this year. I decree by the decree of heavens that every breakthrough that has been dedicated to this year for you in a mysterious, strange way. Possess your possession in the name of Jesus. I decree upon your life 
that none of your blessings shall disappear with this year. In the name of Jesus. Any power that is traveling anywhere to harm you. Any power that is going into the spirit realm to harm you will never come back. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now with a loud voice, pray this yoke-breaking prayer. Pray it without apology. Say, yoke breaker! Jesus Christ! Break my yokes now! In the name of Jesus! In Jesus name we pray Some people are being followed around by some evil powers The agenda of this power is to scuttle everything they are doing Any good thing they are doing they scuttle them Follow, follow powers Following me for evil, turn back there in the name of Jesus. Deal with our power now. But support Ali Katendeke. Riba Sapandeke Yabo Shante Raba Santa. Powers following me for evil. Turn back. Turn. In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch forward your two hands like someone who wants to receive a big present and let your amen be dynamic as I pray those gifts back into your hands father it is written that we will possess our possession anything good that has been stolen from any life no matter how long it has been stolen as this hands are stretched forth now every Everything that has been stolen from you, beginning from your mother's womb, repossess them now in the name of Jesus. Repossess them, 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 repossess them in the name of Jesus. That says you will not possess your marriage. Any power that says you will not have your own children. Any power that says you will not possess your wealth. I command them to die in the name of Jesus. Possess your possession now. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. Possess your possession. In the name of Jesus. In 
Jesus name we will pray then you pray this prayer Daniel Olukoye hear the word of the Lord can you shout that loud our eyes are shut in the name of Jesus Open your mouth and decree that prayer. Thank you, Jesus. Daniel Olukoye. Hear the word of the Lord. Arise and shout. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, anointing that breaks the yoke. Come upon my life now. In the name of Jesus. Let your voice be loud. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. This third prayer, you now apply a prophetic action. As you are praying it, wait for me to tell you the prayers. As you are praying it, begin to clap your hand loudly. That clap shall ordain terrifying noises against your enemies. You shout this loud and clear. Evil family pattern. Pray in the name of Jesus. Command the evil family pattern to break, 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 break in the name of Jesus. 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 My pattern said, louder, 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 louder. Break, break in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. The Lord blesses you from Zion. Make his face to shine upon you. Cover your family with the blood of Jesus. The eyes that never slumbers nor see shall be upon you. The sun shall not smite you by day, nor the moon by night. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. I decree upon you right there where you are that the deliverance that will make you possess your possession should begin to manifest in your life now. Receive it, 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 That does not want to let anyone go whatever covenant is keeping that power in place i command the covenant to be broken by fire in the name of jesus let the power of god begin to move to cut off every ladder of darkness to you father be the glory in jesus mighty name we pray the year is running to an end now. 
and as usual when the year is running to an end like this the enemy intensifies activities in order to balance the account for the year i'm praying that every balancing of the account of the enemy will not prosper in your life and any part that wants you to cry shall be disgraced violently and any tragedy left in the year it is minus you and your family let your amen be loud and clear let your amen be loud and clear you don't have to believe what i'm saying you may even think they're all superstitious is a lie but i know what i'm talking about amen so please listen very very carefully there is an entity known as arrows of darkness they exist whether you believe it or not does not matter they exist there are arrows of darkness i have seen it manifested i have seen many examples countless number of examples that's the first fact to understand i shared with you here before something that happened in my former church that my former church we don't pray much we dance more we take about 10 offering per service and in the offering there will be no usher you have to dance to the front 10 times and dance back to your seat so you are always dancing in and out of your seat in and out of your seat we will take an offering for those who were healed we take an offering for those who travel and came back safely we take an offering for those who have, have obtained certificates we take an offering for all kinds of things and then in addition to those who want to do special thanksgiving and if they are your friends you dance after them and follow them to the front and they carry a plate giant plate but small money they dance to the front we dance after them i used to feel sorry for my dad he was a very poor dancer he dancing behind the woman like that and the woman who were rolling and rolling and rolling and rolling would be using their bum bum to shook his leg because he could not dance that's what we were doing there not knowing that we were just preparing ourselves for silver golden arrows the first time this will happen it's a wedding ceremony the wedding has finished the couple were outside those who were to take pictures were there all of a sudden the bride shouted who are these people and she put her hands in her wedding gown and tore it they quickly rushed at her pushed her inside the car drove her straight to the hospital because we that were there we did not know that there is something known as arrow of darkness somebody who was normal throughout the service was never sick before had never even taken ordinary panadol before does not even go to hospital because he's always well then all of a sudden just like that that's what we call the arrows of darkness arrows of darkness i pray for somebody here that the arrow that is targeting your day of glory will backfire by fire in the name of jesus a seven fall amen It was another wedding at Ife. The bride, after the wedding, began to have pounding headaches. She could not sleep. She could not do anything. They rushed out to Lagos. They brought her here. I started praying. The Lord said, call for the video of their wedding. Call for the video. Say, I want to show you something. Call for the video. So I, they, they brought the video. So I started to watch him. During the reception, as they were dancing, they were pasting money on their forehead. They were pasting money, pasting money. And I was watching, what? There. The one woman like this danced to the front. I noticed that when she danced to the front, no one followed her. She faced the couple alone. She put her hand inside the bag. At that level, what she brought out was a feather, not money. She had used her demonic power to keep others from dancing to the front. He now put the feather on the head of the woman and the feather did not come back to her hand in that picture the lord said that's it a feather of darkness an arrow of darkness true in that picture immediately the feather entered into her head 
the bride did like this, did like this. She didn't do anything. And they continued the dancing. You really are telling me, Mom. I can see that you have been attending those ceremonies. Amen. One prayer let the feather of darkness go back to the senders. That was all. But if we didn't know what happened to that head, you can put cartons and cartons of panadol. It's a lie. Can you shout this loud and clear? fired against my head consciously or unconsciously can you shout it loud your voice is not loud enough backfire by fire in the name of Jesus there is a woman here who needs to pray this prayer Mapiari Katari Kasa Riba Sapiari Katandaka. In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch your right hand to the heavens. Say, My Father, put heavenly coals of fire on my hands now. Stretch that hand above your head. My father, put heavenly coals of fire upon my hands now. Fire to disgrace the weapon of darkness. In the name of Jesus, now smite your head seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Thank you, Jesus. Sit down for a little bit, madam. Sit down, brothers, sisters, ladies and gentlemen. So there is an entity known as arrows of darkness. At fact number one. At fact number two. Men and women receive these arrows every day. Every day. Fact number three. The Bible makes us to understand. According to Psalm 91. Psalm 91 verse 5. That there is an arrow that flyeth by day. So fact number three. There are day arrows. There are night arrows. The Bible makes that one very very clear every arrow by day fired against anyone here shall by fire by fire <laughs> how many facts have i told you now fact number four most cases of untimely death is due to these sudden arrows sudden arrows it's a terrible thing a professor i've been looking for a child for a long time Eventually, the wife took him. He was teaching in the lecture room that day. While they came to break the news that the wife had delivered the baby boy. The professor was extremely glad. He was beside himself with joy. He jumped up for joy. By the time he landed on the floor, he was dead. That's what they call arrows. It doesn't make sense the way it works. Fact number five. The strength of an arrow and the power thereof depends on the person who shoots the arrow depends on the origin of the arrow fact number six there are special arrows the enemy fires at the righteous righteous so the fact that you are righteous does not mean they won't target you the bible says they shall fight against you but they shall not prevail it didn't say they will not fight, they will fight. But they shall not prevail. Can you say, they shall not prevail? Can you shout it three times? In Psalm 11, 
verse 2. Psalm 11, verse 2. If you are there, say yes. Are you there? So, for lo, the wicked bend their bow. They make ready their arrow upon the string that they may privily shoot. At who? At the upright. There you are. There are special arrows targeted against the righteous. And at fact number seven, the most dangerous arrows are fired by witchcraft because they are public enemy number one. Public enemy number one. Public enemy number one. Please, from what I've said so far, you will see that walking about saying, I'm sanctified. I've received salvation. I am holy. I am righteous. I have received the baptism of the Holy Spirit. By the grace of God, I'm living a clean life. I don't sin. I don't lie. I don't fornicate. I don't steal. It does not say that they will not fire the arrow. Please understand that one. That's why you find somebody who claims to be holy, he has received an arrow. Somebody who claims to be doing God's work, he has received an arrow. Receive an arrow. When a man of God at the age of 70, pastor at the age of 70, is now suspended for sleeping with a girl of 20, and he has been a pastor for 50 years. He was a pastor before I was born, and now he's gone. Just like that. As the arrow. Is there? See, they make ready their arrow so that they can privily shoot. Privily shoot at the righteous. Notice the word privily there. They be careful. They watch the person carefully. Watch the person very carefully. No wonder that hymn says, Christians, seek not yet repose. Hack your guidance in Jesse. Thou art in the midst of fools. Watch and pray. It says principalities and power. Gather their unseen array. Waiting for your unguarded hour. That is waiting for your careless hour. Waiting for that time when you are supposed to pray, you are watching television. Waiting for that time when you are fighting your wife, fighting your husband. Waiting for that time when you fall into sin. And when you enter into that unguarded hour. I say, yes, yes, shoot. The thing goes in. It's after the arrow has gone in. Father, I'm sorry, Father, I'm sorry. Father, forgive me, I'm sorry. Father, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I promise, promise I won't do so again. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, but the arrow is already inside. Sin, already. Waiting for your unguarded heart. Watch and pray. The songwriter now says, Watch as if on that alone. Watch as if on that alone lies the issue of the day. Ambushed lies the evil one. Watch and pray. Ambush lies the evil one. So watch and pray. The Yoruba hymn book says, A shoe back on the It's a hunter. It's watch. So watch and pray. So there are arrows for the righteous. The most dangerous ones are fired by witchcraft. When an arrow comes against a person, three things can happen. One, you either receive the arrow, which most people do. Two, it bounces off. Bounces off. And in bouncing off, it can go to the center, it can go anywhere. Three, it can miss you and eat someone else. It misses the person and eats someone else. And this is a serious matter. But the truth is this. Anyone firing an arrow at a true child of God is seeking for trouble. Really, really trouble. Everyone may keep quiet for a while. But when heavens begin to react, it can be terrible. Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is planning to sink in the Red Sea like Pharaoh. Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is seeking to be destroyed by God's angel the way an angel destroyed the army of Sennacherib. Any power firing an arrow at the child of God is seeking to receive the stones that fell into the head of Goliath. 
Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is writing courier letters to substitution, and it will be repl he himself will receive the arrow. Any power firing arrows at the child of God is seeking to be eaten up with, with worms like Herod. The Lord is a man of war. He understands all strategies and policies of the enemy. Maybe you don't know. Our Lord is a mighty and terrible, terrible warrior. He can employ anything to fight for you. He can even employ inanimate objects to terrify and destroy the enemy. Everyone may be watching for a little bit. But once our Lord beckons with one finger, one finger, all celestial and terrestrial hosts are ready to fight. The Bible says, Who had hardened his heart against God and has prospered? When God sets himself against an enemy, the enemy is undone. Because riches cannot save the enemy. Strength cannot save the enemy. In the day of God's anger, riches is not, it's not a defense. Money cannot bribe him. The Lord has always disgraced those who try to rise against his children. He makes one to chase a thousand and two to put ten thousand to flight. He knows what the enemy is discussing in their bed chambers. He knows the thoughts of their hearts. Perhaps you are here this morning and you have been shedding uninvited tears. You close your eyes, you cannot sleep. You have food on the table but no appetite. You see wrong. Not because you are wrong, but because wrong sees you. I have a message for you today. The repeated affliction shall backfire this morning. And every new affliction shall flee. Let me drop a gentle note of warning this morning. Anybody who wants to deal with anything witchcraft, you have to do it without compromise. You have to be violently determined. You have to behave like those who destroyed Jezebel. Jezebel was there on the top of the house. And Jezebel said, throw her down. And he threw her down. You have to be that violent. We are getting ready to pray now. As I told you that this is a short message. But now, I want to look at some scriptures. Plenty of them actually. Pass a few comments on those scriptures. Then we are going to start praying now. Anyone who is present in the service of this morning, you did not come here by chance. You must have come by divine ordination and appointment. In Proverbs chapter 28, verse 10, it's good to note these scriptures very well. Proverbs 28, verse 10. Proverbs 28, verse 10. If you are there, say yes. Whoso caused the righteous to go astray in an evil way, he shall fall himself into his own pit. He shall fall himself into his own pit. But the upright shall have good things in possession. So the Lord is saying that that pit dug for you. They who dug the pit shall fall into that pit. The same Proverbs chapter 26, 26 verse 27. We are looking at principles of dealing with those arrows. In all the scriptures I'm reading, I'm giving you principles. Proverbs 26, 27. Whoso diggeth a pit shall fall therein. And he that rolleth a stone, it will return upon them. There you are. That is, their weapon should catch them. Now, if you go to Deuteronomy chapter 7, Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 15. Deuteronomy 7, 15. It says this. And the Lord will take away from thee all sickness, and will put none of the evil diseases of Egypt which thou rest upon thee. Then listen to what he says. But we lay them upon all them that hate thee. That's what the Bible says. It will not allow the arrow of sickness to come upon you, but it will allow you to come upon your enemies. In the book of Nehemiah, Nehemiah, you find Nehemiah after Ezra, before you get to the book of um, Esther, Nehemiah chapter 4, verse 4. Hear, O our God, for we are despised and 
turn their reproach upon their own head and give them for a prey in the land of captivity. You can see the stand of scriptures. Because almost sometimes when we start praying this prayer, some people say, why is all this in the Bible? This is, this is uh, not, not scriptural. It's not scriptural. That's, that's, that's not scripture you are reading. In Psalm 7, verse 16, Psalm 7, verse 16, it says this, His mischief shall return upon his own head, and his violent dealing shall come down upon his own forehead. That's what the Bible says here. I hope you can read it by yourself. And in Psalm 35, which you read this morning, Psalm 35, verse 8, Psalm 35, verse 8, said, let destruction come upon him at unawares, and let his net that he had eat catch himself. Into that very destruction, let him fall. So the prayer is, let his own net catch him. The one who made the nets said, Let that net now catch him. The Bible also tells us said, no weapon fashioned, formed, prepared, no weapon fashioned against thee. That is, they specially sit down in the laboratory and prepare a special weapon against you. They fashioned it. Say, but no weapon fashioned like that against you shall prosper. So every tongue that shall rise against you in judgment, thou shall condemn. It didn't say thou shall pacify, thou shall beg, thou shall appeal to them. No, every tongue that rises against thee in judgment, that is, every witchcraft judgment against you, thou shall condemn. That's what it says. Didn't say you just tolerate them and let them be talking all the nonsense and rubbish you want to talk. The Bible now says something very serious. Look at the book of Esther, chapter 7. You find Esther after Nehemiah that we read before. Esther, chapter 7, verse 10. Esther 7 10. So they hanged Haman on the gallows. That he had prepared for Mordecai. They hanged a man on the gallows that he had prepared for Mordecai. That is why we used to pray mountain of fire. That any power that wants you to die shall die in your own place. Every a man assigned against you shall die for your sake. Let your amen be loud and clear. So when evil arrows are fired, the strategy of the Almighty is that the weapon that is used against you should fall back on the ones who started the weapon. The evil words that are used against you well, should go back to those who originated it. It is a divine principle for his children. I pray that any incantation you against anyone here shall backfire by fire. Every curse issued against you from any form of coven shall go back to the senders. Every arrow fired against your progress shall backfire. Every assignment of the wicked against you shall acquire acidic violence and go back to the senders. In the name of Jesus, we believers do not send curses to people or arrows, but we have a right. To return those ones sent to us because we did not create the forces it was some people who created forces to destroy daniel in the bible they created a force which they hope would destroy daniel but the force that his enemies created was not only rendered powerless but it went back to destroy them i pray that every arrow fired against your family shall be fired every will plot against you shall go back to the sender and if your amen can be very loud, the bullet of your enemy shall destroy them. You shall destroy them. You shall destroy them. The bullet of your enemy shall destroy them. You shall destroy them. You shall, shall destroy them. In the name of Jesus, a seven fall, amen.
these days a lot of people just sleep and they experience somebody strangulating them on the bed trying to choke them upon the bed as the arrow some tell you they hear voices telling them to do strange things as the arrow a sister was giving testimony at present that in the night she just stood up took off her clothes and was about to walk out into the streets children asleep husband asleep then she heard a voice daughter go back go back it was then her eyes cleared and she saw herself and she was wearing nothing the enemy wanted to throw her into the streets mad if there is anyone here this morning and there's an arrow to make you insane may that arrow of insanity double its power and go back to the center in the name of Jesus a sevenfold amen the amen is not loud enough a sevenfold amen Someone has been happy all of a sudden. A sudden depression comes upon the person. A heaviness. That's the arrow. When the Bible says, It gives beauty for ashes, the oil of joy for money, the garment of presence out of the spirit of heaviness. Now, heaviness has entered. So the person who woke up saying, Praise it, Lord, praise the Lord, praise God, praise God. The mood, everything has now changed. It's an arrow needless fear it's an arrow a pimple on the face something say is leprosy fear needless fear pimple on top of the breast somebody say this is cancer needless fear it's an arrow that is what you call paralytic wind some people just some breeze will blow upon them like this they just go paralyzed may those evil wind go back to the sender Sometimes it's a cold chill at night. Even in a hot room, the temperature of the person just falls. An arrow of witchcraft. Sometimes the head or some parts of the body, they feel heavier than other parts of the body. It's an arrow. Sometimes some parts of the body will be shaking on their own without anybody touching them. It's an arrow. I've seen people they prepare food by themselves not that they bought the food from outside but as they ate the food they were finding insects and parts of a uh, body of uh, tiny tiny animals inside the food the arrow of witchcraft some dream that the air is cut off or they wake up without anybody entering their room they find a part of their air had been cut off some arrow of witchcraft sometimes they send demon idols to people demon idols come to people physically you see them physically come to accost people it's an arrow of witchcraft sometimes they even send snakes live snakes to people sometimes it's spiritual snakes to people it's an arrow of witchcraft sometimes it's heat in the head but you just be hot you don't know what is going on it's the arrow of witchcraft I want somebody in this meeting this morning to get sufficiently angry in the spirit to fight back and fight and win. It's a very serious matter. Sometimes people hear their names being called. Who calls the name? And unfortunately, some answer. Say yes. I say, Mommy, why are you saying yes? Uh, didn't you call me? No. Nobody called you here. And generally, such people die within a few days may any voice calling anyone here from the grave be silenced by fire in the name of jesus let that amen roar like thunder sometimes they feed people with what they will ordinarily not eat they will feed them without food in their dreams some arrow of witchcraft sometimes people dream a female with male organ, male sexual organ, will be sleeping with them, carrying a female face, but having a male sexual organ. 
It's a terrible arrow indeed. Sometimes it's sudden pain in the body. They go to the hospital, they check x ray, check everything, nothing. Sometimes they are prepared an arrow for somebody in the village. And they say, Somebody's dying, somebody's dying. Come home, come home, come home. Only for you to rush down, you find that nobody was sick. And I say, well, It's just a long time we have seen your face. And if you say you should come, you will not come. It's an arrow. People seen themselves inside coffins, seen themselves dining with the dead. It's an arrow of witchcraft. Many who are here this morning, unfortunately, we have been attacked at one time or the other with these weapons. If you were attacked as a baby, it is possible that the arrow is even still in you. If you were attacked before you got born again, it is possible that the arrow is probably still in you. If you are attacked when you were ignorant, it is possible the arrow is still inside. But what you should learn today is to send the arrow back to the senders. You do not have to exercise fear. You have to plead the blood of Jesus as a covering for yourself and begin to demand that the arrows should go back to the senders. I shared with you here many years ago the story of how an occultic man got born again. That occultic man is now a pastor. It was a face my face with kind of accommodation. This occultic man was in one room. The sister was in the room next to him. And the son of the woman was sick. She had one son and the son was sick. It was a strange sickness. So she started praying for the baby. Praying for this child. When she prayed, 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 the child would be okay for a little bit. After some time, the conversion would start again. This woman would start praying, 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 praying. And then the child would relax again. After some time, this child would start again. This woman would pray, 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 pray. Not knowing that by the second room, this occultic man was the one killing the child. He had put a nail somewhere. And when he bangs the nail inside, the child begins to convulse in the other room. And when the woman begins to pray, the force of her prayer will be pushing out the nail, pushing out the nail, pushing out the nail. Then the nail falls down. And the boy says, Mommy, I'm okay. The man takes the nail again, put it back. Bwah! The child starts again. And this battle went on from 7 a.m. in the morning till 5 in the evening. The woman kept praying. And the man kept putting the nail. After some time, the man came out, carried the concussion, knocked the woman's door. Say, Madam, Madam, I have a feeling that your child is not okay. Give him this concussion to drink. If she had accepted it, that would have been the end. She said, Thank you. I don't want. I do not want. For those of you who are still drinking concussions, God have mercy on you. The man now went back to his room. I said, okay, ah, this is enough. This woman is embarrassing me. Now brought out his satanic drum and began to call forth for the face of the woman and her child to kill them on the drum. Their faces were supposed to appear in that drum and they would put a nail through it. And that would have been the end of the two of them. So she prepared the drum, made all the incantations. She was supposed to call their names three times. She called the name first time, no one appeared. She called the name second time. The woman and her child appeared. Brought out his name. He was taken to the drum. Just a split second for him to do that. The face of an old man appeared. Grey hair, smiling, and said, I am the Alpha and Omega. I am the ancient of days. Now pack all your fetish power here together and go to that church over there. Because that woman is my daughter. You cannot kill her, you cannot kill her son. All these powers you have here, you can now see that they are useless. This was how the man surrendered his life to Jesus. Rise up on your feet below. All eyes closed. But you see, if you are here this morning and you are not born again, you have not surrendered your life to Jesus, do so very quickly now very very quickly now by raising up your right hand and say what i'm going to say after so father in the name of jesus i come before you now lord jesus come into my life take control of my life in jesus name amen if you said that short prayer with me immediately we close just find a way to the altar here so that we can pray more with you all eyes closed Obviously, you can see that we're not here to joke. 
we are in for serious business. We are going to start our prayers with this song we sang last. Jump out. Jump out. Evil arrows in my body, in my progress, in my family, they must jump out. We are going to start with that song. And when you are singing it, just open your eyes and begin to do what I'm doing. Whatever I do, you do. As you are singing that song. Because as you are singing that song, it's an order. It's a command. The Bible said, Thou shalt decree a thing, and it shall be established. Thou shalt decree a thing. Jump out, jump out. Jump out, jump out. Evil arrow in my body, jump. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. Hallelujah. Jump out, jump out. Oh, yes, sir. Hallelujah. Jump. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Hallelujah. 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 Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Hallelujah. 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 Oh, yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. close now with a voice that roars like fire and like thunder say I fire back every arrow of witchcraft now in the name of Jesus open your mouth and the Christ Jesus is here something must happen in your life today Barriabo Pasitala. Fire it back. That's why you are here. Aha, aha, aha. This is not a day to negotiate. Louder, 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 louder. We are not here to play. I fire back. Every hour of witchcraft. In the name of Jesus. Aha. (laughs) 
Amen. Uh-huh. You see what is happening now? See what is happening now? That's right. Say arrows of reproach. Arrows of embarrassment. Arrows of limitation. Can you shout those three arrows loud? Sisters, your voices are not loud, you know. Everybody together now. Everybody together again. Jesus Jesus Yes 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 Yes, my Peter Satele Kayaba, Ribo Soponte Kayabo Shantaraba. Yes, Jesus. Jesus name we pray uh-huh. this is wonderful with a louder voice Allah! insulting my faith can you shout that loud backfire in the name of Jesus Continue, continue, continue. Jesus is here. Aha, that's it. That's how to do it. In Jesus' name we pray. Enemies backfire in the name of Jesus, the arrows of envious enemies. Jesus, thank you, Jesus. Jesus name we pray a sevenfold man stretch your right hand towards the heavenlies again say my father put hot coals of fire Fire of complete deliverance upon my hands now. In the name of Jesus, anywhere I smite with my hands, let the arrows go back to the senders. In the name of Jesus, start with your head again three times one, two, three. Go to your chest. One. Look at what is happening over there. Two. Three. Go to your stomach. Close to your belly button. Close to your belly button. One. Two. Three. 
Now go to your back, your back, your back. One, two, three. That woman over there having issues with your womb. Go to your womb area. One. Don't feel sorry for that place. Do it again. One, two, three. Thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Now begin to speak into the womb of this month. Tell it what it should deliver to you. Tell it what it should not deliver. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Lord, shall I say to somebody here that although it looks impossible or unachievable, but that before this year runs to an end, your testimony shall shock your friends and surprise your enemies. Let the amen roar like thunder. Father, I cover your people with the blood of Jesus. As you go into this month, it shall be well with you. The Holy Spirit will change the rules for your sake. The law will arise for your sake in every area. It is written, as soon as they hear of me, they shall obey me. Strangers shall submit themselves unto me. Father, I pray that any stranger contesting for the life of your children, let them be embarrassed and disgraced in the name of Jesus. The arrows that have gone back to the senders today shall never come back to you again. The spirit of Jehovah, which is the everlasting spirit, shall arise and defend you. It is written, the Lord has his way in the wind and the wild wind. I command your way to open. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. time before your feet we thank you because you are our glorious savior and we thank you for the mightiness of the name of the lord we thank you because you are the yoke 
breaker. We thank you because your power is the absolute power. As we gather that another prayer battle, meet each and everyone at the point of their needs in the name of Jesus. Every enemy that has determined that they will not let anyone go. Let them perish in the Red Sea in the name of Jesus. Every pursuing power pursue yourselves in the name of Jesus. Every gathering power against the children of God destroy yourselves in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. A louder amen. If there is another name for this world, it's trouble and battle. Life is a battle. And we all have battles to fight. Some start their battles from the womb. Some start their battles at mid age. Some start their battles at old age. Life is a battle people are fighting all kinds of battles I shared with you many years ago a 75 year old man who took his wife of 70 years old to court seeking for divorce the judge Say, ah, you've been married for how long? He said, over 40 years. The judge said, if you've been married for over 40 years, and you have grown up children and grandchildren, why do you want to break the marriage now? The man said, break it. The old woman at 70 was crying there. Simply because a 24-year-old girl has now captured this 75-year-old man. A girl younger than their last daughter is now scattering the marriage after 40 years. And the old woman could see everything she has worked for being taken away. She started a battle at the old age. This is why I'm going to pray this strange prayer. And let your amen be volcanic. I decree upon your life any battle that has been traveling with you from the womb with a tenfold amen. I command them to die tonight in the name of Jesus. That was last week I was explaining all this to you. But one thing is very certain. It is a dangerous thing to confront a true child of God. Those who have done so in the past, they have had to contend with the Almighty God. Those who have contended with true children of God in the past, they have had cause to regret. Some did not even have time to regret. The Almighty just wipe them off. As people wipe off things from plates. Some of them have been given a red card by heaven to depart from the field of play. Some have been forced to bow to those 
be despised. And so I decree one more time. Your enemies shall bow down to you. 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 In the name of Jesus. This is why I want you to shout that ancient prayer seven times now. That ancient but very effective prayer. So, oh God, arise! And let my enemies be scattered! In the name of Jesus, shout it seven times! Some who have confronted the true children of God, they just receive arrows of torment from God's angels that torment them there night. Some have been eaten up by worms. Some have eaten their own flesh and drank their own blood. Some have been skinned alive and thrown into dungeons. Some have been converted to animals and made to partner with beasts. Some have had their power base cut off and dismantled. I can testify to each of the things that I'm telling you now. Some have had invisible whistle from heaven turning them to mad dogs. Some like Goliath, they have received holes in their forehead. Some have become Victims of their own weapons of war. Some have had their faces smashed in their crystal ball or in their dark mirror. Some have been forced to carry their own load of wickedness. Some have even had forces from heaven throwing stones against them on earth. That's your room, and when pack on one down, pull in one lorry, that's it. So, Ilayah, some I want mirror have been dealt with as written by the psalmist. At if what you want, my boy, get a good sum to saw, let their ways check your normal become dark and slippery. Let the angels of the Lord pursue them day and night. So let their loins shake continuously. Some have had their idols turning against them simply because they decided to attack a true child of God. This is why I want you to pray this prayer. Don't say, I, I think I've prayed this kind of prayer. Before. Pray it under the anointing of prison here tonight. God to attack me.
Thank you, Jesus. Yes, yes, there with so many people. Or that's if you do a colour for home above by putting a concrete. Nick me more on top of their spiritual life. Sorry, be I am praying tonight. Last you move back. I think there is any wonder in that category. But a barrier and you can bell. Any man has put a concrete slab on the soil of the person's life. Sorry, let the concrete crack open. So that good seeds can grow. In the name of Jesus. Let our amen rule like thunder. And this is why I want you to pray this prayer. We pray last week again. Let your voice be the loudest as you pray this prayer. Wicked powers hiding behind the pandemic to attack me. Remain standing and silent. Don't say anything. You have addressed some powers. You address them. Father, it is written that the strangers shall fade away and they shall be afraid out of their close places. Any stranger any agent that has entered into anyone's life during this pandemic period. I know you are hiding there, but you can't hide anymore. For the fire of God is upon you, and you must depart from your hiding place. Let the power begin to move now. Let the strangers begin to depart from the hiding place. Depart, 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 depart from your hiding place. Depart from your hiding place. In the name of Jesus. Powers. Assigned to press down your head to prevent that head from rising. Right there where you are. The fire of God is coming upon you. And those powers have been taken out. That's number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number Get out. Jade. Let her go. Vile. Get out. Jade. Let him go. For In the name of Jesus. Shout this loud and clear. Battles in my life. I decide to disgrace me. What are you waiting for? In the name of Jesus. Deal with that battle now. Hey, don't do it. Don't do it.
Open your mouth, 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 open your mouth. Don't negotiate. But capote seta. Rimo koton de kayaba. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. So the prayers we're going to pray now. When you shout it once, you convert it to machine gun prayers. Don't let anybody's voice be louder than yours. Can you shout this loud and clear? Voices of my glory. Stolen by the enemy. Then we pray. The machine gun for that one is I recover you by fire. I recover you by fire. I recover you by fire. That's how to pray machine gun prayers. Can you shout this loud and clear? Oh God, arise! Oh Let my stubborn enemies bury themselves. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Ben. Continue, continue, continue. What you at the continue, continue, continue at the swat? Bapo Catella Kaya Boshendera Boko Sotonda Yaba. Jesus, then we pray. If you are a student here, raise your right hand to the evilest. Father, let your power flow into this hand. Let this hand carry the fire power. In the name of Jesus. If you are a student here, as I count seven, smite your head vigorously. There are some of you that have been attacked by deep polygamous witchcraft. I can smite that head vigorously. One, any, two, eighty. See what is happening again. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Be released. to select. Be released. Yes. Everybody to select. I'm moving about in the head. Oh, oh, don't walk in it. Come on. On that day. Pass. Any other swallow in my favor. Don't be on the road. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say satanic bullets. Oh, type of satanic. This is personal prayer now. Adura. So if you if you love yourself, pray it very well. Satanic bullet. And your type of satanic. Lodging in my body. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus.
Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to the name of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. As you hold the water, pray this prayers from your heart. Voices of thou shall not prosper. You are a liar. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and say, Line In Jesus' name, we pray. If you don't like this prayer, you, you, you may not pray it. But if I wear your shoes, I will pray them with fire. Satanic priests on the payroll of my enemies. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers commanding my glory to die. Don't pass your focus. Your time is on. Stretch your right hand towards this altar. Father, let your healing power, your deliverance anointing, overshadow these hands. Use them as instrument of healing and breakthrough. In Jesus' name we pray. If you have any infirmity in any part of your body, smite it 21 times, shouting, Go back to your senders. Let's go! Oh, yeah! Do it well. Jesus. Yes. Jesus. Yes. Jesus. Yes. That's the power of God moving from the top of your head to the sole of your feet. Amen. Amen. Check your body now. Begin to do what you could not do before. If you cannot use your legs, use your legs. If you cannot see clearly, begin to see clearly. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Bring out your manna water and your oil now. Father, we thank you for these faith materials. The manna, water, and the oil. Let your glory, your power, your mightiness, your anointing flow into these materials in the name of Jesus. I sanctify, consecrate, dedicate this water and this oil in the name of the Father, the name of the Son, the name of the Holy Spirit. Anointing of ease. Enter into this water in the name of Jesus. Power of God.
God. Glory to the water in the name of Jesus. Fire of God. Glory to the water and the oil in the name of Jesus. To you, Father, be the glory. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. The Lord blesses you from Zion. Make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The prayer request, our Lord, answer them by fire. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. And let us share the grace in fellowship. Seven Goliath destroying Hallelujah. Let's go. Hallelujah. Mate. Control of every situation, mother strong. Oh, my mind, oh, yeah. Oh, Lord Jesus, yeah. sing it loud and clear. And sing to the Father, 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 Blessed Holy Spirit, And Holy Spirit, 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 Blessed be the Lord, God Almighty, Hallelujah. Blessed be the Lord God Almighty, Hallelujah, who reigns forever. Sisters alone, blessed be the
Brothers, sing it loud and clear. Blessed be the Lord, Lord, Lord Almighty. Hallelujah. Who was at his and his to call? Blessed be the Lord, Lord. Father, we thank you for another gathering of palm of changes. And we praise your holy name for your people you have brought here this morning in order to bless them. We thank you because your word says blessings abound where you reign. We give you praise. Thank you, Lord, because no one is here today by chance. Those who are here are here by divine appointment. We thank you for your power, which is the everlasting power. We thank you because when you arise, your enemies, as a matter of necessity, must scatter. And we thank you because we know that this morning, you will meet each and every one at the point of their need. We we'll give you praise. Father, we are gathered here before you. Let a decree come forth from heaven. On behalf of everyone gathered here this morning. And let that decree bring forth uncommon testimonies to everyone. In the name of Jesus. Now without any accompaniment. Everyone here, the more, the faster you want the Lord to answer your prayer today. Now the louder you should sing this song. from heaven in the name of Jesus and as many people as are here this morning and they have been under pursuit all their lives beginning from this morning pursue your pursuers pursue your pursuers pursue your pursuers in the name of Jesus any power that does not want to let anyone here go let those powers be destroyed this morning in the name of Jesus Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Shout it loud, hallelujah. Before you sit down, I'd like you to prophesy into the life of three persons. Look at somebody straight in the eye. Say, the enemy designed to destroy you shall die in your place. In the name of Jesus. Say to three persons. Professor to the life of three persons. Amen. Now professor to the life of three persons again. Say for the rest of this year. And all your days. Tragedy shall not know your address. In the name of Jesus. Say to three persons. Shout it loud, hallelujah. Let's have a seat, God bless you. This morning's message and prayer, beloved, is something we have to do with all the aggression God has given to us. It will be a tragedy if we keep quiet when the divine rain is falling. 
what the Lord wants us to deal with here this morning before we go, and which is going to form the topic of this message, is what I call sending back evil arrows. Sending back evil arrows. Can you say that and let me hear you? Let's look into some scriptures very quickly so that you know where we are this morning. And let me tell you, that this is a message that has no mercy on the enemy. And the prayers today shall show no mercy to every enemy of our souls. I know there is somebody here this morning that your enemies shall cry. To that person, shout a loud hallelujah. I know there is somebody here this morning too, who shall have the last laugh over all the enemies. If you are that person, shout it loud, hallelujah. Psalm 7. Look at what it says in verse 16. Psalm 7, verse 16. Are we there? It says this. His mischief shall return upon his own head. I, it was, it's not Dr. Luca that wrote that one. It's inside the Bible. His mischief shall return upon his own head. And his violent dealing shall come down upon his own part. That's what the Bible says. Look at verse 15. He made a pit and digged it and is falling into the ditch which he made. Open straight to Psalm 35 verse 8. Psalm 35 verse 8. He says, let destruction come upon him at unawares, and let his net that he had eat catch himself. Into that very destruction let him fall. All this is talking about sending back evil arrows. Go straight back to the book of Nehemiah. You find your Nehemiah after Esther and after Job. Nehemiah chapter 4, verse 4. So let's show you this once in scripture. So you won't say, what kind of doctrine are they preaching here today? Nehemiah 4, 4. Hear our God, for we are despised, and turn their reproach upon their own head. And give them for a prey in the land of captivity. In the same Nehemiah chapter 13, verse 2, Nehemiah 13, 2, look at something else God can do. Because they met not the children of Israel with bread and with water, but hired Balaam against them, that he should curse them. I will be our God turned the curse into a blessing. I pray that every curse issued against your life shall be converted to blessings. It shall be converted, it shall be converted, it shall be converted to blessings. In the name of Jesus. Now go right back to the book of Esther. Esther chapter 7, verse 10. Esther 7, 10. Note these scriptures very well. Esther 7, 10. So, they hanged Haman on the gallows that he had prepared for Mordecai. What? The, is, the instrument that it prepared against Mordecai backfired. This is what has happened there in scripture. Something happened in South Africa. It's an example of what we're talking about this morning. It was in the news. An armed robber was mistakenly killed by his own gang member. They went to steal somewhere and his own colleagues shot him down. That's what they call sending back evil arrows. And I think it was about a month ago or so, somebody was giving a testimony at the headquarters. He said he came for one of our services. And the Lord said, there is somebody here, the enemy wants to kill you, but that arrow has backfired. So he said that day they were going and some armed robbers accosted them. And he tried to shoot at this person. And the gun refused to walk. I said, well, ah, but I've just used this gun. Why is it not working now? He aimed the gun at this person and was trying to shoot it, but the gun refused to cooperate. But while he was fiddling around with the gun, the gun went off and blew off his own hand, giving that person an opportunity to run away. 
I pray that the bullets of your enemies shall destroy them. If I were in your shoes, my amen would be loud and clear. I also pray that every evil plan against your progress shall return to the sender. You know, God told King Jehoshaphat, so don't worry, say these enemies that are coming against you, by the same way in which they came, by that same way they shall go back. And by the time they were going back, they went back in scattered pieces. The Bible says the last days will be characterized by intensive satanic revival. Revelation 12, 12 tells us that war unto the earth and unto the sea. For the devil has come against you in great wrath, knowing that he hath but a short time. The Bible makes us to understand that the wicked will fire arrows at the righteous. That one is very clear from scripture. And you'll be very naive and very foolish to believe that you no one is interested in attacking your life. It will be very naive and stupid for you to say, I don't have enemies. God himself has enemies. In Psalm 11 verse 2, Psalm 11 verse 2 tells us, For lo, the wicked bend their bow, they make ready their arrow upon the string, that they may privily shoot at the upright in heart. The Bible tells us that arrows shall be fired at the righteous. I knew a girl who went to the examination hall. She had studied, she had read, she had prepared. And everything was okay. They gave them the question papers. She looked at the question paper. She felt that it's an exam she could pass very well. But as she took a pen and wanted to start writing, any time she touched that pen, there would be violent vibration in her hands. And she could not write anything until the examination was over. An arrow was fired into her hand. The Bible also tells us about the arrows that fly by noonday. The Bible makes us to understand that we are not to live in this world as someone does not understand the world where he or she is. When wicked arrows are fired against a person, three things may happen. The arrows may enter into the person's life. And that's what happened in most cases. Arrows may bounce off. The third thing is that the arrow may miss the person and eat another person. When arrows are fired like this, what God does for his people is what is sometimes what what sometimes happens is what you find in Proverbs eleven eight. This is what God sometimes does for his people when arrows are fired like this. In Proverbs eleven eight. The Bible says the righteous is delivered out of trouble and the wicked commit in his stead. When evil is dispatched like this, the Lord removes the righteous, replaces the righteous with another person. Just like the Bible says that God can give life for your life. It's important for you to know how to send back evil arrows back to the sender. Many weapons and arrows of darkness are being used today. And the attack of the enemy against us may be so terrible that they don't want to mind how many casualties are suffered. These are not days to be ice cream Christians. There are many weapons and arrows of the enemy operating in so many lives these days. You find people being choked on their beds. People hear voices from the spirit world. Insanity is on the rise now. And most of them claim to be hearing voices. A sudden depression comes upon a very happy person, all of a sudden the person becomes sad. Some suffer from needless fear. Some just have a, some paralytic wind blow upon them, and then before you say Jesus is Lord, there is trouble. Some complain of cold chill at night in a hot room. There are some, they just feel that their heads are becoming heavier and heavier and heavier, and the head, there is no extra weight on that head. Some have taking food and they found strange items in the food. Some have found insects, all kinds of things in the food and they didn't know it got there. There have been cases of people who slept and when they woke up, something has been cut off from their body. It's so terrible now that they even send physical idols to people. People actually, they are in their room and this physical object moves in. They do all kinds of things to people. People stay in locked rooms with windows and not open. All of a sudden, you find bats and birds inside the room. They send physical and spiritual snakes to people. Some complain about heat in the head or as if wind is blowing through the head. It's the arrow of darkness. 
Some complain of people calling their name at night from the sleep. Many dream and what they would normally, ordinarily don't eat. They will force feed them with those things in their dreams. You find sisters complaining of being molested sexually in the dream by a female with male reproductive organs. They send emergency force messages to people and they send this feeling of lifelessness onto people. We are here this morning to do a particular operation to return all these arrows, conscious or unconscious arrows, back to wherever they came from. Many here today have been attacked at one time or the other by these evil weapons. If you were attacked when you were a baby and you didn't do anything about it, the, those arrows are probably still in you now. If you were attacked before you got born again and you are not aware there is an arrow, the arrow is probably still in you there. If you were attacked when you were ignorant and you didn't know what to do, the arrow is probably still in you now. But something I know will happen today is this. As many arrows that have been planted into the life of the righteous shall go back to the senders in the name of Jesus. With years and years of experience in prayer, evangelism, deliverance, and ministrations, we have been able to identify different kinds of arrows that we have come across. I will tell you the major ones that are prepared and fired into people's lives. I want you to understand something. When someone is so wicked and disobedient as to fling witchcraft curses, witchcraft arrows on people, they must be stopped. We can't just wait and let them do whatever they want to do. They have to be stopped. I remember something that happened many years back. We were at a crusade somewhere at Evans Square in Yaba. And as the crusade was going, all of a sudden, thunderstruck. The microphone became practically ashes. And the whole of the crusade went into darkness. But the man of God there knew what to do. He shouted in his voice, everybody stand up. And they stood up. And he said, what has happened now is an hour of darkness. He said, all of you will now raise up your voices. And say, evil arrows, go back to your sender. They prayed like mad prophets at that crusade. The light came back on. They now started using megaphones. A few minutes to that time, a man was rushed into the crusade. I have never seen that kind of thing before. And I don't want to see it again. This man, it was as if somebody came to him and used knife to cut off the whole of his skin and put his skin on the floor. They brought him on a wheelbarrow. He was the head of the native doctors in that area. He was the one that sent the arrow. So when the believers now said, back to the senders, the arrow that he sent, he had no power to contain it. When you command bad prayers, evil arrows that are against you to return to their chest, they are in trouble. When you return the arrows back to the senders, you were not the one that initiated it, but you are merely sending it back to the originator. Satanic agents are normally afraid when their arrows are sent back to them. But then is the principle of scripture. A man died in the place of Mordecai. Those who arranged for Daniel to be put in lions then were the ones who were eaten by the lions. Those who threw Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego into the fire were the ones who were destroyed by the fire. The giant sword that Goliath brought to kill David was the same sword they used to cut off his head. I pray that this morning before you leave this place, your Goliath shall destroy itself. In the name of Jesus. The enemy sends arrows to people. There is arrow of disfavor. There is arrow of satanic anger. Just like it happened to Moses when he was about to enter the promised land. There is arrow of failure. There is arrow of unexplainable health problems. There is arrow of academic and career frustration. There is arrow of almost dear or near success syndrome. There is arrow of joblessness. There is arrow of untimely death. There is arrow of vagabond life. There is arrow of insanity. There is arrow of poverty. There is arrow of building and not living inside. There is arrow of marital distress. There is arrow of suicidal tendencies. There is arrow of addictions. There is arrow of unexplainable gynecological problems. There is chain problems, arrow of chain problems. There is arrow of confusion. 
There is out of being disgraced, out of breakthrough. There is out of infirmities. There is out of demotion. The hour of hardship. There is hour of dream oppression. There is hour of strange accidents. There is an hour of mark of hatred. We just hate you without any cause. There is hour of constant spiritual attack. There is hour of torment. No wonder the Bible talks about the fiery darts of the enemy. There is hour of paralysis. There is hour of attack on one's children. There is hour of business failure. There is hour of tragedy. There is hour of spiritual blindness. There is hour of sin but not attaining. There is hour of strange human. The hour of strange human can be fired into the life of a man. There is hour of bad houses. There is hour of stagnancy. There is hour of devourers. There is hour of satanic delay. There is hour of buried talents and virtues. There is hour of disappearance of helpers. There is hour of having to fight hard and fight hard before you get anything done. There is hour of just always in the wrong position, wrong position. There is hour of death. There is hour of prayer paralysis. There is hour of evil diversion. There is hour of bewitchment. There is hour of gradual dispossession. There is hour of profit starvation. There is hour of unexplainable loss of very good things. There is the hour of homelessness. The hour of leaking pocket. There is hour of success manipulation. There is hour of drug dependence. There is hour of shame. There is hour of fruitless efforts. So the enemy has prepared his arrows and is firing it at the righteous. What do you do to send back these arrows? The first thing to do is to plead the blood of Jesus. You plead the blood of Jesus. And you have to try and learn the blood scriptures. All the scriptures that have to do with the blood of Jesus. The second thing you should do is to learn warfare prayers. And that will involve you to learning warfare scriptures. The third thing you should do is to learn to send the arrows back to the senders. When there is an arrow in place and it's not out yet, God in his mercy, who does not want his people to be destroyed, comes to them sometimes in their dreams and be showing them things to indicate that there is something you should address. So all the dreams of properties being carried away by flood is indication of an arrow. All the dreams of walking in slippery ground is, is an indication of arrows. All the dreams of the cap or the heart being blown away is an indication that there is an arrow in, in, in place. All the dream of things being stolen away from you is an indication that there is an arrow. All the dreams of your name missing from important list shows that there is an arrow in place. Dreams of counting pennies and counting coins, when you should be counting paper notes, is an indication that there is an arrow. All the dreams of giving out money to people you don't know is an indication that there is an arrow. All those injection dreams is an indication that there is an arrow. All the dreams of picking eggs and picking rotting things is an indication that there is an arrow. When God begins to show you this kind of troublous dreams, He is telling you there is something in place you need to address you have not addressed. And once some dreams begin to repeat and repeat and repeat themselves, what God is telling you that is that there is still a trouble you have not solved. We have work to do here this morning to force the arrows of darkness to go back to where they came from. As we said we had many years ago, and we are on the altar like this. Men of God were on the altar. It was an open air crusade. And as the message was going on, Right down, down below, some men gathered. I could see them. They gathered in a circle. They were doing something inside that circle. Whatever they were doing, when they finished, something just rose up from their middle and began to trans travel far, fast to the pulpit. And I saw it coming. I saw it coming. When it was about to get to the pulpit, it distributed itself to as many men of God as were there. But as the thing was about to reach the altar, the thing made a roundabout turn. I started going back. I was still watching. I was watching. The men had not dispersed. The thing struck them where they were. Many fell down, couldn't move. Some ran away. I pray, beloved, that every power assigned to destroy you,
shall destroy it serve in the name of Jesus. I remember that brother who used to preach every morning in a particular location. He didn't know that he was annoying some powers. So one day all the witch doctors, the native doctors gathered together in that area. And the agenda was to destroy this brother. They wanted to kill him. So they gathered. So this man who is disturbing us every morning must be destroyed. So they prepared their juju, their magic. It was like a drum. The face of a drum. The idea is that they will call the brother. His face will appear on the surface of the drum. And then they will stick a knife through that drum. And the brother will bleed to death. They brought the best expert to come and do it. I pray that any satanic expert assigned against you shall be destroyed in the name of Jesus. They brought the experts. So he started his incantations. He was supposed to call the brother's name three times. He called him the first time. No face appeared. He called him a second time. No face appeared. He called the third time. The brother's face appeared. And they brought out their knife. As, as it remained just a split second for that knife to touch the drum, the face changed to the face of the man with the knife. And it happened so quickly, he could not stop. He put a knife through his own face and he fell down on the floor. I pray at any power observing your face in a mirror in order to destroy you, they shall be put to shame in the name of Jesus. Rise up on your feet now, beloved. The time has now come when we should send back these arrows back to the sender. It will be a tragedy if you go home from this meeting with any arrow in your life. But the anointing to send those things back to the senders is already all over this place. All eyes closed. But you see, if you are here this morning and you are not born again, you have not surrendered your life to Jesus, you cannot send back any evil arrow. So wherever you are, while all eyes are closed, you say, Pastor, I want to surrender my life to Jesus. Just leave that seat very quickly and run to the front here. Very quickly, very quickly. Don't waste time. Jesus is waiting for you here. Those of you at the front, I congratulate you. Taking the most important decision in life. Close your eyes. Bow down your heads. And say what I'm going to say after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. As from today, I say bye-bye to the devil. I enter into the kingdom of life. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. I'm going to pray with you now. Father, I thank you for these your children here who have taken this very, very important decision. I pray that it shall be well with you. And the Lord will keep you standing by his power. He will do great and marvelous things for you. Today that you have surrendered your life to Jesus, every arrow of darkness shall be disgraced. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Right there where you are, our counselors will discuss with you. The rest of us, let's sit down and quietly confess our sins to the Lord. Any sin that will hinder you from receiving mighty deliverance today, 
ask the Lord to forgive you. Tell him you don't want to go home the same. Tell him you want his power upon your life. Do so now. Let's rise up on our feet now. As we begin to pray these prayers, many kinds of things will begin to happen all at the same time. I want you to pray with concentration, with boiling anger. Maybe you've been attacked. Your family has been attacked. Your children have been attacked. Your career has been attacked. Your spiritual life has been attacked. You have a wonderful opportunity to send these arrows back to wherever they came from. As we begin to pray this first prayer, I want you to pray now. There are people here that familiar spirits have fired arrows into their lives to make sure that they die this year. 
These people are between the ages of 40 and 43. As we start prayer now, the arrows will go back to the senders. As you pray this prayer through, if you are that person that the enemy fired an arrow into your leg, and the leg is swelling like balloon, all of a sudden you feel the touch of the power of God upon that leg, and it will return to the normal size. As many people as are here that have the arrows of paralysis and stroke fired against them, the arrows of chronic arthritis, the arrows of internal rottenness, the arrows of cancer, all these arrows shall vanish immediately, for they shall go back to the senders. Now you will shout this louder than anyone here. You shout it loud and clear. Don't allow anybody's voice to overshadow your own. As you decree this with a commanding tone. Arrows of darkness! A sign against me. Hear the word of the Lord. Gather together. That's the first command. Let's gather all the arrows. Sisters, are you here this morning? Sisters, pray. Arrows of darkness are signed against me. Hear the word of the Lord. Gather in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to gather them. Gather them together. Masika poya bo shendera bo kotora ba santa. Open your mouth and declare it. Masopola kaya bo shendera boka. In Jesus' name we pray. <laughs> All right. We have to do it one more time. There are people here, there are things the enemy have planted in your body now. The Bible calls them strangers. You notice they move about in the body. You notice they come to choke your heart. It's because of those kind of people who want to pray this prayer again. Arrows of darkness are signed against me. Hear the word of the Lord. God, ah! in the name of Jesus, open your mouth and declare it. Gather them together. Something is happening already. Masepo koya bo shendera bo kopola kaya ba. Deribo soponda kaya bo shendera ba kaya ba. Ya karibo soponde ke ya bo shentera ba kaya ba. Aha, aha, aha. It's happening now, it's happening now, it's happening now. In Jesus' name we pray. Silence. Silence, beloved. Many things are happening here. Yes. There are some seven persons. Who are receiving some really special deliverance where they are. That's right. Let the legs be released. Let the ties be released. Let the womb be released. Let the stomach be released. Let the heart be released. Let the liver be released. Let the kidney be released. Let the eyes be released. Let the head be released. Let the backbone be released. In the name of Jesus. Aha. Aha. You will not pray the second prayer like this in this very aggressive song. Now that you've gathered the arrows together, it's now for them to get the second instruction. And the instruction is in this song, which I want you to sing like fire and like thunder. Not allow anybody's voice to overshadow your voice. Sing it like a warrior. Sing it from your heart. Sing it with faith, believing that as you are saying it, that is happening like that. Are you ready? Evil arrows go back to your evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. 
In Jesus' name. Oh, evil arrows. Oh, yes. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. In Jesus' name. Go back to your sender. Go back to your sender. Go back to your senders. Go back to your senders. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. Evil arrows. In Jesus' name, man. Aha. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Maso kapo ya boshende rabo kota rabo sanda. Ribo soponde ke ya boshente raba. Nakatonda ka ya boshente raba. Aha, aha. Amen. If you came here with any infirmity, this is the time to lay your hands on that place as we pray the first arrows back to the senders. Father, as we raise up our voices now, let your healing power begin to take place. Let every arrow of infirmity go back to the senders. Let there be no infirmity that will remain in place. In the name of Jesus, shout this after me with boiling anger. Arrows of infirmity backfire in the name of Jesus. Let them backfire now in the name of Jesus. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Receive the touch of the healing power. Of God, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name, we pray. Check your body now. Do what you cannot do before. Check your body now. The powers that have been ringing. Evil bells in one ear has now been silenced. This terrible medical report has now been silenced. The terrible skin disease has been wiped away. The swellings in the body have been melted away by the power of God. The heaviness in the head, the heaviness by the neck has been melted away by the power of God. Check your body very well. Things are happening all over the place. Aha. This is the, the first arrow is the arrow of the That's right. The one on that child too. The arrows in the life of that child is going right back to the senders. Just check the child. Check the child. The arrow is going back to the senders. The arrows of unexplainable flow of blood has gone back to the senders. The arrows of not being able to bend has been sent back to the senders. Look at what is happening over there. Look at what is happening over there. I see a woman at the back of that place. You had a dream that you were thrown into the well. The power of God is bringing you out of the well that the enemy has thrown you inside. Thank you, Jesus. If you check your body now and you find that you have been healed, quietly find a way to the altar here so that we can pray with you the enemy we don't bring back the problem quietly find your way to the altar here we are praying against the second arrow can you shout this louder than anyone here arrows of untimely death is that the loudest you can shout is backfire in the name of Jesus Arrows of untimely death. Backfire, 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 backfire. 
In the name of Jesus. Bosetekeye boshende rabo koporaba. Aha, 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 aha. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Everybody will shout this third one loud and clear. Arrows of poverty. Backfire. In the name of Jesus. Masika poya bo shendera bo kotendera ba. Bakatora bo sopola kaya ba. There must be a backfiring effect. Enough is enough. Receive your deliverance. Receive it, receive it, receive it. Receive it, receive it. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. God is touching the eyes of somebody and also the legs of somebody that they say had a, tr- had a problem. Problem is being melted away from that leg. Someone here, the enemy has been stealing from you since you were born. In fact, you came to this program from somewhere else. The enemy has been stealing from you. That arrow of loss has come back to the senders. Shout this louder than anyone at this meeting. Arrows of witchcraft. Black fire. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Aha. 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 Oh, Jesus. Begin to move. In your power. Move. Move in your power. Move in your power. Move in your power. Jesus. Jesus. Something is happening over there. That's right. In Jesus' name we pray. Silence once again. Just. Look at what is happening. As many people as are here this morning, and as an arrow of witchcraft in the body, the power of God is coming upon you where you are, and that yoke is broken completely. That's the first person. Number two, number three, number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight, number nine, number ten, number eleven, number twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yes, it's happening all over the place. Aha. Amen. This prayer, don't say, I don't think it concerns me. Pray it anyway. Arrows of failure. My life is not your candidate. Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Amongst the people, by the power of the Holy Ghost, by the power of the Holy Ghost, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. This is very interesting. Look at what is happening here this morning. The next arrow that should go back to the senders. Don't joke with that one too. Hmm. Arrows of failure at the edge of success. Can you shout it louder than anyone here? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. I refuse to fail at the edge of success. 
Jesus. Musepe kete po ya boka. Kariyo noko saponde ke ya bo shente ya ba. Mana rebo sa. Marna rebo se pia. Mana rebo ko poda ka. Mana rebo se pia le katana. Bo se tende ke ya bo shente. Yes. Open your mouth, open your mouth. Jesus is here. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. And what is receiving a new organ in the body? An organ that the enemy has destroyed. A new one is coming into place. Somebody here, the Lord is ushering you into great wealth. Because the, the owners of evil load have carried their load now. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Aha. 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 Yes. You, the arrows of lump in the breast, come out now. And go back to your senders. In the name of Jesus. You shall not die but live. To declare the works of God. Now, sister, check yourself. When the problem has vanished, let's find a way to the altar here. Thank you, Jesus. This next arrow, we want to send him back three hot times. Let nobody sit down now. Not at this time. Arrows of answered wickedness. Backfire. In the name of Jesus. Oh yes. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Yes, 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 yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and pray it again. Aha, 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 aha. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and pray it again. Yes, the must backfire. In Jesus' name we pray. Aha. So many things are happening. Now, say this. Evil loads are signed against my life. Hear the word of the Lord. God. In the name of Jesus, command evil loads to gather. They must go back to the senders today. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Aha, now that the loads are here. Say, owners of the evil Lord. Carry your Lord by fire. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. They must carry their loads. In Jesus. Name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Now, if you have ever been attacked in your dream, whether it's happening now, it has happened before, this is the time to send back those arrows. Arrows of dream attacks. 
backfire in the name of Jesus. Yes. Something is happening, something is happening. I will subdue my attacks by fire, by fire, by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Now pick a song of praises where you are. And begin to sing it loud and clear. To the King of Kings and to the Lord of Lords. What a mighty God we serve. Glorious in holiness, powerful in praises, doing wonders. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Father, I thank you for this, your children at the front here. And I thank you for all the signs and wonders you have done here today and the ones you are yet to do. Father, I cover the signs and wonders and the miracles with the blood of Jesus. And I decree that your miracle shall be permanent. Jesus, mighty name we pray. You may go back to your seat and apart from those who have interviewed there. Glory be to the name of Jesus. But if you have received an outstanding testimony, don't go back. Make sure you talk to somebody so that the devil will not bring it back upon your life. Thank you, Jesus. If you believe the Lord has touched you here this morning, shout it loud, hallelujah. Let's pray these prayers for our country, Nigeria. Say this loud and clear. Every agent of darkness assigned against Nigeria scattered in the name of Jesus. Let's open our mouth and declare it. In Jesus' name we pray. So every power assigned to cause confusion in this country, we bury you now. In the name of Jesus. Powers are assigned to cause confusion in this nation. We bury you now. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, so, O oh, Prince of Peace, reign in Nigeria. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and declare that one too. In Jesus' name we pray. Lay your right hand on your head now. Henceforth, no evil arrow shall locate my head. It, it is to your own advantage, beloved, to shout that prayer with holy anger. Henceforth, no evil arrow shall locate my head. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say thank you, Jesus. These 21 prophetic prayers. The louder your amen, the faster your breakthroughs. If you say amen to these 21 prayers, and your voice goes away, but you receive your breakthrough, you have made a powerful bargain. I decree by the decree of heavens that every buried greatness of your father's house shall resurrect in your life. In the name of Jesus. It shall resurrect in your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I decree by the power of God that the Almighty God will over answer your prayers of breakthrough. He shall over answer, he shall over answer, he shall over answer, he shall over answer. In the name of Jesus, I decree by the power of God, 
and by the bulldozing power of the Holy Ghost, every obstacle on your way of greatness, I command them to die in the name of Jesus. 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 I decree that whether it is convenient for the enemy or not, God shall be God in all your situations. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare by the power of God that if the enemy has placed your hand on the program of failure, take your hands off in the name of Jesus. Take your hands off in the name of Jesus. I pray that the vulture of your father's house planning to feed on the carcass of your destiny shall die. The vulture shall die. The vulture shall die. In the name of Jesus, I decree that for the rest of this year, every tragedy left in the year shall not include yourself or your family. In the name of Jesus, the oil of breakthroughs, the oil of gladness, the oil of favor assigned to your head shall not run dry. It shall not run dry. In the name of Jesus, any pattern of darkness that has enveloped your life shall be broken. 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 In the name of Jesus, every good thing the Lord has deposited into your life shall manifest by fire. Shall manifest by fire. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord your God shall make the right people to help you at the right time. In the right place. In the name of Jesus. Every curse issued against you. I decree that they will be converted to blessings. In the name of Jesus. Whatever the enemy is planning to be your worst time. Shall be converted to your best time. In the name of Jesus. I decree by the decree of heaven. That because of you. Your family shall not know poverty. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I decree that the rest of this year shall be a time of uncommon breakthroughs for you. In the name of Jesus, I pray that you shall not struggle to be recognized. Your God shall announce you. 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 In the name of Jesus, I decree by the power of God that the son of your life shall not listen to the voice of witchcraft. The son of your life shall arise and shine in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The power of God shall single you out for honor. In the name of Jesus. The power of God that has no respect for impossibility shall swallow up your problems. And I decree that every grip of darkness upon your life shall be broken. In the name of Jesus. I decree by the power of God that your God shall arise. Your story shall change. Your God shall arise. Your story shall change. Your God shall arise. Your story shall change. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Listen, the Lord has designed this month to make many people multimillionaires. This month. All you need to do where you are now is to make a secret vow with the Lord, between you and the Lord. That if he will carry out his own part of the contract, this is what you will do for the Lord too. Don't say, but I don't have anything that I want to do now. This is our, an arena of faith and uncommon breakthrough. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Aha. Yes, the angels of answered prayers, they are already working on people who are here today. I congratulate you for coming here today. His hand, which is a mighty hand, is already upon you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
I'm bold, I'm strong, for the Lord my God is with me. I'm bold, I'm strong, for the Lord my God is with me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Lord, this day, because I walk in faith and victory, because I walk in faith and victory. For the Lord, my God, is me. Sing it loud and clear. I'm bold. I'm bold. I'm bold. For the Lord, my God, is with me. I'm bold. I'm stronger. For the Lord, my God, is with me. Hallelujah. I am not afraid. Hallelujah. I am not dismayed. Because I want to for the Lord, for the Lord, my Lord is Sing it again loud and clear. I'm I'm for the Lord, my God is I'm born, I'm stronger. For the Lord, my God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because I walk in faith and victory. Because I walk in faith and victory. For the Lord, my God, is with me. Shout hallelujah. Say thank you, Jesus. Now listen very, very carefully to this spiritual announcement. As many vehicles as you have, if you have a car or a vehicle, make sure within the next 48 hours, you anoint them with oil. Do you understand? Within the next 48 hours, don't give it to somebody else to do. Go there yourself and anoint them with oil. For compassion complete shield and protection. And you say, I anoint you by the power in the blood of Jesus. Amen. Send this message across to other believers or your family members. Glory be to the name of Jesus. So that all the agenda of the enemy will be frustrated. Let us share the grace in fellowship. Shout hallelujah. Father, we thank you for this morning. We praise your only name because you are the God of righteousness and power. We thank you because your power is the absolute power. What a mighty God we serve. Your power is the only power that no man can contest. Your power is the empirical power. The power that has no respect for geographical location. The power that has no respect for impossibility. Accept our thanks in Jesus. Name. This morning, everyone gathered here. Let the power of deliverance of heaven overshadow every life in the name of Jesus. Your word says, But upon Mount Zion there shall be deliverance and holiness, and the children of Jacob shall possess their possession. I decree upon you right there where you are. That the deliverance that will make you possess your possession should begin to manifest in your life now. Receive it, 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 That does not want to let anyone go. Whatever covenant is keeping that power in place, I command the covenant to be broken by fire. In the name of Jesus, let the power of God begin to move to cut off every ladder of darkness. 
to you father be the glory in jesus mighty name we pray shout it loud amen obviously god bless you listen to this short message carefully i don't even know whether it's a message but listen to it very very carefully the year is running to an end now and as usual when the year is running to an end like this the enemy intensifies activities in order to balance the account for the year i'm praying that every balancing of the account of the enemy will not prosper in your life and any part that wants you to cry shall be disgraced violently and any tragedy left in the year it is minus you and your family let your amen be loud and clear let your amen be loud and clear dealing with witchcraft arrows dealing with witchcraft arrows please listen to this short message carefully listen carefully you don't have to believe what i'm saying you may even think they're all superstitious you say lie but i know what i'm talking about amen so please listen very very carefully there is an entity known as arrows of darkness they exist whether you believe it or not does not matter they exist there are arrows of darkness i have seen it manifested i have seen many examples countless number of examples that's the first fact to understand i shared with you here before something that happened in my former church that my former church we don't pray much we dance more we take about 10 offering per service and in the offering there will be no usher you have to dance to the front 10 times and dance back to your seat so you are always dancing in and out of your seat in and out of your seat we will take an offering for those who were healed we take an offering for those who travel and came back safely we take an offering for those who have, have obtained certificates we take an offering for all kinds of things and then in addition to those who want to do special thanksgiving and if they are your friends you dance after them and follow them to the front and they carry a plate giant plate but small money they dance to the front we dance after them i used to feel sorry for my daddy who was a very poor dancer he dancing behind the woman like that and the woman who were rolling and rolling and rolling and rolling would be using their bum bum to shook his leg because he could not dance that's what we were doing there not knowing that we were just preparing ourselves for silver golden arrows the first time this will happen it's a wedding ceremony the wedding has finished a couple were outside those who were to take pictures were there all of a sudden the bride shouted who are these people and she put her hands in her wedding gown and tore it they quickly rushed at her pushed her inside the car drove her straight to the hospital because we that were there we did not know that there is something known as arrow of darkness somebody who was normal throughout the service was never sick before had never even taken ordinary panadol before does not even go to hospital because she's always well then all of a sudden just like that that's what we call the arrows of darkness arrows of darkness i pray for somebody here that the arrow that is targeting your day of glory will backfire by fire in the name of jesus a seven fall amen it was another wedding at ife the bride after the wedding began to have pounding headaches she could not sleep she could not do anything they rushed out to lagos they brought her here i started praying the lord said call for the video of their wedding call for the video say i want to show you something call for the video so i they, they brought the video so i started to watching during the reception as they were dancing they were pasting money on their forehead they were pasting money pasting money 
and I was watching what there the one woman like this danced to the front I noticed that when she danced to the front no one followed her she faced the couple alone she put her hand inside the bag at that level what she brought out was a feather not money she had used at the money part to keep others from dancing to the front she now put the feather on the head of the woman and the feather did not come back to her hand in that picture the lord said that's it a feather of darkness an arrow of darkness true in that picture immediately the feather entered into her head the bride did like this did like this she didn't do anything and they continued the dancing you really are to me me mom I can see that you have been attending those ceremonies. Amen. One prayer let the feather of darkness go back to the senders. That was all. But if we didn't know what happened to that head, you can put cartons and cartons of panadol. It's a lie. Can you shout this loud and clear? fired against my head consciously or unconsciously can you shout it loud your voice is not loud enough backfire by fire in the name of Jesus there is a woman here who needs to pray this prayer Mapiani Katari Kasa Ribasapiani Katandaka In Jesus' name we pray. Stretch your right hand to the heavenlies. Say, My Father, put heavenly coals of fire on my hands now stretch that hand above your head my father put heavenly coals of fire upon my hands now fire to disgrace the weapon of darkness in the name of Jesus now smite your head seven times one two three four five six seven do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Thank you, Jesus. Sit down for a little bit, madam. Sit down, brothers, sisters, ladies, and gentlemen. So there is an entity known as arrows of darkness. At fact number one. At fact number two. Men and women receive these arrows every day. Every day. Fact number three. The Bible makes us to understand, according to Psalm 91, Psalm 91, verse 5, that there is an arrow that flyeth by day. So, fact number three, there are day arrows, there are night arrows. The Bible makes that one very very clear every arrow by day fired against anyone here shall by fire by fire how many facts have i told you now fact number four most cases of untimely death is due to these sudden arrows sudden arrows it's a terrible thing a professor i've been looking for a child for a long time eventually the wife took him he was teaching in the lecture room that day while they came to break the news that the wife had delivered the baby boy the professor was extremely glad he was beside himself with joy he jumped up for joy by the time he landed on the floor he was dead that's what they call arrows doesn't make sense the way it works fact number five the strength of an arrow and the power thereof depends on the person who shoots the arrow depends on the origin of the arrow fact number six there are special arrows 
the enemy fires at the righteous righteous so the fact that you are righteous does not mean they won't target you the bible says they shall fight against you but they shall not prevail it didn't say they will not fight they will fight but they shall not prevail can you say they shall not prevail can you shout it three times in psalm 11 verse 2 psalm 11 verse 2 if you are there say yes are you there so for lo the wicked bend their bow they make ready their arrow upon the string that they may privily shoot at who at the opera there you are there are special arrows targeted against the righteous and at fact number seven the most dangerous arrows are fired by witchcraft because they are public enemy number one public enemy number one public enemy number one please from what i've said so far you will see that walking about saying i'm sanctified i've received salvation i am holy i am righteous i have received the baptism of the holy spirit by the grace of god i'm living a clean life i don't sin i don't lie i don't fornicate i don't steal does not say that they will not fire the arrow please understand that one that's why you find somebody who claims to be holy he has received an arrow somebody who claims to be doing god's work he has received an arrow receive an arrow when a man of god at the age of 70 pastor at the age of 70 is now suspended for sleeping with a girl of 20 and he has been a pastor for 50 years he was a pastor before i was born and now he's gone just like that as the arrow is there so they make ready their arrow so that they can privily shoot privily shoot at the righteous notice the word privily there they be careful they watch the person carefully watch the person very carefully no wonder that him says christians seek not yet repose hack your guidance angel say thou art in the midst of foes watch and pray says principalities and power gather their unseen array waiting for your unguarded hour that is waiting for your careless hour waiting for that time when you are supposed to pray you are watching television waiting for that time when you are fighting your wife fighting your husband waiting for that time when you fall into sin and when you enter into that unguarded hour they say yes yes shoot the thing goes in it's after the arrow has gone in father i'm sorry father i'm sorry father forgive me i'm sorry father, i'm sorry i'm sorry i promise i, promise I won't do so again i'm sorry <laughs> yeah but the arrow is already sir sin already waiting for your unguarded heart watch and pray the songwriter now says watch as if on that alone watch as if on that alone lies the issue of the day ambushed lies the evil one watch and pray ambush lies the evil one so watch and pray the Yoruba hymn book says a shoe back on the door it's a hunter it's watching so watch and pray so there are arrows for the righteous the most dangerous ones are fired by witchcraft when an arrow comes against a person three things can happen one you either receive the arrow which most people do two it bounces off bounces off and in bouncing off it can go to the center it can go anywhere three it can miss you and eat someone else misses the person and eats someone else 
And this is a serious matter. But the truth is this. Anyone firing an arrow at a true child of God is seeking for trouble. Really, really trouble. Heaven may keep quiet for a while, but when heavens begin to react, it can be terrible. Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is planning to sink in the Red Sea like Pharaoh. Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is seeking to be destroyed by God's angel the way an angel destroyed the army of Sennacherib. Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is seeking to receive the stones that fell into the head of Goliath. Any power firing an arrow at a child of God is writing courier letters to substitution and he, will be he, will, he himself will receive the arrow. Any power firing arrows at the child of God is seeking to be eaten up with, with worms like Herod. The Lord is a man of war. He understands all strategies and policies of the enemy. Maybe you don't know. Our Lord is a mighty and terrible, terrible warrior. He can employ anything to fight for you. He can even employ inanimate objects to terrify and destroy the enemy. Everyone may be watching for a little bit. But once our Lord beckons with one finger, one finger, all celestial and terrestrial hosts are ready to fight. The Bible says, Who had hardened his heart against God and has prospered? When God sets himself against an enemy, the enemy is undone. Because riches cannot save the enemy. Strength cannot save the enemy. In the day of God's anger, riches is not, it's not a defense. Money cannot bribe him. The Lord has always disgraced those who try to rise against his children. He makes one to chase a thousand and two to put ten thousand to flight. He knows what the enemy is discussing in their bed chambers. He knows the thoughts of their heart. Perhaps you are here this morning and you have been shedding uninvited tears. You close your eyes, you cannot sleep. You have food on the table but no appetite. You see wrong. Not because you are wrong, but because wrong sees you. I have a message for you today. The repeated affliction shall backfire this morning. And every new affliction shall flee. Let me drop a gentle note of warning this morning. Anybody who wants to deal with anything witchcraft, you have to do it without compromise. You have to be violently determined. You have to behave like those who destroyed Jezebel. Jezebel was there on the top of the house. And Jezebel said, throw her down. And they threw her down. You have to be that violent. We are getting ready to pray now. Because I told you that this is a short message. But now, I want to look at some scriptures. Plenty of them actually. Pass a few comments on those scriptures. Then we are going to start praying now. Anyone who is present in the service of this morning, you did not come here by chance. You must have come by divine ordination and appointment. In Proverbs chapter 28, verse 10, it's good to note these scriptures very well. Proverbs 28, verse 10. Proverbs 28, verse 10. If you are there, say yes. Whoso caused the righteous to go astray in an evil way, he shall fall himself into his own pit. He shall fall himself into his own pit. But the upright shall have good things in possession. So the Lord is saying that that pit dug for you. They who dug the pit shall fall into that pit. The same Proverbs chapter 26. 26 verse 27 we're looking at principles of dealing with those arrows in all these scriptures i'm reading i'm giving you principles proverbs 26 27 whoso get a pit shall fall there and he that rolleth a stone it will return upon them there you are that is their weapon should catch them now if you go to Deuteronomy chapter 7. Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 15. Deuteronomy 7 15. It says this And the Lord will take away from thee all sickness, and will put none of the evil diseases of Egypt which thou knowest upon thee. 
Then listen to what he says. But we lay them upon all them that hate thee. That's what the Bible says. It will not allow the arrow of sickness to come upon you, but it will allow it to come upon your enemies. In the book of Nehemiah, Nehemiah, you find Nehemiah after Ezra, before you get to the book of um, Esther, Nehemiah chapter 4, verse 4. Hear, O our God, for we are despised and turn their reproach upon their own head and give them for a prey in the land of captivity. You can see the stand of scriptures. Because sometimes when we start praying this prayer, some people say, why is all this in the Bible? This is, this is uh, not, not scriptural. It's not scriptural. That's, that's, that's not scripture you are reading. In Psalm 7, verse 16, Psalm 7, verse 16, it says this, his mischief shall return upon his own head, and his violent dealing shall come down upon his own forehead. That's what the Bible says here. I hope you can read it by yourself. And in Psalm 35, which you read this morning, Psalm 35, verse 8, Psalm 35, verse 8, it said, Let destruction come upon him at unawares, and let his net that he had eat catch himself into that very destruction let him fall so the prayer is let his own net catch him the one who made the net said let that net now catch him the bible also tells us said, no weapon fashioned formed prepared no weapon fashioned against thee that is, the specialist sit down in the laboratory and prepare a special weapon against you. They fashioned it. So, but no weapon fashioned like that against you shall prosper. So every tongue that shall rise against you in judgment, thou shall condemn. It didn't say thou shall pacify, thou shall beg, thou shall appeal to them. No, every tongue that rises against thee in judgment. That is, every witchcraft judgment against you, thou shalt condemn. That's what it says. It didn't say you just tolerate them and let them be talking all the nonsense and rubbish you want to talk. The Bible now says something very serious. Look at the book of Esther, chapter 7. You find Esther after Nehemiah that we read before. Esther, chapter 7, verse 10. Esther, 7 10. So they hanged Haman on the gallows that he had prepared for Mordecai. They hanged Haman on the gallows that he had prepared for Mordecai. That is why we used to pray Mountain of Fire. At any power that wants you to die, they are dying in your own place. Every Haman assigned against you shall die for your sake. Let your amen be loud and clear. So when evil arrows are fired, the strategy of the Almighty is that the weapon that is used against you should fall back on the ones who started the weapon. The evil words that are used against you should go back to those who originated it. It is a divine principle for his children. I pray that any incantation issue against anyone here shall backfire by fire. <laughs> Every curse issued against you from any form of coven shall go back to the senders. <laughs> Every arrow fired against your progress shall backfire. <laughs> Every assignment of the wicked against you shall acquire acidic violence and go back to the senders. <laughs> In the name of Jesus. We believers do not send curses to people or arrows, but we have a right to return those ones sent to us because we did not create the forces. It was some people who created forces to destroy Daniel in the Bible. They created a force which they hoped would destroy Daniel, but the force that his enemies created was not only rendered powerless, 
but it went back to destroy them. I pray that every arrow fired against your family shall backfire. Every plot against you shall go back to the sender. And if your amen can be very loud, the bullet of your enemy shall destroy them. You shall destroy them. You shall destroy them. The bullet of your enemy shall destroy them. You shall destroy them. He shall destroy them in the name of Jesus. A sample for all them. These days, a lot of people just sleep and they experience somebody strangulating them on the bed, trying to choke them upon the bed as the arrow. Some tell you they hear voices telling them to do strange things as the arrow a sister was giving testimony at presity that in the night she just stood up took off her clothes and was about to walk out into the streets children asleep husband asleep then she had a voice daughter go back go back it was then her eyes cleared and she saw herself and she was wearing nothing the enemy wanted to throw her into the streets mad if there is anyone here this morning and there's an arrow to make you insane may that arrow of insanity double its power and go back to the center in the name of jesus someone has been happy all of a sudden a sudden depression comes upon the person a heaviness that's the arrow when the bible says it gives beauty for us the oil of joy for money the garment of presence out of the spirit of heaviness now heaviness has entered so the person who woke up saying praise it lord praise the lord praise god praise god the mood everything has now changed it's an arrow needless fear it's an arrow a pimple on the face something say is leprosy fear needless fear pimple on top of the breast somebody say this is cancer needless fear it's an arrow that is what you call paralytic wind some people just some breeze will blow upon them like this they just go paralyzed may those evil wind go back to the sender sometimes it's a cold chill at night even in a hot room the temperature of the person just falls an arrow of witchcraft sometimes the head or some parts of the body they feel heavier than other parts of the body it's an arrow sometimes some parts of the body will be shaking on their own without anybody touching them it's an arrow i've seen people they prepare food by themselves not that they bought the food from outside but as they ate the food they were finding insects and parts of a uh, body of uh, tiny tiny animals inside the food the arrow of witchcraft some dream that the air is cut off or they wake up without anybody entering their room they find that part of their air had been cut off it's an arrow of witchcraft sometimes they send demon idols to people demon idols come to people physically you see them physically come to accost people it's an arrow of witchcraft sometimes they even send snakes live snakes to people sometimes it's spiritual snakes to people it's an arrow of witchcraft sometimes it's heat in the head but you just be hot you don't know what is going on it's the arrow of witchcraft I want somebody in this meeting this morning to get sufficiently angry in the spirit to fight back and fight and win. It's a very serious matter. Sometimes people hear their names being called. They calls the name and unfortunately some answer. Say yes. I say mommy why are you saying yes? Uh, didn't you call me? No. Nobody called you here. And generally 
such people die within a few days may any voice calling anyone here from the grave be silenced by fire in the name of jesus let that amen roar like thunder sometimes they feed people with what they will ordinarily not eat they will feed them with that food in their dreams some arrow of witchcraft sometimes people dream a female with male organ male sexual organ will be sleeping with them carrying a female face but having a male sexual organ it's a terrible arrow indeed sometimes it's sudden pain in the body they go to the hospital they check x-ray check everything nothing sometimes they have prepared an arrow for somebody in the village and they say somebody's dying somebody's dying come home come home come home only for you to rush down you found that nobody was sick i say well, it's just a long time we have seen your face and if you say you should come you will not come it's an arrow people seen themselves inside coffins seen themselves dining with the dead it's an arrow of witchcraft many who are here this morning unfortunately we have been attacked at one time or the other with these weapons if you were attacked as a baby it is possible that the arrow is even still in you if you were attacked before you got born again it is possible that the arrow is probably still in you if you are attacked when you were ignorant it is possible the arrow is still inside but what you should learn today is to send the arrow back to the senders you do not have to exercise fear you have to plead the blood of jesus as a covering for yourself and begin to demand that the arrows should go back to the senders i shared with you here many years ago the story of how an occultic man got born again that occultic man is now a pastor it was a face my face with kind of accommodation this occultic man was in one room the sister was in the room next to him and the son of the woman was sick she had one son and the son was sick it was a strange sickness so she started praying for the baby praying for this child when she prayed 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 prayed, prayed the child would be okay for a little bit after some time the conversion will start again this woman will start praying 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 and then the child would relax again after some time this child will start again this woman will pray 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 not knowing that by the second room this occultic man was the one killing the child he had put a nail somewhere and when he bangs the nail inside the child begins to convulse in the other room and when the woman begins to pray the force of her prayer will be pushing out the nail pushing out the nail pushing out the nail then the nail falls down and the boy says mommy i'm okay the man takes the nail again put it back Bwah! the child starts again and this battle went on from 7 a.m in the morning till 5 in the evening the woman kept praying and the man kept putting the nail after some time the man came out carried the concussion knocked the woman's door say madam madam i have a feeling that your child is not okay give him this concussion to drink if she had accepted it that would have been the end she said thank you i don't want i do not want for those of you who are still drinking concussions god have mercy on you the man now went back to his room i said okay this is enough this woman is embarrassing me now brought out his satanic drum and began to call forth for the face of the woman and her child to kill them on the drum their faces were supposed to appear in that drum and they would put a nail through it and that would have been the end of the two of them so she prepared the drum made all the incantations she was supposed to call their names three times she called the name first time no one appeared she called the name second time the woman and her child appear brought out his nail to stick into the drum just a split second for him to do that the face of an old man appeared gray hair smiling and said i am the alpha and omega i am the ancient of days now pack all your fetish power here together and go to that church over there because that woman is my daughter you cannot kill her you cannot kill her son all these powers you have here you can now see that they are useless this was how the man surrendered his life to jesus rise up on your feet below all eyes closed 
But you see, if you are here this morning and you are not born again, you have not surrendered your life to Jesus, do so very quickly now. Very, very quickly now. By raising up your right hand and say what I'm going to say after. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. In Jesus' name. Amen. You said that short prayer with me. Immediately we close. Just find a way to the altar here. So that we can pray more with you. All eyes closed. Obviously you can see. That we are not here to joke. We are here for serious business. We are going to start our prayers. With the song we sang last. Jump out. Jump out. Evil arrows. In my body. In my progress. In my family. They must jump out. We are going to start with that song. And when you are singing it, just open your eyes and begin to do what I'm doing. Whatever I do, you do. As you are singing that song. Because as you are singing that song, it's an order. It's a command. The Bible said, Thou shalt decree a thing, and it shall be established. Thou shalt decree a thing. Jump out. Jump out. Jump out. Jump out. Evil arrow in my body, jump. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yes, yeah, sir. Oh, yes, yeah, sir. Hallelujah. Jump out. Jump out. Oh, yes, yeah, sir. Hallelujah. Jump. Hallelujah. Oh, yes. Yeah, Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, Hallelujah. 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 Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. 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 Yes, sir. Hallelujah. 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 Yes, sir. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, uh -huh. Hallelujah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. close now with a voice that roars like fire and like thunder say I fire back every arrow of witchcraft now in the name of Jesus open your mouth and declare it Jesus is here something must happen in your life today Bariamo Pasitala. Fire it back. That's why you are here. 
Aha, aha, aha. This is not a death to negotiate. Louder, 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 louder. We are not here to play. I fire back every hour of witchcraft in the name of Jesus. Aha! Aha, 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 aha. Amen. Aha, you see what is happening now? See what is happening now? That's right. Say, arrows of reproach, arrows of embarrassment, arrows of limitation. Can you shout those three arrows loud? Sisters, your voices are not loud enough. Everybody together now. Everybody together again. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Yes. 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 Yes, yes, my Peter Satele Kayaba, Ribo Soponte Kayabo Shantaraba. Yes, Jesus name we pray uh -huh. this is wonderful with a louder voice Allah! insulting my faith can you shout that loud backfire in the name of Jesus Continue, continue, continue. Jesus is here. Aha, that's it. That's how to do it. In Jesus, then we pray. Envious enemies backfire in the name of Jesus. The arrows of envious enemies. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus name we pray a sevenfold man stretch your right hand towards the heavenlies again say my father put hot coals of fire Fire of complete deliverance. 
upon my hands now in the name of Jesus anywhere I smite with my hands let the arrows go back to the senders in the name of Jesus start with your head again three times one two three go to your chest one look at what is happening over there two three go to your stomach close to your belly button close to your belly button one two three now go to your back your back your back one two three that woman over there having issues with your womb go to your womb area one don't feel sorry for that place do it again one two three thank you jesus say thank you jesus say thank you jesus now begin to speak into the womb of this month tell it what it should deliver to you tell it what it should not deliver thank you jesus amen lord shall i tell somebody here that although it looks impossible or unachievable but that before this year runs to an end your testimony shall shock your friends and surprise your enemies let the amen roar like thunder father i cover your people with the blood of jesus as you go into this month it shall be well with you the holy spirit will change the rules for your sake the lord will arise for your sake in every area it is written as soon as they hear of me they shall obey me strangers shall submit themselves unto me father i pray that any stranger contesting for the life of your children let them be embarrassed and disgraced in the name of jesus the arrows that have gone back to the senders today shall never come back to you again the spirit of jehovah which is the everlasting spirit shall arise and defend you it is written the lord has his way in the wind and the wild wind i command your way to open in the name of jesus thank you heavenly father in jesus mighty name we pray just share the grace in fellowship. Castle Africa TV. Somebody around you can see, hear your voice. Or oh, you can see, hear the voice of the person next to you. You are not praying hard enough. Can you shout this loud and clear? Dark imagination! In my heart! Jesus, you your mouth and decree. Jesus, Jesus, Piara, Tasha Talaka, the river supporting the Kayabashenta, Jesus, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus. Bapota Satiria, Ribo Conte, Kalikando Casapendikas, the Ribo Sopenda Kaya Moko Shanta Rabakaba, Bala Katenda Casatenda Kaya, Kopotos, Birapia Katanda Kaya Moshenta, Santa Podiasa. Jesus, then we pray. Say negative imagination. 
that has stolen from me. Toti Jamilole. In the name of Jesus. Somebody ought to shout this loud. Ba pata sa piale katanda. Riba sa panda kaya ba shantera ba. Jesus, then we pray. Now, with more violence, with more aggression, you will shout this loud and clear. My angel of open door, appear in the name of Jesus. Name we pray. Can you shout this loud and clear? My father, Baba, me release unto me wonderful me the angels of power. It is important you pray that for some very well. Oh, say, but I tell bad. Do right, dara, dara. To get those angels released unto you. Here are the yonder. One get the fool you. Before you now begin to operate. What are the prayers? Can I hear the sisters shouting this prayer? Is that the best the sisters can do here today? Let me hear the brothers roaring like thunder. Yes. 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 Everybody together. In the name of Jesus. Begin to ask for the ministration of the angels of power. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Angels of power. Angels of power. Shout his love. Arise. Pursue my enemies. Recover my possession. In the name. Jesus. They are ministering angels. I want get it all say sent for to minister to the heirs of salvation. I roll is a lot to say, say, but I want to go quick. Name we pray. Neo Ruko Jesu Lagba. Bolo no that the best defense is attack. We all know that Dalati Dabu when it will latch you close your eyes. A deal doing thunder of God. Shoot down my enemies. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. And Ladi Kabresi Bali Adura. Yes. Shoot them down. In Jesus' name we pray. The glory of the serpent. Oh go ejo fighting against me. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Set their glories ablaze. Bakatenda yabo shende rabo kopona. 
the glory of that serpent fighting me. Catch fire, catch fire, catch fire. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Arrows of fire. Strike the head of my enemies. In the name of Jesus. Jesus name we pray feet of fire crush my enemies to death feet of fire crush my enemies to death in the name of Jesus In Jesus' name we pray. Angels of war use sharp stones to break the head of my enemies. Can I hear you shouting this loud? In the name of Jesus. This is not a day to negotiate. name we pray oh I will oh, I will open the gate of death oh. for the enemies of my jaw for our tire can you shout it loud it's okay your voice is not angry now oh, you are deep in the name of Jesus. Yes. Benny. Makatenda Yaboshenda. In Jesus' name we pray. Nio Ruko Jesu, La Badura. The next few prayers. I want to draw tears. Don't be any what you need. What to call boiling anger? I need to attack when he is being The psalm says, "I hate them that hate the Lord." The psalm says, "I'm going to attack when he is being attacked." I hate them with perfect hatred. I'm going to attack when he is being attacked. Kingdom of darkness. Ijoba Okunku, shouting my name. Don't worry, worry, call me. Thunder go around. Destroy them now. Somebody is receiving a breakthrough. And you got it, Balaja. Yes, yes, Benny, Benny. In Jesus' name we pray. Any assassin, I yard against me this year. Can you shout it with hatred? I withdraw your life. No In the name of Jesus. You cannot afford to negotiate. There is no room for negotiation. In Jesus' name we pray. 
this with power and with fire any informant giving my enemies my information can you shout it loud be consumed by fire in the name of Jesus we are not here to negotiate we are here for serious business Jesus name we pray Power Power Pursue me for evil When you say that You now raise up your voice in the command Run into destruction Power Pursue me for evil Run into destruction in the name of Jesus. Aha, Benny. Aha, aha, Benny. In Jesus' name, we pray. This nice prayer. Adora to for it to be super effective. To be prayed in a non-compromising manner three times. Let your voice be louder each time. Fire! Hiding my glory in the belly. Can you shout it loud? Turn of God around the belly. Uh -huh. Open your mouth and pray now. And we can do that by in the name of Jesus. Your voice is not loud enough. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your mouth and shout it again. Burst the belly. Yes. It's happening, it's happening, it's happening. Continue, continue. Yes. Benny. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. For the third time, open your mouth and pray. And now you can bow to the. Jesus name we pray. Ni oruko Jesus la gbadura. Good. Oda be. Very good. Oda da da. Very very good. Ese dara dara. You deserve what you tolerate. O nti e ba fa e ba lo to sin. We are tired of certain situations. Awon e ko kan sun yin wa yi. And so we use our most potent weapon. You will shout this again without any apology. Assigned to turn my garment of glory to rags. 
Là, tu sois chaud, go, media, qui ça? Sisters, can I hear you shouting this? Sister, I think your voice should be louder than that. Brothers, let me hear you. Who are they like thunder? Your time is up. In the name of Jesus. Continue, continue, continue. There must be a change. 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 Ribos support the Kenya Boshen Terabo Popola Ba. Ba pila katen the Kenya Boshen. In Jesus' name we pray. Esa wu fole ba. Amini loko meche. Wicked powers. I don't like her. Sisters, are you very shout it mercilessly? From my place of birth. Lati Lu me from my place of marriage. Lati Bitimoti Loko assigned to destroy me. Tiwano, Lati Pamiru. Can I hear you shouting it loud? Brothers, can I hear you shouting the same thing? Everybody together now. Destroy the two powers. Ba wa ba la meje ju. Aita. Ba yi. Something is taking place here. O kon shele ni. Thank you, Jesus. O show Jesus. Masatila kaya bo shenta. Kira ba dia kuta di mesa. Jesus name we pray. Lord God Jesus, la guadura. Somebody demanded for the head of John the Baptist and the charge. Fool or it, you are not only there, but me know I walk at all. It is a spirit. Amen, Connie. You are not going to say this one. Oh, we buy low, Rada. Every power of Herodias. Demanding for my head. Don't be the fool in me. Can you shout it loud? I feel alone, brother. Is that the loudest you can shout? Yeah, the ghost of the divine lord. Pay with your head. For the other error. In the name of Jesus. Oh, look at Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Jesus. Let them pay with their own heads. 
ori ara wo di Jesus name we pray loru ko Jesu lagbadura se pass abara angry with my life ton binu saye mi destroy yourself e para yinu by the power ni pa abara in the blood of Jesus open your mouth and declare lo re ko pa la se Destroy yourself by the power in the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Lord, for Jesus, that God You will shout this loud. Blood of Jesus. Silence every blood crying against my life. In the name of Jesus. Boys of the enemy, Ibujokota, monitoring my destiny. Don't talk to me. In the name of Jesus, Lord God Jesus. That's better. That's better. 
Yeah. This is the kind of prayer that makes the imagination of the enemy to fail. Just fails. They can't even recollect you, they want to attack. Can you shout this again loud and clear? Memory bank of my enemy. The nice three prayers. Please, you need to pray, pray it in boiling anger. Sir, I push the enemy inside the grave, dog for me. Can you say it loud and clear? Uh huh. Let your voice be louder. Boom, that's okay. Let your voice be louder. Boom, so can see. In the name of Lord Jesus. 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 Yes. In the name of Jesus. Push. Push them inside the grave dog for you. You want to do this? I'll put you on bed for. Jesus, then we pray. Lord, God, Jesus. Every witchcraft computer. Go where royal abia shata waje. Fashion against me. Do you want back and let it on me? Crash. Daru. In the name of Jesus, God, Jesus. Crash the computers. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. Say by fire, by force. I delete my information from any satanic database. In the name. I delete my information from any satanic database in the name of Jesus. Just Jesus name we pray. Lord, who call Jesus, that bad rap. Where is the Lord God of Elijah? Jesus, Jesus, something is going on here. Oh, 
sicknesses don't like to hear. Can I hear the sister shouting it here? Is that the loudest the sisters can shout this important Brothers, can I hear you who are like thunder? When you say it once, but the women left, you now know, with violence convert it to machine gun play. Oh, my wife saw the Save me, I shall be saved. Heal me, I shall be healed. Save me, I shall be healed. Just continue saying it. Oh, tell no more. Continue saying it. Oh, tell no more. Are you ready now? Shut it up. Open your mouth and go around. Masekatela Kaya Boshanda. So told the Labaya. Something is happening already. 
Jesus name we pray. Lord of God, Jesus, la badura. I fire back. Every arrow of infirmity. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and fire it back. La enora kota kada. Mapota setela kaya boshendera bosepela katenda. Riba sepanda kaya boshendera. Riba sotela boshu. In Jesus name we pray. Lord we call Jesus. Owners of the Lord of Infirmity. They must carry their load. My posterity will compel. The river will send you to the center of the Kopala Bakatanda. Carry your load. Carry your load. Jesus name we pray Lord God Jesus like the power of drinkers of blood e wa gbara muje muje the power of eaters of flesh e wa gbara jeran jeran can you shout those two things loud your voice is not loud you know la so te to what are you waiting for in the enduro Something is up over there again. Conchale, you better let us see. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, 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 Jesus. Amen. Amen. Can you shout this now loud and clear? Kibele lo murara. Blood of Jesus. Eje Jesus. Kill every serpent in my destiny. Kill every serpent in my destiny. Something is going on over there. Oh, conchale, ni me. The serpent is in trouble. The serpent is in trouble. Ejo, what you walk out? Jesus. In Jesus. 
Jesus name we pray Lord call Jesus lay your right hand on your head da owo and shout this loud and clear every poison in my body you are a liar in the name of Jesus kill the poison now Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. 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 In Jesus, then we pray. Glory to Jesus. This prayer should be prayed with reckless violence. Every progress that the enemy has stolen from my life. Can you say this loud and clear? Every progress the enemy has stolen from my life. I recover you now. I recover you now. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, we call Jesus. My father. My father. Shock my enemies. Can I hear the sister say I shout to this? Sister, your voice is not loud enough. Brothers, can I hear you shouting this? Everybody together now. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to declare the shock upon your enemies. Yes, shock them. Yeah, one of you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Shock them. Yeah, one of you. Our warfare is a warfare of words. We create by our words. Whether it's life or death, we create by our words. We can remove mountains. Our own words are like raw materials. What are materials? With which we create or we kill. But the children of darkness, they do.
I'm praying for somebody here. That every incantation, every word uttered by the enemy against your destiny shall, as a matter of necessity, backfire. They shall backfire. They shall backfire. They shall backfire. In the name of Jesus. Say this loud and clear now. We buy low rara. Say I speak against every Goliath. Most of the Lord is equal Goliath. Posting against my life. Don't find no Lord is I am and I decree. Most of the say that when you sleep tonight. You will not wake up again. In the name of Jesus, I speak against every power contesting with my moving forward. That by the power of the God of Elijah, I cut you off. I cut you off. I cut you off. I cut you off. I cut you off in the name of Jesus. A servant for the Lord. Words of signs and wonders. Aro ami atiara. Locate me now. Satanic dedication. If satani of my family. T me. Is that the loudest who can shout this one? Your voice is not loud enough. Vagabond power. Agbara, Alani Kiri, release my family. Fear be visile. 
please don't joke with this prayer. Can I hear the sister shouting? Brothers, can I hear you shouting? Everybody together now. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Then we pray. Lord, who called Jesus, La Badura, and Central Oracle. Of Pele Rodino, speaking against my family. Don't sorrow, Lord, this year be me. If somebody here needs to shout this prayer, and you come what Tony Lola to keep that prayer again, shouting it. And goes, okay. Tonight is tonight. There must be a dismantling. It took a level of shame. Powers that do not want to give you peace. Dismantle them. Follow of my father's heart. Father, let me go. In the name of Jesus. Say Jehovah, Jehovah, the story changer, and the Let my story change. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? Say, I shall not see shame. I shall not see shame. I shall not see defeat. I shall not see defeat. I shall not see demotion. Can you shout it loud? Yes. Yes. Can you shout it again? I shall not see shame. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord for Jesus. Lagwadura. Satanic. Prophets, holy Satani, summoning my spirit, don't wear me, me, run mad. Yahweh, in the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to pray that That's right, Master Yes. Enough is enough. Okay. okay.
Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, look on Jesus. Like that, you're right. Fingers of the wicked. Ika, mo ika. Pointed against my breakthrough. The one now, Lord, is here like that, me. Wida. Lord, in the name of Jesus. Lord, look on Jesus. Open your mouth and command it to wither. Fingers of the wicked. Ika, mo ika. Pointed to my breakthrough. The one. Something is happening over there. Unconsciously, in Jesus' name we pray. Lord, call Jesus. I got you. By the time you that person over there, in by the time you shout this prayer three times, the weaknesses you brought here, I want to let out will vanish. What you could not do, until you begin to do. Over the every vampire power. Assigned against my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Deal with the vampire power. Yes. Deal with the vampire power. Ben, ben. Ben. In Jesus' name we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? That by the rock. Beloved, I ask you a question. Adam of Ebere Berekon. What does it mean to his? Kilotumasi Lati Poshe. What does it mean? Kilotumasi. His, let me hear you. Echo shaking bono. Aha. Say, oh God, arise. Lord, and he's over my enemies. Cause if Moshe, Lord, I want to me in the name of Jesus. Lord, look on Jesus. Yes, Benny. Jesus, then we pray. Lord God, Jesus, like that, we are making huge progress. That's why you land and say, Thunder of God. Arise, waste my enemies. Ben. Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus, then we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? Like Badura. Aha. Aha. Ben. Say every. Coven trap. Go go ikekun ajoaje catch your owner. Mu I want to know. Can I hear the sister shouting this? Can we have a little bit of 
I want you to emphasize catch. Eternal Can I hear the sisters again? Hey, you mean I go, it's okay. Brothers, can I hear you shout hey, in the same way? No, okay. Everybody together. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Let them catch their owners. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Every poison in my body. I am not your candidate. In the name of Jesus. Somebody is breaking through over there. And you can do a new universe. Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus, then we pray. Lord, who called Jesus? That Badura. Say thank you, Jesus. We pray, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Quickly, bring out your thanks and our offering for this meeting. Before we go on, Father, we thank you for the thanks and the offering. A good measure, present falling over. Let it be our Lord in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Bless your people to a mighty degree. In Jesus' name we pray. And destroy every coffin that has buried my destiny in the name of Jesus. Something is happening. Open your mouth, open your mouth, destroy the coffin. Jesus name we pray this is number two I want you to be very aggressive powers investigating my destiny to make me a slave can you shout this loud in the name of Jesus Yes. Somebody is breaking through with this press. We are not here to joke. In Jesus' name we pray. Grab your anointing oil now. Thank you, Jesus. Pour the anointing oil on your palm. At this level now, the gear to the prayers have changed. Father, this anointing oil on the palm, let it become the oil of fire, the oil of power, the oil of deliverance, the oil of glory. In the name of Jesus. As you anoint your head with this oil, you shall become a terror to the kingdom of darkness. Your words shall carry fire, your words shall carry power in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Rub your forehead with that head. Your forehead. Rub it very well. Brother. Thank you, Jesus. Aha. You are now in position to pray the rest of the prayers today. Oh God, arise! Remove death and grief.
grain from my family in the name of Jesus remove it then we pray <laughs> this next prayer let nobody's voice be louder than yours every curse hiding in my name Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Jesus. Jesus. Be released. Be released. Be released. From the wish cast sponsored infirmity. Be released. Be released. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers. Donating my blessing to evil altars. Can you shout out loud? Blood of Jesus, kill them now in the name of Jesus. Jesus. then we pray say family battle family battle family battle can you shout this loud Then we pray. So every curse assigned to make me and my family suffer. Can you say that loud? Your voice will be louder than that. Break in the name of Jesus. Shout this loud. Kill every power that are reducing my testimonies in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, then we pray. Two more prayers. Out of the ten, two more. Can you anoint your head again? 
Let's anoint your head again before we pray these two last prayers. Touch not my anointed, the Bible says, and do my prophets no harm. Anoint your head. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now, with a voice that roars like fire and thunder. It's a voice that nobody else can contest with. Can you shout this loud and clear? Pause! Behind my problems! Hear the word of the Lord! Down! In the name of Jesus! Masati Lakayabosha! Jesus, Jesus, aha, 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 in Jesus name we pray, honors of evil Lord, Open your mouth and pray it. That's why Jesus brought you here. In Jesus' name we pray. A seven fold man. Thank you, Jesus. Rise up on your feet now. Rise up on your feet. And all eyes closed. All eyes closed. With fire in your voice. For those who love themselves well. For I want to fear around understand themselves. Lay one hand on your chest. Preferably your right hand. On your chest. You will shout this louder than anyone around you. If somebody around you can see hear your voice. Or you can see hear the voice of the person next to you. You are not praying hard enough. Can you shout this loud and clear? Dark imagination in my heart. Dark in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree. Jesus. Yes. Jesus. Yes. Jesus. Yes. 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 Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Negative imagination that has stolen from me. Jesus, somebody ought to shout this loud. Jesus. 
Jesus then we pray now with more violence with more aggression you will shout this loud and clear my angel of open door in the name of Jesus name we pray can you shout this loud and clear my father Baba me release unto me wonderful me the angels of power it is important you pray that for so very well to get those angels released unto you before you now begin to operate can I hear the sisters shouting this prayer is that the best the sisters can do here today let me hear the brothers roaring like thunder yes Everybody together. In the name of Jesus. Begin to ask for the ministration of the angels of power. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Angels of power. Shout his love. Allies. Pursue my enemies. Recover my possession. In the name. They are ministering angels. I want to get it say, Sand for the minister to the heirs of salvation. I run is a lot to say, say, what I want to go with. Jesus name we pray that if you are afraid don't pray the next prayer but I believe God because the Bible says God has not given us the spirit of fear powers of witchcraft in my town scatter in the name of Jesus, scatter it. Etuka. Name we pray. Close your eyes. Thunder of God. Shoot down my enemies. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Yes. Shoot them. In Jesus' name we pray. The glory 
of the serpent fighting against me catch fire in the name of Jesus set their glories ablaze the glory of that serpent fighting me catch fire catch fire catch fire Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Arrows of fire. Strike the head of my enemies. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Feet of fire. Crush my enemies to death. Feet of fire. Crush my enemies to death. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Angels of war use sharp stones. Hello, to break the head of my enemies. Life for I want to hear you shouting this loud. In the name of Jesus. This is not a day to negotiate. Jesus name we pray. Niyoruko Jesus. Oh I will. Eyi oru. Open the gate of death. Esi enu ono iku. For the enemies of my joy. Fu I want to you. Can you shout it loud? Do we is okay? Your voice is not angry now. We all need pinu pinu to. Just In Jesus name we pray. Niyoruko Jesus la badura the next few prayers no. you need what you need what to call boiling anger the psalmist says I hate them that hate the Lord I hate them with perfect hatred kingdom of darkness shouting my name thunder of God destroy them now Somebody is receiving a breakthrough. And you got him, Balaja. Yes, yes, Benny, Benny. In Jesus' name, we pray. Any assassin hired against me this year, can you shout it with hatred? I withdraw your life in the name of 
Jesus. You cannot afford to negotiate. There is no room for negotiation. Jesus name we pray. We pray this with power and with fire. Any informant. Giving my enemies my information. Can you shout it loud? Be consumed by fire. In the name Jesus, we are not here to negotiate. We are here for serious business. Jesus name we pray. Power! Pursue me for evil. When you say that, you now raise up your voice in the command. Run into destruction. Power! Pursue me for evil. Run! Destruction in the name of Jesus. Aha, Benny. Aha, Aha, Benny. In Jesus' name we pray. This next prayer. Adura to Koyi. For it to be super effective. And to be prayed in a non-compromising manner three times. Let your voice be louder each time. Hiding my glory in the belly. Can you shout it loud? The belly. But you could not. Uh -huh. Open your mouth and pray now. And I can bow. Do that by. In the name of Jesus. You are Your voice is not loud enough. Oh, we In Jesus' name, we pray. Open your mouth and shout it again. Bust the belly. Yes, say it could not. It's happening, it's happening. Continue, continue. Yes, Benny. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. For the third time. In Jesus' name we pray. Ni oruko Jesus la badura. Good. Oda be. Very good. Oda da da. Very very good. Ese dara dara. You deserve what you tolerate.
we are tired of certain situations and so we use our most potent weapon you will shout this again without any apology Pause! assigned to turn my garment of glory to rags sisters can I hear you shouting this sister I think your voice will be louder than that brothers let me hear you who are they like your in the name of Jesus continue 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 there must be a change 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 Jesus name we pray. Amen. Let's bring out a man out and let's remain standing. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Papa, Father, in the name of Jesus. Papa, we leave the manna water unto you, Lord. Let every particle of it become the blood of Jesus. Let every particle carry the fire of God. Let this water disgrace every serpent and scorpion. Let this water disgrace every infirmity. Let this water put to shame every assignment of darkness. Let this water bring progress and deliverance and healing. In the name of Jesus, let the anointing of peace flow into the water. Anointing of fire flow into the water. Anointing of power flow into the water. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. The Lord blesses you some Zion. Make his face to shine upon you. And be gracious unto you. You shall go from strength to strength. And from glory to glory. No weapon form against you shall prosper. Every prayer request, our Lord, answer them by fire. The promise of touch not my anointed. And do my prophets no harm. Shall be your Lord in the name of Jesus. Evil is not permitted to visit you. And you are not permitted to fail. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Thank you, Jesus. Can you say this loud and clear? As a result of what I've told you here today. Say, Ancient prison door. In the Kutubu ati rondi ron in my family life. Ninu idile mi. Somebody needs to shout this loud. Eh, ne kwa wati eko pipe lo rara. Your voice is not loud enough. Oh, we are not so petu. Your voice is not loud enough. Oh, we are not so petu. Jesus. Jesus. Please don't joke with this next prayer. Say, power! Bewitching my photograph against me. 
Can you shout this loud? <laughs> the reason I ask you to pray this prayer is because some photographs are in the hands of the enemy to use. Can you shout this loud? <laughs> shout it again. <laughs> Five persons here. I want your maroni. There's some strange object in your body. I want to look at you. Come on, you know After this prayer now, then I do like anything. These strange things. I want to look at you. Want you? Will vanish. Walk around. Father, Baba, it is written. At the call we pray, you yourself bore our infirmities. You walk on through our lairawa and took away our sickness. Oh, see, move up, go, I end this chance. Because of our pieces upon you. In our life, I want Benny Arare. And by your stripes, we are here. Nick Pai Noreni, I say, move on, Arare. I stand there as your servant. Moduroni, you can't be wrong. And I declare under the mandate of Calvary. Most in Pasela, baby. You strange objects in the body. Hear the word of the Lord. A poor Olua. It is written. At the call, as soon as they hear of me. They shall obey me. Strangers shall submit themselves unto me. The strangers shall fade away, and they shall be afraid out of their close places. You, the stranger in the body, I bind you and I cast you out. In the name of Jesus. Check it now. Check it now. Check, check, check. There are five of you. Five of you. Five of you. You will declare this louder than anyone around you. Collective captivity. Is that the loudest you can shout? Your voice is not loud enough. Your voice is still not loud enough. In the name of Jesus, that's the power of God. That's the power of God. I don't know me. I don't know me. There are several other persons. And when you are making mirror, what? You have been caged. What if you see you a hammer by the powers who call marine bankers? Lack of war and war only shall live for a me. Your money is there. Oh, you in Bembe. Your husband is there. I won't call you in Bembe. Children are there. I won't mind you one in bed. They have hidden so many things from you. Who called you? Got out the Pamo Kuro Doi. I'm just going to count seven from here. Walk or count Kade, the Latin, and then the volcanic fire. Of the only ghost who fall upon you and the yoke of that water power broken completely. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sponsored infirmity. Both by Lerati and one, Jesse, I go the bar. Clear away now. Go over this. 
In the name of Jesus, let your amen roar like thunder. You will now shout this louder than anyone here. Hatchquake of the Lord's deliverer. Can you shout it louder? Your voice is not loud enough. Shout it louder. Fight for me now. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Can you now shout this loud and clear after me? Say, Acts of God. Acts of God. Acts of God. Acts of God. Acts of I want you to put your emphasis on cut down. Every witchcraft tree. Battle in my life. Can I hear the sister shouting it? Mm-hmm. This prayer is meant to penetrate into the covens. Can I hear the sisters again shouting it? Sisters, your voice is not loud enough. Brothers, can your voice roar like thunder? Cut that! When you say it once, you now convert it to machine gun prayer. Cut it down. Cut it down. Open your mouth and pray! It's happening, it's happening. Cut it down. Jesus. Jesus. Cut it down. Whether it's in the village, whether it's in the city, whatever it is present, cut it down. In Jesus' name we pray. Every cage fashioned to imprison my star. Can I hear you shouting that? I smash you. Can you say that again? In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and say it loud and clear. Every cage fashion to imprison my star. I smash you. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Power! 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 Exhorting yourself as eagle against me. 
Don't be around what Gabi a yeah di lo di si mi. Can I hear you shout to this one? I am got a key belay. I knock you down. No for you. In the name of Jesus. Me oru ko Jesus. Open your mouth and deal with that power. And like you can do do ko and walk bara no. Just bend. Jesus, then we pray. Ni uruko Jesus lagba. Say thou power, iwagbara of invisible barrier. To we dabu iri stagnating my life. To die mi gun. Can I hear you shouting that? Again, go ke kibere. Let your voice be louder than that. Ejo ko we lo so ke kibere lo. Is that the loudest you can shout it? Oh, we are also to be there, no. Scatter! Fuka! In the name of Jesus! Neo, look at Jesus! Yes! Ben! Thank you, Jesus! Yes, soon, Jesus! Jesus, then we pray. Ni oruko Jesu ni agbadura. Father, Baba, at my count of seven here. Let it work on kade je lati. Let anyone in this service. Eje ke ni yo to wa ninu ipade yi. Who is under the yoke of village witchcraft? Go wa la be ajaga ti aje ti abule be released instantly. Go by to see your dress. For it is written. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. That every enemy that comes against us must flee from before our face. If they come against us in one way, they shall flee in seven ways. Father, Baba, as I count seven from one, any no matter where they are, whether outside this or the third or outside, and they have been harassed. Tormented, he won't come on. You don't want to hear my village witchcraft. Let your power fall upon such people and let them be completely delivered in the name of Jesus. One, any, two, eighty, three, a time, four, every, thank you, Lord. I see you all. Five, six, ever, seven, eight. Let the chains be broken. Let the chains be broken. Powers of the enemy cutting holes in my pocket. Can you shout this loud? In the name of Jesus. Cutting holes in my pocket. Your time is up now. My cat is sitting there. I'm pushing the rubber to center. In Jesus' name, we pray. Sisters, are you here tonight? Can you say this after me? Powers. Using the hours of the night to conclude my case. Can the sisters shout with anger? Brothers, can I hear you roaring like thunder? Them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 
ko Jesu la gbadura can you raise your voice with fire and with thunder as these angels are moving about now so that you won't be left out can you shout this prayer loud and clear as dictated by the holy spirit Powers! assigned to rubbish my glory you are alone in the name of Jesus yes thank you Jesus Thank you, Jesus. 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 Oh, put your mouth up, put your mouth up, put your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, continue to lay your hands upon us. This first prayer will bring so many testimonies. Whether you understand it, you don't understand it, just pray. Pray it. Pray it very well. Pass! Contending against my new day. Can you say that loud and clear? You are alone. Dead. In the name of Jesus. Yes. Name we pray. Say, so, Oh God, arise! Wherever my enemies shall run to tonight, find them and bring them down. Oh God, arise! Wherever my enemies shall run to tonight, find them and bring them down. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray. Open them out, open them out, open them out. In Jesus' name we pray. This next three prayers. You lose your voice is worth it. As far as you get the results. Powers assigned to make we rotate on one spot. Sisters, can I hear you shouting it? I want the sisters to be more angry in their spirit. <laughs> Brothers, let me hear you worry like thunder. Everybody together shouting it. <laughs> Die by fire. <laughs> in the name of Jesus. <laughs> I refuse to rotate on one spot. <laughs> Jesus. Yes. In Jesus.
Jesus name we pray Please number two of that enough is enough press <laughs> Batus Making my case difficult Can you shout it loud? Scatter! In the name of Jesus! Aha! 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 Don't negotiate! This is not a day to negotiate! Battles making my case difficult! Scatter! 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 Jesus name we pray as many people as love their families please pray this prayer yokes shout it loud shout it louder that multiply problems in my family can you shout it again Jesus, break the yoke, break the yoke. Something is happening, something is happening over there. Jesus, then we pray. Pray this without any apology. Any curse upon my father's head. Any curse upon my mother's head that is transferred to me. Can I hear you say that? Let your voice be louder than that. Yes. Let your voice be louder than that. Somebody is breaking through with his prayers. This is not a day to negotiate. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. It's happening. It's happening. Open your mouth. Don't negotiate. Be released, 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 be Now you are going to raise up your voices in these strange but effective prayers. Say every cobra and viper in my foundation run out and die in the name of Jesus. Somebody needs to raise his voice in that prayer. The cobra and the viper in my foundation run out and die. Run out and die. Run out and die. Jesus' 
Jesus' name we pray. Silence. Silence. Some first bonds are here. I want a copy come Benny. Who are not finding their feet in life. Right there where you are. The power of God is coming upon you. And that yoke of stagnancy is broken. Jesus. Yes. Say spiritual robbers. Me, what you have stolen from me and my family, return them by fire in the name of Jesus. Command them to return what they have stolen. Stolen from me and my family. Return them by fire. Return them by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. For every dark garment assigned to threaten my future. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus. Aha, aha. It's happening, it's happening. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Jesus name we pray Surgeons of heaven My life is available This is me now In the name of Jesus Call on the surgeons of heaven Visit me now Visit me now Visit me now. Visit me now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. And be on your knees as you pray this demon destroying prayers. Voices. Shout it loud. Commanding me, Don't for me to carry the evil load of my father's house. Voices commanding me Don't to carry the evil load of my father's house. Shut up in the name of Jesus. name we pray I want you to lose your temper in the Holy Ghost as you pray this prayer let nobody's voice be louder than yours now Pass! postponing the day of my miracles
This is not a day to negotiate. Pause. Postponing the days of my miracles. Jesus, name we pray. Two more prayers. Two more prayers. Pray this with all the strength that you have. Every curse pushing me backwards. Anytime I want to move forward. Can you say it with only anger? Yes, Says, Six thousand years of shout this prayer Break! In the name of Jesus. Break it! Break it! Oh, put your mouth, oh, put your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Power, sir. Assigned to push me out of my promised land. You are a Lord. Open your mouth and pray. I refuse to be pushed out of my promised land. Jesus, then we pray. A song for the man. There are battles around us. And the enemy can go to any level to capture a man of destiny. Some parents who lived in I brought area of Lagos, Banana Island. They brought their son here. Who was talking incoherently. And his brain was like it's been manipulated. We started praying. We started praying. When he calmed down a little bit, he told me a strange story. He went to a party. Met a lady there. First day. Picked the lady up. And they were driving away to a hotel somewhere. Somebody you met. Just a few minutes or hours ago. He said they were driving our, on our third mainland bridge. It was after prayer I could recollect this. He said as they drove on third mainland bridge. That the lady was, uh, was taken off. His trousers. Although he was driving, the lady was taking off his trousers. He was taking off the trousers of the man. Was removing. Was unbuttoning his trousers. But the, man, the man kept driving. He unbuttoned the man's trousers. Pulled down his pants. Held his manhood. Held his manhood. As he held the man's manhood, the man released semen onto her hand. And the next thing, she shouted, Stop! Stop! Third me lambry. The brother said he parked the car. I said, I said, Why are you shouting? The lady walked out of the car, jumped into the lagoon. He rose up to see what happened. The lady had disappeared. 
from that day that your joy, Lord, his destiny was in trouble a high flying man became somebody who could not spell his name this is why I'm praying for all the young people that are here that made the enemy not make you mad may you not embrace your enemies may you not in the name of excitement or a few minutes of German lose your God ordained destiny in the name of Jesus all the young people let your amen roar like thunder that's when you could remember it and you have to fast and fast and pray and pray. Here are his eyes. They had come from your family where nobody fast, nobody pray. Can you shout this louder than anyone around you? Oh God! Oh Lord! Enter into my waters. Every witchcraft connected to my root. Can you shout this love? In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Yes, louder, louder, louder. In Jesus' name we pray. Messenger of sickness, shout to God. I wish you could see what is happening now. I told you, don't joke with this prayer. Thou power, Iwan, 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 I Jesus name we pray. Nioruko Jesus la kadura. Belly of evil birds. Iku awenye ipi keeping my star. Kopa irawo mimo. Can you shout that loud? Eki belo rara. Bust by fire. Bear me by no. Open your mouth and bust the belly. Ela ni ke pe iku no. Your voice is not loud. Your 
From river, let me make sure you shout that loud and clear. Can you say that again? Every monster. To report me. Can you shout that loud? Do you say, the love of Jesus? Wisdom, 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 Jesus, then we pray. Get yourself really angry in the spirit. Three people in your meta who have been pushed into the covens of eaters of flesh and drinkers of blood. Under cleverly hidden medical names. Arrive where you are. And the yoke of the eaters of flesh and drinkers of blood is broken completely. The power of God is about to come on ten people. So one thing is common with these ten people. There is a power that always pushes them to the back zone. Hungry family spirits pushing you to the back all the time. Right there where you are. You see here, do you hear this in the name of Jesus? As the first person, and you number two, a cake in number three, a cat and number four, a number five, a car number six, a number seven, a number eight, a number nine, a number ten, a number nine.
You can't hide. The time is up. You that person over there. Your body is not your body. Right there where you are. Recover your correct body in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Glory. The womb of this man shall favor you in the name of Jesus. 
Awesome. You know the professor of the church that consults you the name of Jesus. Whenever you get this one, the favor of God shall overshadow you. Any power that hates your existence, they shall replace you in the grave. In the name of Jesus. The prayer request I will answer them by fire. Jesus, my name will pray. Let us share the grace and fellowship. Seven miracles in the area of God. Hallelujah. Make it. Rise to your feet. Now. Right. Get your spiritual gun ready. I want you to fire these seven prayers the way you've never prayed before. Say, cowards should not be given a place. So, if you must win this evil, you must keep on firing your prayer bullets. Can you shout this louder than anyone around you? Every cry of the night. Assigned to kill my glory. In the name of Jesus. The cry of the night. There must be no negotiation. We are not here to negotiate. But Captain Satan. Jesus, then we pray. Something is crying at the night at the back of your window. You see other windows, they don't go there. It's the young window they are coming. Find a way to this altar. And pray with fire and with power. What will happen is that you will meet them dead. Can you shout this again loud and clear? Evil cry of the night against my destiny. Open your mouth and pray. Ba pote se tenda kaya ba. In Jesus name we pray. Oh God, Allah. shout his love. Give me a miracle that will set you my case. Set you my case. I do really want to say why did that one? Makate seten de kaya boshanda. In Jesus name we pray. Something is about to happen. A prayer is about to come now. That will change destinies. Can your voice roar like thunder as you shout this loud and clear? Every internal chain. when you Shout it with fire. when you In my body. In the name of Jesus. The 
Ni chemas u broke ni chemas u broke Kenya Makate setendi ya boshenda Bread in the chain Kenya Jesus name we pray See what is happening. See what is happening. That's right. Right there where you are. The electric current of God is going from the top of your head to the soul of your feet. From the top of your head to the soul of your feet. And as that current is going through your body, it's challenging every plantation of darkness. It's challenging every plantation of infirmity. How is the power of God, the power of God going through your body? You can't hide. You can't hide. I am going to count seven from here. As I count seven from here, any hidden serpent in the body of anyone, any hidden enemy in the life of anyone, will jump out and go back to the ascenders. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, God. Yes, that's the power of God. That's the power of God. Say, angels of war. Where are you? I know. Upside down. Sisters, can I hear you shouting this prayer? I'm sure the sisters can do better than that. Sisters, you can still do a lot better than that. But come better, Brothers, let me hear you. What is it like to you? Everybody to go out. In the name of Jesus. Something is happening over there. Abriana Faruacho. You that evil growth in the body. You have made a huge mistake. By following this person here today. Let the luggage of darkness. There's a swelling of darkness. Go back to the senders now. You that evil growth in the body. I command you to disappear. 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 You that person, check your body now. Check your body now. Once the growth has disappeared, and you can't find it in your womb, you can't find it in your breast, you can't find it in your body. 
run quickly to the altar here. Don't let the devil put it back. You the spirit of paralysis. Trouble that person over there. I command you to lose your hold. 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 In the name of Jesus. Aha. Check your body now. Yeah. If you have been feeling funny in your limbs, and the funny feeling has disappeared, come on, and I want to get it to the altar. Don't let the devil put it back. The plantation of the stubborn spirit husband that has occupied the lower part of your body. One day, chica, carcashe. I set it ablaze. 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 In the name of Jesus. The noises in the head. Noises in the brain. I silence you now in the name of Jesus. All the evil noises you have been hearing. Let them be silent now in the name of Jesus. Check your body now. That noise in your head assists. Check your body. Makapota le kayabo shende. Ribo soponde kayabo shente labo kosenta. Bakayabo shanda. The evil wound that has refused to heal. When the eki wake wa. Hear the word of the Lord. Go back to your coven. 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 In the name of Jesus. Stretch your right hand towards this altar now. Make a hand in the name of Jesus. Make a hand in the name of Jesus. Make a hand in the name of Jesus. Ribo sepeli. Make a hand in the name of Jesus. Father, let the hand of healing and deliverance. Fall upon his hands now in the name of Jesus. Let every yoke of the enemy be broken to pieces. In the name of Jesus. Yes. If you brought any infirmity here, smite it forty times. Ask the infirmity to die. Say, die infirmity. Die. Die. Forty times. Smite it. Let's go. Do it twice. Do it twice. Do it twice. Something is going on over there. Something is going on over there. There is a power of God coming upon you. Yes. How can you? Amen. I have a strange word for two people here. I don't know who you are. Your brother and a sister. I don't even know whether you are watching me online. But the enemy. That has refused to let you shall die within seven days. Yes. Yes. 
Amen. Amen. You that person, you are just joining this service. I have a word to you from the Lord. Now, the one that your conspiracy, the conspiracy against you is scattered completely. Right there where you are. Your photograph that is being used to torment you. Right there where you are. Receive your deliverance. Receive it. 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 Receive yeah. Begin to do what you could not do before. Yeah. Check yeah. it very well. Yeah. Begin to do what you could not do before. Yeah. Out of God, the hand of bondage is upon you now. Check your body. Yeah. Once you are healed, find a way quickly. Yeah. To this altar. Yeah. Now you go to the altar very quickly. Yeah. When you smote yourself just now, the yeah. yeah. power of God flowed up yeah. into your life. And you be healed. Find a way quickly to this altar. Don't let the devil put it back. Don't let the devil this with anger. Boiling anger. When I say boiling anger, I mean boiling anger. Nache. Fushi deke tapasa. In existence, expanding my battles. Can you shout this loud? Your voice is not loud enough. Your voice is not loud enough. In the name of Jesus. Yes. 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 If he's expanding my battles, you go the most Jesus. Now. Yes. The next three prayers. Immediately you begin to pray. Those of you who have been constantly denied of your rightful position. Seriously, they shall restore you to your right position. As you pray these prayers, those businesses and trades that have gone into coma shall receive the resurrection power of the Lord Jesus Christ. You must fire this prayer seriously. Saying it is over for me. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus name Shout this last say battles Assigned to damage my happiness In the name of Jesus Yes you cannot damage my happiness you that person over there you have done multiple surgeries. Yet the enemy is still troubling you. Right there where you are. 
that is a surgical angel by yourself carrying out surgery for your body something has been taken out from the head something has been taken out from the chest something has been taken out from the womb something has been taken out from organs of your body that's the first person that's the second person that's the third person Don't say anything now. Don't even shout amen. Thou power. And shadow. The inua. And arrows. The kibioi. On timely death. Ner mutuang benye. Let her go. But that that fee. Let her go. But that that fee. Let her go. But that that fee. But that that fee. But that that fee. But that that fee. In the name of Jesus. I kiss you, na yesu. The serpent that is monitoring your progress. I send the serpent a blaze. 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 The serpent a blaze. In the name of Jesus. Every power that is firing arrows at your brain. Let the arrows fire into your brain. Jump out now and go back to the sun. That's in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Right there where you are. In the kitchen now. Raise your right hand to the heavens. The Gahan and Dama Kasama. Raise your right hand to the heavens. The Gahan and Kano Dama Sama. Say, my hand. Hanuna. Hear the word of the Lord. Come on over to you. Become a battle axe. Kasama. In the name of Jesus, lay the hand on your head now. And shout this prayer loud and clear. Assign to press down my head. You are Lord. In the name of Jesus. You cannot negotiate. You You will now shout your name. The way I'm going to shout my own name. Yeah, the same. Daniel Onukoya. What's the deal, Awal? Hear the word of the Lord. You can't go over into it. Pursue your pursuers, my friend. In the name of Jesus. Pursue your pursuers, my friend. In the name of Jesus. Pursue your pursuers, my friend. In the name of Jesus. Pursue your pursuers, my friend. Jesus, name we pray. A louder amen. Beloved, with the mode we are operating now. This is 70 days prayer and fasting period. God must do something to mesmerize and embarrass your enemies. In this seventh days program, I want to share and plan. Plan as as you plan about the escape goods. The bank is there and planning the word and so something must happen to show who is serving the living God. Ah, Buzef, no one is scared. Whether it is convenient for the enemy. Koyama, Koyama, must go be must be. Everyone must write courier letters to all your stubborn enemies. Why is there must be? We seeka.
all antagonists of God's children in the Bible have been embarrassed and disgraced. All who ever threaten God's people you cannot fight against the sins of God without fighting their God and let me tell you there is no greater madness in this world than for weak human hands who want to engage the almighty in battle and, and therefore special announcement to any covenant that the the coven shall be destroyed by the fire of God in the name of Jesus and the nakedness of your enemies shall be revealed in the name of Jesus a servant for the man Amen 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 Rise to your feet now in case you are here today, you are not born again. You have not just surrendered your life to Jesus. Do so very quickly by raising your hands. Or taking the data on our screen. Say what I'm going to say after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. Take control of my life. Thank you, Jesus. Can you raise up your two hands to the Lord? Now? As you pray this very serious prayer. <laughs> Assigned to punish me because of my glory. When they can say horror, you don't know. Your time is up. No, I can't tell you. You too. I just want to know yes. Powers are sent to punish you because of my glory. Your time is up, Lord. Die in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Every mouth of the enemy speaking against my glory shut up in the name of Jesus. Command them to shut up. In Jesus' name we pray. Sisters, are you here tonight? Can you say this after me? Powers. Using the hours of the night to conclude my case. Can the sisters shout with anger? Brothers, can I hear you worry like thunder? Thunder of God! Scatter them! 
Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I read it. Obey you. Kawa said this. Kawa said this. Kawa said this. I speak in Sumerian. Yes. I read it. Obey you. Kawa said this. I speak in Sumerian. Yes. Kawa said this. Kawa said this. Kawa said this. Sunana, 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 Sunana,
Father, we thank you for another time before your feet. And we thank you for the mightiness of your name. We thank you for your name, which is great and marvelous. We thank you for your power, which no man can put behind. We thank you because of your grace. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. As many people as are gathered there tonight, open their understanding in the name of Jesus. Let them war a good warfare. Let there be no one who will come here today or join to this program and go away without a testimony. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Right there where you are. I want you to be silent. Don't say anything. The power of God will begin to move from person to person in a few moments from now. And in the moving of that power, every enemy of destiny progress. Every enemy of divine acceleration. Every enemy of breakthroughs, of enlargement, wherever they are hiding, the fire of the God of Elijah will identify them in their hiding place and begin to push them out. Every power that are saying you will not have peace, every power that are restarting problems every power that circulates you from one problem to the other every power that is against your joy every power that is against your continuous happiness every power that is against the progress of your children every power that is attacking your marriage no matter how cleverly hidden there let the fire of the God of Elijah begin to push them out of their hiding place in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ let there be silence let the power of the God of Elijah begin to push them out of their hiding place get out the one in the head get out the one in the eyes get out the one in the chest get out the one in the legs get out in the name of Jesus every contrary wind that the enemy is blowing towards your direction let the wind of the Holy Ghost blow them off 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 there's a power God coming upon you That woman over there. I command the marine bankers to bank your marriage, bank your progress, to release what they are banked from your life in the name of Jesus. Recover it. Recover it. Recover it. Recover it.
can you raise your voice with fire and with thunder as these angels are moving about now so that you won't be left out can you shout this prayer loud and clear as dictated by the holy spirit assign to rubbish my glory you are alone there in the name of Jesus yes thank you Jesus Thank you, Jesus. 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 Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, continue to lay your hands upon us. In Jesus, mighty name we pray. Years ago, we went to a house to pray. The woman was having this, people were just dying. We went to this house. We started praying. Immediately, we started praying. It was as if our prayers were bouncing back on our heads. And I would stop praying. The others were still praying. Say, Lord, what is the problem here? Say, son, lift up your head. I lifted up my head. And I saw a piece of furniture. A piece of decoration on top in the shape of a vulture. Oh, what that be? You see, so, until that is removed, don't waste your time. This place has already been dedicated, it's under an evil covering. That's why I'm going to pray one prayer now. Let your amen be tenfold aggressive. And shout the amen ten times. I decree that every environmental wickedness, any wicked cover over your habitation is broken now in the name of Jesus. So any satanic object you are keeping to prolong your warfare you may say it's an ornament you may say it's a piece of jewelry but if it's satanic you prolong your warfare you must have heard me sharing this the first time we went to Ghana for a crusade a mother brought her child said so the child was always having epileptic fit epileptic fit and that I should pray for that child close my eyes to pray Lord says see see the pendant see the chain on his neck it must be removed and destroyed so I said mommy remove this chain you are hanging on his neck said no sir he's been wearing it since he was a baby he's been wearing it so we can't take it out see? you take it out he will die. I said, take it out. Say, are you serious, sir? Yes. Take it out. Now, sir, she now look around. 
if I take it out and this boy dies, you will be held responsible. Take it out. She took it out. Where was he standing? So now this pendant below it, break, break it up. They broke this heart like shape thing open. Inside that small metal was inscribed I love Lucifer. Inside that thing. Burn it. And that was the end of epilepsy. So any property of the enemy you are hanging around will hinder your warfare. Oh, you used to have one sugar daddy many years ago. You are, still, you are still having the gift he gave to you in your house. You are looking for trouble. He bought bed shit for you. You are still using it. You are looking for trouble. You are still sleeping on his bed. You are sitting on his chair. You are looking for trouble. Any demonic objects or objects of darkness in your possession must go. You cannot fail without your permission. You permitted. So if you say I'm not permitted to fail, then you are not permitted to fail. I'm not permitted to fail, you are not permitted to fail. And this is why I decree by the of heaven. Any failure that anyone has been experiencing, you are no longer permitted to fail in the name of Jesus. You are not permitted. You are not permitted to fail in the name of Jesus. Let our heaven roar like thunder. Not speak words that will make the devil think he's winning. Don't speak those words. If you are unwilling to love, you will not overcome. Always wear your armor properly. Be properly dressed. The way the book of Ephesians has told us. Fear. Worry. Anxiety. They negate your faith. And attract defeat. Nobody has solved any problem with worry there are accurate prayers there are inaccurate prayers there are prayers that go up and bring down nothing and this is where we need to start praying serious prayers and construct our prayers according to the enemies we face we have enough it's enough prayers to pray today yeah. I want to give enough time for those prayers and I see somebody here those your expectations that are always cut off as you pray today your story shall change in the name of Jesus I see someone here you have a circular problem as one problem is going another one is coming one problem is going another one is coming as you pray tonight the spirit behind it shall be terminated in the name of Jesus as several sisters here doctors have made evil pronouncement against your womb pray the enough in, it's enough prayers tonight and cancel the clinical prophecy 
There are people here tonight too. The strange deaths in the family. Pray those enough is enough prayer. There are parents here tonight. Or connected to me. Whose greatest prayer request is that their children should marry godly spouses. Because currently they are with the wrong ones. The one wrong fiance, wrong girlfriends, wrong boyfriends. If they pray tonight, there will be a change totally. Many stony virtues have come back. Rise to your feet now. And all eyes closed. We continue this message next week. All eyes closed. In case you are here, and you are not born again. You have not just surrendered your life to Jesus. Do so very quickly now. By saying what I am going to say after me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I come before you now. Lord Jesus, come into my life. In Jesus' name. Amen. Who said I shall pray with me? Just wait behind and see us briefly after the service. Or take our data on the screen. Thank you, Jesus. Bring out your anointing oil for this meeting now. And, and stand on your feet. Father, let a new fire flow into this oil now. As many as will anoint themselves here tonight, help them to wage a good warfare that will move them to the next level. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Put the oil on your hand and use it to anoint your forehead. Then put it on your hand again and use it to anoint your legs. A leg is your instrument of dominion. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The Bible says, Touch not my anointed and do my prophets no harm. Part of the reason you are bringing this oil is to anoint yourself so that if anybody launches a counter attack, it will not affect you. This first prayer will bring so many testimonies. Whether you understand it, you don't understand it, just pray. Pray it. Pray it very well. Powers contending against my new day. Can you say that loud and clear? Jesus. Yes. Then we pray. Say, so, Oh God, our Lord, wherever my enemies shall run to tonight, find them and bring them down. Oh God, our Lord, wherever my enemies shall run to tonight, find them and bring them down. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and praise. Open.
open their mouth, open their mouth, open their mouth. In Jesus' name we pray. This next three prayers. You lose your voice is worth it. As far as you get the results. Powers assigned to make we rotate on one spot. Sisters, can I hear you shouting it? I want the sisters to be more angry in their spirit. Brothers, let me hear you roaring like thunder. Everybody together shouting it. Die by fire. In the name of Jesus. I refuse to rotate on one spot. Jesus. name we pray this number two of that enough is enough prayers <laughs> Batus. making my case difficult can you shout it loud scatter in the name of Jesus It is not a day to negotiate. Battles making my case difficult. Scatter, 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 scatter. Then we pray. As many people as love their families. Please pray this prayer. Yokes. Shout it loud. Shout it louder. That multiply problems in my family. Can you shout it again? Break! In the name of Jesus. Break the yoke, break the yoke. Something is happening something is happening over there in Jesus name we pray pray this without any apology any curse upon my father's head any curse upon my mother's head that is transferred to me. Can I hear you say that? Let your voice be louder than that. Yes. Let your voice be louder than that. Somebody is breaking through with his prayers. This is not a day to negotiate.
Open your mouth. Open your mouth. It's happening. It's happening. Open that mouth. Don't negotiate. Be released. 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 Jesus, then we pray. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now you are going to raise up your voices in these strange but effective prayers. Say, every cobra and viper in my foundation run out and die in the name of Jesus somebody needs to raise his voice in that prayer the cobra and the viper in my foundation run out and die run out and die run out and die name we pray silence silence some first bonds are here who are not finding their feet in life right there where you are the power of God is coming upon you and that yoke of stagnancy is broken Jesus. Yes. Say spiritual robbers. What you have stolen from me and my family. Return them by fire. In the name of Jesus. Command them to return what they have stolen. What you have stolen from me and my family? Return them by fire. Return them by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. For every dark garment assigned to threaten my future, catch fire. In the name of Jesus. Aha, aha. It's happening, it's happening. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Jesus name we pray Surgeons of heaven My life is available This is me now In the name of Jesus Call on the surgeons 
of heaven. Visit me now. Visit me now. Visit me now. Visit me now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. If you are in this meeting, you have been hearing strange voices. You have been finding it difficult to sleep. Find a way to this altar and be on your knees as you pray this demon destroying prayers. Voices. Shout it loud. Commanding me to carry the evil load of my father's house. Voices. Commanding me to carry the evil load of my father's house. Shut up. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to lose your time by the Holy Ghost as you pray this prayer. Let nobody's voice be louder than yours now. Pass! Postponing the day of my miracles. In the name of Jesus. Powers postponing the days of my miracles. Die in the name of Jesus. Ma pota le kaya bo shendera bo kosopia. The rima kapo le katende. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. This is not a day to negotiate. Powers postponing the days of my miracles. Da. Jesus name we pray. Two more prayers. Two more prayers. Pray this with all the strength that you have. Every curse pushing me backwards. Anytime I want to move forward. Can you say it with only anger? There is a sister who needs to shout this prayer loud. Break! In the name of Jesus. Break it! Break it! Put your mouth up, put your mouth. And I know you. In Jesus' name we pray. Power answer. Assigned to push me out of my promised land. You are a lord. Oh, put your mouth and pray. It. I refuse to be pushed out of my promised land. Jesus name we pray. A servant for the man. 
Heavenly Father, to Jesus, by the name we pray. The Lord bless you some Zion. Make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. You shall go from strength to strength and from glory to glory. Any disaster left in this year is man or you and your family in the name of Jesus. All the prayer requests, our Lord, answer them by fire. By the time we gather again next Wednesday, let each and everybody be bigger bottle of testimonies. In Jesus mighty name we pray. And let us share the grace in fellowship. Surely, goodness and mercy upon them. All the days of you shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Seven Goliath destroy and hallelujah. Let's go. Hallelujah. 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 To my miracle. Father, we thank you for a time like this before you. And we thank you for your grace and your mighty power. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Tonight, lay your hands upon us. Help us to work a good warfare. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Somebody who likes to cause harm to others whether you provoke them you don't provoke them they cause harm to people the activities of the wicked no wonder the psalmist prayed that wicked prayer so let the wickedness of the wicked expire. Can you shout that loud and clear? Let the wickedness of the wicked against my life expire. Can you shout with three hot times? Shout it again loud and clear. Shout it again loud and clear. In the name of Jesus. The days of ice cream prayers are gone. I want you to do that family taking the to talk what you love. It's gone. What you love. You now need to pray the kind of prayers that would target and bring down and destroy the power of the enemy many wicked things going on in our world a fellow woman be will take acid, acid. pour it on another person what kind of wickedness is this the last time I saw somebody that they poured acid on in one hospital in America, I could not sleep because I'd seen the lady before in one of my crusades 
in the university campus in Nigeria. She won the Miss University Campus of the Year. So, so when I came for the crusade, the crusade organizers brought her to greet me. So this is uh, the campus. Miss Campus for the year. Only year fee and to rewa do you know fast year for two years. Beautiful lady. Open it to rewa. So I now stood up. Oba sofun. Have you surrendered your life to Jesus Christ? So I don't need uh, Jesus. <laughs> My beauty can get me anything I want. Oh, come to my fellow ye e wa mi yi o le fun mi. A jealous boyfriend went poured acid on her on her face when I saw her in that American hospital she looked like a monster the wickedness of the wicked I have seen a lady who had a dream Somebody she was quarreling with in the office came in the dream and started to bite her breast. Second day, breast began to swell up. In one week, they are calling it cancer. Three weeks, he was dead. Wickedness of the wicked. Can somebody who is sufficiently angry raises her voice with thanks? and say of the weekend my life is not your candidate but in the name of Jesus is breaking through in this place in jesus name we pray wickedness of the wicked many years ago a man came out with PhD in accounting if, if, if you look at him he looked normal he was always dressed in three piece suit but occasionally every three to five minutes he will snap his own head and bring out a cockroach so if he was coming to greet you and he was in the waiting room and then he will have waited for a few minutes to see dead cockroaches around him I have seen a man that came to see me who said we should pray that his land that they have stolen from him should be returned but by the time prayer started a demon spoke from the mouth of the man the demon said he has donated all his five daughters to make money and these five daughters are str were struggling hard to exist struggling hard to marry struggling hard to do things what, what kind of wickedness is this some go to collect the diary of their daughters in the spirit realm so they can't marry some go to where people work take the sand from under their feet some use wicked pandas to lock people up I'm praying one more time that the agenda of the wicked for your destiny shall perish tonight in the name of Jesus someone invited ministers for family deliverance and they went to the company the village they started 
a small crusade inside the company. There is power. 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 They were singing about the blood of Jesus. They began to sing warfare songs. All of a sudden, one of the idols that they came to pray against in the company fell down. And the demon inside the idol went to the smallest child there. And the child began to wriggle and to twist and to gasp for breath. The blood of Jesus chased out the demon. But the demon did not want to just go away like that because of the wickedness of that demon John on that small boy thank God the people there were not legible they commanded the demon to go back to the idol from where it came before burning that idol many are crying day and night why is my life like this when will things be okay am i the only person in this world why is it that nothing is working some will say who are five offended who are five offended why are these powers refusing to let me go harassing your life with this kind of question is a pointless exercise because their definition is wicked so if somebody is wicked you do not have to provoke the person before he begins to fight you like i used to tell you if i slap you and you slap me back you are not wicked you just retaliated I slap you slap you but wickedness is when no offense nothing, nothing wrong this is just in their nature to attack and to be wicked is their nature to do that and like i was telling you on sunday there is no gentle method of controlling anything evil all the methods available for controlling something evil and wicked must also be wicked and evil you face them with what the weapons they brought somebody cannot be confronting you with a large cutlass and, and you want to fight the person with your shoe you get a greater weapon with the wicked that's why the bible has very harsh words harsh words against the wicked ecclesiastes chapter 8 verse 13 ecclesiastes 8 13 young man young woman ladies and gentlemen if you will fire back at the wicked tonight and you dismantle them from their stronghold you'll be amazed at what breakthrough you will have but if you decide to be a gentleman gentlewoman 
and the enemy remains in place. It will not be the fault of me telling you what to do. I did not write these words we are going to read now. It's in the Bible. Ecclesiastes 813. But it shall not be well with the wicked. <laughs> was it me that wrote it? No. Zeph. But it shall not be well. So for the Bible to be issuing curses, it gives a particular group shows you that the only thing that can bring them to order is violence and the only thing the enemy respects is power violence said it shall not be well with the wicked neither shall he prolong his days which are as a shadow because he feared not before God I therefore decree any wicked assigned against you assigned against this country assigned against any family he shall not be well with them in the name of Jesus let your evil rule I turn back Shout the amen without apology. I, I didn't write that. I'm reading the Bible. Job 18. Job 18. Verse 5. Job chapter 18. Verse 5. Job 18. Verse 5. 18.5 yeah. The light of the wicked shall be put out and the spark of his fire shall not shine I decree at the light of every wicked agent assigned against you shall not shine in the name of Jesus everyone shall put out their candle in the name of Jesus and you say oh God turn the way of my enemies upside down in the name of Jesus I pray this prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Can you shout this loud and clear? By fire. By force by thunder can I hear you shouting those three things your voice is not loud enough I withdraw the peace of my enemies in the name of Jesus withdraw their peace Jesus, then we pray. If, for example, you feel that the press ask you to pray, it's too aggressive. Just pray it on my behalf. Intercede for me. 
Pray for those of us who need the prayer. All eyes closed. The first prayer I want you to pray is powers. Shout it with anger. Assigned to turn the source of my joy to sorrow. Are you going to be kind to that kind of power? No. Can you shout it again? Oh God! Oh God. Waste them! In the name of Jesus! Setende Kenya Boshende Rabasanda. Aha! Open your mouth and decree it. Bokate! Riboko Setende Kenya Boshende Rabasanda. In Jesus' name we pray. Powers! Sucking the milk of my virtues. Sisters, can I hear you saying it? I said, sister, we should be very angry and pray this way. Vomit my virtue and die in the name of Jesus. Somebody is breaking through, is breaking through, is breaking, breaking through. Name we pray. This power will release many people from hidden bondages. You may not understand the prayer point, but please pray. Eggs of serpents in my body. Can you shout it loud? You are not angry enough. In the name of Jesus. Jesus is here. Receive the touch of the power. Receive the touch of the fire. Receive the touch of the power. Receive the touch of the fire. In Jesus' name we pray. A seven fold name we pray rise to your feet beloved the next few minutes 
I want you to lose your temper in the Holy Ghost as you fire this prayer. Altars of darkness established to make me cry. Can you shout it loud and clear? Somebody ought to shout it louder than this. Waste your honor in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Name we pray. Powers are sent to suck me dry. You are alone. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. That's why Jesus brought you here. You are here for an encounter. Then we pray. Say wickedness of the wicked is in my life. Expire in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decrease now. That's why the Lord brought you here. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Silence. You the wicked arrow of infirmity. Fired into the chest. Fired into the breast. Fired into the womb. Fired into the backbone. Your time is up. You the wish comes sponsored the infirmity inside the body of anyone here. Your time is up. Your loads and your luggage. In the head, in the eyes, in the chest, in the womb. Carry your load in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing now. Receive it, 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 in the name of Jesus. Yes, check check your body now. Some infirmity you brought out just disappeared. Check your body, check it. Do what you could not do before you got here. Stretch that leg. Yes, check that chest. Makatendari Bokalila Shanda. Da Kasete Nikayabo Shente. Every witchcraft sponsored infirmity. Infirmity from the dream. Infirmity from the arrows of the wicked. Infirmity from envious witchcraft. Depart now in the name of Jesus. Depart in the name of Jesus. Check your body. Check it very well. If you discover that you have been healed, run quickly to this altar. Don't let the devil put it back. Run quickly to this altar. Stretch your right hand towards me now. At the altar here. Something strange is happening to one sister over there. Yes, check it. It is gone. 
structure right hand here father let your anointing fall upon this hand let every yoke of the enemy be broken let this hand become the hands of fire and power let it become a yoke breaking power in the name of jesus 21 times smite anywhere that is not feeling well in your body Smite seriously and shall go back to your center let's go do it well Do it well. Something is happening over there. Do it well. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Check your body again. Check it very well. Do what you could not do before. And find a way to the altar. A mysterious miracle is taking place in that system over there. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Ben. Say powers that have sworn that I will not rest can you shout it loud your voice is not loud enough before I leave this place in the name of Jesus Mountain decree. name we pray now shout this with the loudest voice you can gather we can dance in my dreams there! in the name of Jesus open your mouth and decree Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. A loud amen. Yeah. Let us share the grace in fellowship. Sure. Seven Goliath is trying to hallelujah. Let's go. Castle Africa TV.